Right. Oh. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Tetra Cop 7. Yeah, lucky number 7. For me, it's lucky number 8. Looks lucky like number 8 for you? Sign. Yep. Is, is that an Australian thing? <laughs> no, that's me thing. Okay. You just you happen to be Australian. Yeah. That's my, uh... Okay. I was gonna try and make a joke, but I can't think of anything. <laughs> sucks. It sucks being not funny. It happens. The trick is I just keep talking until I think of something funny. You know, if you keep, just keep just keep throwing shit out there. You know, eventually something will stick. Exactly. That's my philosophy in life. It's good. It's good. I agree. We're just getting the first match. Ready right now. Are we allowed to like spoil who, who it's gonna be or like do we have to wait? A surprise. Yeah, I'm not sure. The, the player jump scare. <laughs> oh, here it is. Oh no. Oh! Watching this. Oh. oh, let's go. UL versus Quick and Smart. The Battle of the Qs. Oh, they're pitting the two Qs against each other. Mm. That was fun fact here. This is the third time I've been streamed against a player whose name starts with Q. And Maybe uh, one Quick day. Smart. Sorry, continue. No, I was going to say Quick and Smart fact. 80k oh. PCs in the past year, but doesn't know any setups. Yeah, Quick and Smart's very, very good with PCs. Uh, I think he's, I think he's beating my, my PC mode. A PB, but that's not saying much. It's pretty low these days. To be honest, I'm a, I'm a big fan of the freestyle PC players, just because yeah. I can't be bothered learning setups. Mm -hmm. And I hear the Tetrio music. Is it? Yep. Oh, okay, okay, warm up. But uh, yeah, it uh, you see here, well has higher win rate, TR, and friend count. That's friend count is of course the number one indicator of both social status and Tetrio skill. Yes, that's why Vince is so good. Mm. Sometimes though, like, see people with less friends do better because they only play Tetris, they don't talk to people. It's the case with me. That's why I don't have any friends so I can get good at Tetris. Yeah, that, that's my excuse, I mean reason. <laughs> yeah, there's no other reason I don't talk to people. Got a uh, weird tasty tower there. Mm. Cleaned up pretty well. And she's over on quick and smart side. And both so players are kind of slowing down as the game goes on. Mm -hmm. It's like they're both like in a neutralish position. Quick and smart a little pushed up, but doesn't really have any issues getting back down to the bottom of this field. Oh my god. Ooh, it... <laughs> Is this... I think that was a King Crimson. Yeah, that was King Crimson, right? <laughs> it looked like it. It was like... It looks we like a weird version of it though. I'm not sure. Oh. Ooh. Bad mission from QL. I think that might be it. No? Yeah. Ooh, that yes. closes the round out. Yeah, that was a long warm-up round. And now we're gonna get into the real thing. GLHFs are being exchanged. It's like both players have some good manners. Love to see it. Never be me. <laughs> I never say good luck or fun. 
I want the good luck. Yeah. If and your opponent's have... having fun, you're not doing it right. <laughs> say, say just have fun, it looks toxic, so I don't say it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Understandable. Oh, very bad misdrop on quick and smart side and gives QL the first round. Yep, very quick round compared to that warm up. Mm -hmm. See more of this SDPC on QL side. Looks like he knows the PC to it too, and DPC. Quick and smart surviving for now though. Mm -hmm. I think that uh, the, P the DPC misdrop really gave him the chance there. The QL landed, I think that would have been it for quick and smart. Alright, another SDPC bag. But well, we don't see it this time. Is that is this submarine? Oh, Ooh, TST tower. TST there. tower. Love to see it. some very bad miss, a very bad team is on his side. He gets pretty good garbage, though. I'm gonna buy him a bit of time. He's got to clean well now, sort of. Very easy to get down and send a lot of garbage on the way, and that's exactly what they did. Oh, look at the top of his board, it seems. Has some very clean garbage coming up, though. It's to it pretty quickly. Good cancel Ooh. from QL. A yeah, very but smart timing just... there. It just doesn't matter, though. Yep, yeah, just not enough time. Alright, another SDPC from QL. Have we seen a single TKI? <laughs> Not yet. I think Smart opened up with a uh, jigsaw there, I believe. Locasing his PC skill. Excellent multiplier, gonna get him out of a very sticky spot there. Quick Smart high up on the board right now, but mm -hmm. it is salvageable. But he just sent QL a lot of clean. Yeah. So it was a bit there to find the proper down stack. That's that little bit of extra time he gave QL by slowing down was all that QL needed to take the round. Fortunately, there was a bit of a teaspoon nothing there. Oh, there was a two line PC. Ooh. Doesn't kill but I actually got has the... a bunch of clean. Insane. Like oh my god. A PC of his own, oh my god. <laughs> That's disgusting. Jesus. And more PCO from Quick and Smart. It's a very Kill nice... Kill going for a stack. Mm -hmm. Find some good pace pins. Pressure is too much for Quick and Smart. His PCs don't seem to be doing Quick and Smart any good. Yeah, he's not killing fast enough, and then QL just has a massive counter spike ready. Yeah, they just can't get the second one off ever. Mm -hmm. It just might not be worth going for. Yeah, very Six unfortunate miss drop there. Sealed his fate. Match point for QL. Oh, okay. Real good. Bit of, bit of chatting going on. We do a little chatting. Hey, kill kill there. trying to... Oh, sorry. There we go. I was just going to say, it looked like he tried to tank there. Shoot for a bit of a counter spike, maybe. Now QL's got a clean stack here, and he's just sending, and mm. they take the game. GG's. GG's to both players. That was a good first game. It's us. Hello. Uh, <laughs> I feel like, um... Yeah, quick and smart. 
Those PCs weren't doing them any favors. Yeah. Just sending way too much clean. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times it looked like he slowed down to look for the optimal second PC. But in versus you, you just want to blitz through. You don't want to be taking yeah. time, especially after sending a bunch of clean. But still played very well nonetheless. Had some good uh, top of the board survivals there. But Kilo's pressure was just way too much. Yeah, there was just a lot of pressure from QL. Like as soon as the PC went through, they used it like all that garbage instantly. Mm -hmm. Hello, Flaming Shuriken. Quantum Hornet and Dorami? Ooh. Was that who we got next? Uh, I don't believe so, no. Just in chat, someone said it. Oh, people are spoiling it in chat, SMH. Just you know what the, the bracket's looking like? I actually haven't pulled the bracket up quite yet. Ooh, Garden Snow versus Combo Storm. I haven't, I haven't heard from Combo Storm in a while. I didn't know he still played. Yeah, I missed the Combo Storm streams. Yeah. I all think right. my man's got a job. I was just like, all right, cool. Yeah. <laughs> and then Which number I respect. one, number one kind of the all Tetris players is time. You grow up and have to get real jobs. <laughs> That's meant to be me, but I can't find one. Oh yeah, I have to. I have to start looking for a job soon. I graduate high school this year, which is scary. Yeah, I have graduated university. <laughs> oh. Jesus, I thought I thought you were like sixteen. Nah, dude, I'm twenty-one. My God, I'm sorry. I, <laughs> I know my it's voice okay. doesn't sound like it. Oh, I'm a boomer. Yeah. I am. I'll handle it. It's okay. I'm turning. I'm turning 18. But I can't make old jokes anymore because I'll legally be old in September. Coming the boomer of the Tetris community. Yeah. These like 13 year olds are gonna start calling me old soon. I'm not sure if that's a, a world I want to live in. What you have to live in. It happens to the best of us. We're all gonna die. <laughs> yeah. Make, yeah, make the most of your life. <laughs> I'm with your PSA. Go, go good luck, have fun in chat. Looks like hey. warm up is about to start. There's a being respectful. I'm waiting for one person to not say GLHF and I'm gonna call them out. You just exposed your plan. <laughs> oh man, I, I doubt... People are in the tournament, right? They're not listening to me. They're playing. Yes. Right. Very... Arneson <laughs> is very fast. It's like 4 PPS. Yeah, this is a very, very speedy gameplay Ooh. right here. Oh, a lot of misdrops Ooh. though. The only problem with playing this fast is just like the misdrops just happen all like it's like a combo. Yeah. And like you got your self cheese and you got the cheese from the opponent. A very cheesy round here. Interesting uh, fix from Gonzo. Did it pretty quickly considering they have instant soft drop. This is looking like some culture skin play with all these ass combos. And that's the warm up. Jesus. <laughs> we do, okay, that's... I forgot about their fun facts. I just know this fun fact is cool, not snail. And combo storms is. My fun fact is that 
My hands nearly froze off yesterday. That's not good. But uh, here Combo's home is kicking ass in Tetris. Mm. It's like Tetrio, you managed sorry. to get those hands warmed up. Yeah, if you look at the triangles, both of them heavily, heavily pointing towards the Gun PPS side. Garden sell please to not cheese. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Let's uh, see if that happens. Ooh, Tetris PC to start things off. Into a bunch of misdrops. I like this is just classic Garden Cell gameplay. Yeah, I, I didn't know much about him going in, or much about his playstyle going in. I had no idea he was this fast. Uh, I commentated oh. for Garden Cell during. Jesus. During uh, the yeah. Mini Mino. So, <laughs> I got a taste of it. Yeah, I, I commentated that too. That that was very unique uh, gameplay though. Yeah, it, very interesting first of, experience. You guys had like a very interesting setup there. Like a weird T-skin into the STSD. It didn't pay off. And Combo Storm was getting some skins off, but it wasn't enough to, to stay low enough. Very quick round. I have a feeling a lot of these matches are either going to like end right away they're going to be like a long, grueling battle of cheese. Kind of the nature of the game. Yeah. Bit of an awkward back there from Garden Snow. Cleans it up quickly though. Yeah, Garden Snow cleans everything up so quickly, it's crazy. Yeah. Very smart. Oh, at about I, three I PPS. Oh. You're good, you're good. Probably Swarm's at about three PPS, while Gunsell's at like 3.7 consistently right now. Yeah. This is insane. I... I've never seen anyone play this consistently fast. Like, you can burst this fast. Like, people will burst this fast all the time, but to play this fast consistently, it's not seen very often. Ooh, very smart DT so, there from Garden Snail. I like these DT that Garden Snail finds. Uh, to a lot of misdrops though. Let's himself get pushed up a bit. Ooh, and that eye misdrop I think is going to seal the deal, yup. Oh, Garden Snail saying wait in chat. <laughs> he forgot a close stream. Epic. <laughs> Combo Swarm being respectful? Okay, here we go. Game start. That's so what I'm saying. Okay, yeah. I'll wait. <laughs> we love to see the good sportsmanship. Mm -hmm. oh. I'm just done with a very messy stack. That's a nice Ooh, multiplier a... out of it. Yeah, that was a really nice multiplier out. And now stack's clean. Mm -hmm. This is regularly, regularly scheduled pressure. Combo Storm got some funky stuff going on. Mm -hmm. Okay. Finds a pretty good fix out. Is this. Master just swinging back and forth. At, who's that? Oh! That is a massive wow. spike from Gun Cell. I didn't, I didn't see what happened, but I, I was looking at Combo Storm's board and I just seen the red line. From the very bottom to above the top, like half a second. It was a fractal moment. I see. It looked like Garnus had a bit of Ren set up there and stacked up and converted into T spins, though. Oh, fatal misdrop from Gun Cell. Yeah. I'm not sure if the speed Garden Snow is playing at is doing him too well right now. It seems like it's just hurting him more than helping him. 
Definitely don't think it would hurt to slow down a bit and think things through. Yeah. Not even thinking things through. Just misdropping less. Mm. Ooh. Very nice sequence there. Gets a quick three back to back chain. Oh, Mist drops the old piece right over his well, and that is going to give Combo Storm the round. Yeah, the Combo Storm just had a massive um, multiply going on. Ooh. A little STSD continuation there from the Gardens now. Yep, they've used it a couple times now. Oh, just a. Uh... Just slugging each other in this match right now. Yeah, a lot forth. of back and forth. Guardian Snail's maintaining four PPS throughout it all. Very impressive. Yeah, that's really crazy. Ooh. Combo Storm used the IPs that was really needed. Ooh, very awkward stack there, and it's gonna net Guardian Snail the win. I'm gonna start opening really fast this round. Was that like 4.3? It looks like he's speeding up a bit too. He's at like 3.5 ish now, hovering around there. Hands are now warmed up. I fixed the, uh, the cooling issue from yesterday. Yep. The fun fact. That didn't sound very fun though. Yeah. Okay, Garnet's not pausing a bit, looking for the way to get a T-spin there. It, it, it kind of feels like, um, Gun Cell slows down at the worst moments when, like, Combo Swarms, like, makes a really bad miss drop. Yeah. A lot of cheese on Garden Snail's side. Oh man, Gun Cell is Five four to combo storm. It's a close round. Yeah. Okay, combo storm doing a bit of Tetris acting transitions to. This middle wall gonna build up a back to back chain and the Garden Snow's missed drop is gonna net him the win. Yeah, unfortunate mistake from Garden Cell there. It just seems like every one of these losses from Garden Snow is a missed drop. Oh my god. It's a huge think, spike there. I think once Garden Cell, um, it's more consistent, that'll be really scary. Yeah. Or he's super scary now, even with the mist drops. Yeah. Oh. oh the interesting very picks smart. from Guns now. Mm -hmm. That's not enough though. And I'm the is gonna take the set. Yep, GG's to Combo Storm. Yeah, GG's to both players. Very, very Those fast. Are... Yeah, really fast. Yeah. Really just fun game. Alright. OMG, it's us. You get to see our lovely faces again while we play the next match. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was, that was really intense. I. I went into that not knowing Garden Snow was that fast. So I, I like got, got like a whiplash. Yeah, especially like that one round where they just like kept like slugging back and forth, man. I uh, and it was, they're it was both just like up four and down. PPS. Yeah, it was crazy. Same, man. Good stuff. Got our next secret players in the lobby right now. Oh. Ooh. Okay, yeah, this is going to be a good one. Yeah, it will be. It's going to be well, I'm a really big fan one. of both of these players.
Are we allowed to bet on who's gonna win? That's something we can do. <laughs> like, like real money or no? <laughs> uh, I'll wait. I'll wait till we see. Till we see the two players there. I don't want to spoil the jump scare. Oh, Caboose would really win in this one right now. At the moment. 91% to 9%. Give Promo some love. I'll give Promo some love. Yeah, both these players go very close. If you ever watch Caboozled stream, Promo is like the main villain in the stream. <laughs> Like a rivalry or something going on. It seems they always go pretty close. Moose, Moose says he put everything on promo. That's crazy. Very similar Moose. triangles and very close seeds. Shoutouts to Square One. Yeah, shout out Square One. I got the I got the shirt on and the Square One chain. Let's go. Not the Square One, but the Puzzle Kingdom. There's a huge friend difference. Faster friend difference even. It was just way more popular. Oh man, 149 friends, nothing to scoff at. Not yeah, quantity or quality over quantity. <laughs> You're right as hell. That's fun fact. He's played more TEC than Tetra for the last week. I'm I'm like I'm pretty hyped for Square One. We got the warm-ups going though. We're dropping into warm-up round right now, and for those who don't know what seed means, seed just means, um. It's how the kind of how the players are ranked in the tournament. Mm. Uh, seed one would be the person expected to win the whole thing. Yep. Very quick warm up. Four PPS from Cab there. Jesus. That's what we expect from Cab. The screen was small because that was only a warm-up round. We're really getting into the real game right now. Alright, the real thing. Adulterated. Oh, okay. So I'm careful from cab. Does that, uh, yeah. that, that specific variant a lot, and sometimes it can lead into a PC. Yeah, I was gonna say the same thing. Cab does that variant so often now. Mm. It's like almost pushed a bit up. There's a bunch of clean though, I have no doubt. Get out of this. Ooh, and with that S piece missed drop on Cab's side, they get problem with the first round. Yep. Explosive start. Ooh. Oh, I missed drop his, uh, his PC. Turned it into a. What's it called? It's got the name. Go cross. That's the one. Yeah, he uses that a lot, even in um, Blitz runs. It's like a, it's a follow up to PC that has its own PC chance. Cool. I like Imperial Crosses. Yeah, they're they cool. just look cool. Especially if you can pull them off, like, in a practical way. I tanked a, a bit of cheese from Promo there, but got through it pretty quickly. Now it has this massive well to work with. Promo had that huge well, but wasn't able to do much with it, other than send, like, a couple bullets. A lot of misdrops on promo size, it finds a very 
smart combo out. Because both players are just in a bit of a neutral state right now. That was tragic from Promo. He's been nothing. Yeah, Floating, he's been it. nothing. Ooh. Ooh, I was about to say. Back -back going. I was about to say both players started playing pretty clean, but then Promo misdropped it as I opened my mouth. Yeah, commentators curse. Preemptive commentators curse. Pretty impressive stuff. Ooh. Okay, lightning fast double PC. Oh, and that's gonna give Cab the round. Yeah, that was. 4.63 PPS, that's all at the end. Jesus. Usually Promo survives pretty well against Cab's uh, PC spam at the start, but it looks like he just had a bit of a suboptimal stack. Ooh, Cab with so much pressure right now. Yeah, but very messy stack. Very. Jesus, very weird misdrop in. Promo sends off a massive spike. It's like the kind of misdrop where no matter how many times you do it, like you're not gonna find an optimal way down. <laughs> yeah. Gestures map type stuff. Ooh, another double PC by Cab. Almost survived at that time, but didn't survive what followed. Very close rounds. Very close set. Cap had the, the RNG PC there, but I didn't react in time, dropped the eyepiece too fast, and that kills. I remember it was at 3.9 PPS that round, playing really fast. Some very clean starts from the player, Cap missed drop style. That's a good combo out. Now Promo has a lot of cheese. Oh. A brutal miscalculation on Promo's end. Puts the eyepiece right over the garbage well. Even if he found a way down, he just had to waste so much time to get to it. Lucky for Caboozled as well, because Caboozled actually missed up as well. I'm doing that uh, MKO follow up we were talking about earlier. A very clean stack. Back to back that the entire sweet, round. sweet 250 APM. I would find the uh, TK PC there. Very nice. Didn't it? App was not even phased by the misdrop. Yeah. Just kept playing I was he was forced to uh, break back to back there, but he just didn't break back to back. Fed back to back his way down. Very impressive stuff. Ooh, unfortunate. Probably had a fractal set up, but was only able to get a single off, which just completely ruined it. Mm -hmm. Didn't have the piece he needed to throw on the right side. I'm doing the follow-up again, this drops it off. In a super bad way. <laughs> Still does smaller than fine. <laughs> Jesus, and yeah, that's... Game set and yeah. match. Yep, that was a good game, that was really exciting. Yeah, super high octane, a lot of clean back and forth. Alright, that was a really good game to watch, to be honest. Yeah. Tons and tons of clean, just getting traded back and forth. A lot of full board spikes. Very high octane stuff. Always the most interesting to watch. Well, maybe not most interesting, most fun to watch. When you just keep seeing the big spikes between the two players. Yeah, you see the big number and all the cool particles. Oh yeah, Tetrio. Hmm. I love... I love flashy colors. Alright.
Now we're just getting our next game set up, and it looks like it's gonna be another banger. To be honest. It's good stuff. Good stuff here. I am personally extremely hyped for this one. Mm. I will admit I'm a uh, I am biased going into this. I'm not gonna try to hide that. It's okay, I'll be the unbiased one. Yeah, you have to counteract my back. I'm not gonna gonna shit talk any players, but no. Now anyway. you know what? I'll be I'll be extremely biased in the other players' favor to yeah. cancel it out. Yeah, yeah. don't be fair. Must be done. I quantum wanted with an interesting fact. <laughs> what is his? Oh wait, I just spoiled it. <laughs> he did spoil it, but. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> quantum Hornet. They actually voted the uh, number one most attractive Tetris player for in the 2021 Stackies. That's crazy. Don't fact check me on that, but it, it did happen. No, 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 I'll say, I'm sure it did. Frost. Mm -hmm. No, Kabul's a pilot through him, that's so sad. I miss him already. Well, mm -hmm. moving on to better things. God, I'm blundering on my laptop right now. I'm trying to like... Okay, there we go. Everything like went completely south for a second. We're good now, we're good. All good. I never make the same mistake twice. Alrighty. No, I don't really know what. You said who Quantum Horn's playing yet? Yep, just a little bit more of what. Oh. Can't wait to see the triangles. I love the triangles so much. My yeah. favorite shape. Next to it's squares. much more interesting. Much more interesting than looking at just raw stats. No, numbers, they're, they're numbers, but shapes are shapes. That's really something you need to consider before you go to college. <laughs> just graphs in general, it's just much more... Squares. Squares, triangles, circles. There's all kinds so, of shapes and touches. <laughs> Start using pie graphs. Hmm. Oh, dormy jump scare. Uh, thank you, Base Engine, for the raid. Appreciate With it. Twenty-two people. Ah, right, but yeah. Base Engine, the tourney. Huh? Yes, yes, Base and Shen was in the Tony. Was. I didn't mean to right. rub salt in the wound, Beast and Shen. So, a huge uh... friend difference. Oh my god. <laughs> Dormy is just popular. Yeah, the, the, oh. the friend bar is going into the triangle. Uh, these yeah. players' facts are. <laughs> Indonesia is the country with the most Muslims. Interesting fact from Quantum Hornet. Quantum Hornet, as I said before, spoiling it. <laughs> and uh, Doremi says, warm me up from re retirement, ham. Home. Home. I think Doremi's <laughs> even older than you, which is crazy to think about. <laughs> even older than me? 21? Yeah. Oh, that's crazy. That's insane. Very similarly shaped triangles, just Quantum Hornet. Triangle doesn't extend as far. No, he, he has a smaller size than Dormy.
All right, warm up is over, and we'll be getting into the games right now. Wait, isn't Dormy twenty two? Oh my god! The GLHF. Someone just notified me that Dormy is twenty two, that he was like thirty. <laughs> this to be honest, I thought up. I thought Dormy was a bit older as well, but not like thirty. In my mind, you're either like 12, 16, 20, or 30. And after that, it's just nothing else. I'm forever 21 now. But, uh, bring into the game. Player's in a neutral position here. It's like. At some point, it seems to be. Having a much more slow and methodical approach. Yeah, you can definitely see it in their stats. That uh, mm. they play a bit slower, but still have strong APM. Yeah, we had a bit of an awkward miss drop, but find, found a very nice combo out. Very smart multiplier. On the brink of death, he was able to escape. Yep, Dormy gave up on the T-spin. And now Huge we got some Ren Gaming from Quantum. Quantum. Use up Dormy quite a bit, but Dormy got through all the cheese with relative ease. Bit of spy from Quantum. Dormy's board not looking too clean right now, but finds it well. The Quantum also seemed to uh, speed up. Oh! Ooh, Jesus. Uh, very bad L miss drop there. Quantum had multiplier down, but it. dropped the L. You hate to see it. Now this is looking like a bit of a slugfest right now. Ooh, very awkward stack right now from Quantum. Dorm is gonna take the round. Oh, Dorm is whipping out BT. Haven't seen this that in a while. Can't follow through with it though. Yeah, I was gonna say, it looked like BT, but then. He didn't th follow through. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> it, it's a super committal thing to do. Actually, yeah, something it is. like Tetrio. Oh, very nice uh, pressure there from Quantum Hornet. Gonna send Dormy right to the top. And now, moving on to the next round. Both players still have the same PC. Quantum Hornet just like gets another one out so fast. Ooh, and another one. I think yeah, I'm not sure if he he knew if he knows DPC, but he did uh, extra OTK DPC pattern. Very good stuff. Also, want to mention that uh, Quantum Hornet was doing PCs at four PPS. Mm. I think Quantum Hornet has like a. Uh... 10 PC in like under 25 seconds or like something crazy like that. Very good at uh, freestyle PCs. Mm. The army kind of stuck the top of the board right now. Can't yeah, find a clean way down. He's on this field. It's really clean garbage well though. Now it's Quantum has all the cheese. That's, that's the thing with cheese, it's, it always gets sent back as cheese. Mm -hmm. It's kind of a, an eternal loop. Yeah, you have to actively try to break out of the cycle. And Quantum Hornet with like, a bit of like, kind of like a two wide combo. Get out yeah. of that sticky situation. It has a very clean field, just trying to send oh. pressure to Dormy. Ooh. 
I'm just staying fixed there. It turns it into a complete TST. Definitely was a really good fix, and that's a pretty big spike, but it's just not enough. Huge spike from Quantum, but Dormy lives it. Hasn't quite worked his way through it yet to send it back. Dormy's survivability is just insane. Yeah, it seems like nothing kills him, no matter how, like, how big. Gravity's really speeding up now. And the players mm. are kind of getting close to the fault. That's him with a very clean field. All the way at the bottom. The player's kind of in a neutral state right now. Quantum Hornet just gives up on that TST decision, really. That's probably the right move. And Ooh. he finds it all clear into a two line. line. Oh no. my god. Oh my god. What a way to close out that round. Damn, that was really... <sighs> I don't even know, man. There's that PC skill I was talking about earlier coming into play. Both players opened up with uh, near PCOs. I uh, really set the tone this match of, to be like really fast paced, a lot of trading back and forth. Yeah, you can definitely see it. Ooh, looks like Quantum Hornet was going for a TSD that I set up and quickly realized it was not a good idea. <laughs> to be honest, every time. Quantum gets to the bottom of the board, it looks like they're kind of trying to fish for a PC. Yeah, I, he he was close to it last time he got to the bottom. And it, it works, right? No one really expects a mid-game PC, it can catch your opponent off guard. Yeah, really badly. Well, very smart float there to uh, clean up his field, wait a bit for the right pieces to complete the T-spin double at the bottom. On opponent really playing clean right now. Mm. But the army is just taking it all and sending it back. A incomplete TST there from Quantum. Looked like he wanted to use the full thing, but realized it was too slow. Wow. Wow. What a fix. Yeah, turning that uh, awkward stack into a uh, incomplete DT animation thing. That's like something I would not ever think of. Like, especially yeah. not that fast. Quantum is a very, very smart player. I thought Quantum was going to fish for the PC again. I was waiting for it. <laughs> Quantum just finds some out. really weird, yeah, some really weird uh, T-spins as well. Every Fun time I think like, his field is uh, unrecoverable, he like fixes it with some weird T-spin donation. Yeah. Dormy here Dormy with a bunch of clean. Yeah, I was about to say the exact same thing. Just huge queen well. Yeah. Looks like we're gonna have a bit of a back and forth here as both players utilize this queen they're being sent back and forth to each other. Oh really smart awesome. over there from Oh Wow. He's fixed his man, oh my god. This is yeah, this is the good stuff. It's drugs when you can watch Quantum Hornet fix misdrops. That was the it end of a three minute round. round. Jesus, these rounds are a lot longer than the previous previous ones. Well, we did say it was going to be exciting. Before I spoiled the player. <laughs> <laughs> Goes for a lot of teaspoon triples. I kind of like it. 
Yeah, it's interesting because not too many people go for They have like, look, he goes for one right there. Very clean one too, very clean C-spin, huge spike. Yeah, that was a really good moment from... And it gets in the round. But the triple double. Yeah, C-spin, that's the name, C-spin. <laughs> I was so bad with names. I feel like Quantum Hornet kind of misread the situation there. Mm -hmm. Very weird misdrop. Oh my god, I Yo, just got a Cop 7 for... live now. Dude, that's insane. Dude, I want to watch live. Oh man, I'm, I didn't get a join. It's kind of kind of bummed out about that. Maybe next time. Next time for sure, Jimothy will be terror. Ooh. Was Huge that some possible back -back action? Chin. It looked like it. It could also have just been that Dormi was sending that fast. True. Finds the... Um... <sighs> I'm just gonna let you yeah, say all the names, good. man. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even remember TKI now. Happens. So sad. Oh, uh, huge oh. spike from Dormi. Money Quantum lives through it. Quantum lives it, and now he just has all this clean to work with. Do whatever he wants with. Another spike from Dormi, though, is gonna add up. Quantum had a, a bit of an early lead going there, but it looks like he was able to catch up, tie things up. Very nice stuff. Both players. Tried to go for PC and just ended up stacking. And oh my god, Dormy! Oh my, Dormy had like a fractal setup, and then he also like had a huge Tetris while going massive spike. Yeah, that was just huge. Jesus. This needs to be careful here. Match point for Dormy. And it, he was like down five two, and now he's. Now it's six five. Point. Yeah. Say like Quantum's gonna keep up stacking here, keep up the back to back chain. Bit of them. Oh, a lot of misdrops. Oh, he really needs to send the. Dude, the Z spin though. Very smart. He would have died it had he not found that. Army sending hard now, and oof, that's it. For a top of the board T spin there, but he had the like awkward one extra Mino thing where it doesn't work. Killed him. Very good match though. Yep, yeah, that was a good game. GG's. Really good stuff from both players. Yeah, GG's. Dormio was just sending some like huge spikes there, man. Yeah, especially near the end. It looked like he needed to warm up a bit, then once he got into his rhythm, just spike on spike on spike. Yeah, absolutely. But Quantum Hornet really played well as well. A yeah, really good showing from him. That, that PC was really hype at the start. It really set the tone for the rest of the set. Mm. I just re I really liked Quantum Hornet's fixes. That were crazy, yeah. man, those donations. Especially that, uh, Sorry, that DT one. Yeah, I was going to say was that really DC nice. the Yeah, that was crazy. Play down too. That was good. Players come from a PPT background, so I was I was expecting some. A lot more back-to-back -back than normal, but not to that degree. Yeah. Good stuff. I would... I would mint that round as an NFT and sell it. <laughs> Possible. <laughs> Well, you can make... sell that for a lot. No, I, I, I make millions off that. I think TM, Team TSD has the rights, though, to mint these as NFTs. No, 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 you have to worry about that, not with NFTs. Oh, yeah. Of course. I got some bidding going on in the chat. Shen's gonna buy it for five bucks. Oh, the floor five price bucks. is like 10,000 Ethereum. <laughs> 10,000 Ethereum. Yeah. Uh, you're right as hell, because Ethereum, you know, it all crashed, I think, yesterday. 
So obviously yeah. it's just... I think so. I don't know anything about NFTs or crypto. I think everything went down. Bad. God bless. I to mint this is like DNFs. Hey. Ooh. Did I need to check something quickly? Yeah, never mind. I'm crazy. Yeah, I'm not. Okay, whatever. Next round. Next round's looking good though. To be a good it one. It is looking good. It's looking to be an absolute banger. Maybe the most exciting so far. Which says a lot, yeah. because there's been some really exciting ones. Mm -hmm. Alright, both players are in the room now. Well, they're both verified. Some big shots here. Some big chats. I think Kabuzan and Promo are both verified too. Dude, everyone's so famous. When am I gonna get verified on Tetrio? OSK, please. Ask, please. If you're watching this, please, I'm begging you. <laughs> I, have, I have like 10 followers on Twitter, please. In my last Tetrio stream got like 3 viewers. Is that enough to be verified? Oh, amazing fun fact from Firestorm. Love to see it. <laughs> Hell yeah. Ooh, two warm ups. Verify Jim now. <laughs> Verify me now. I'm not asking. Dom. <laughs> Appreciate it, Dom. Oh, fun fact from. Uh... Circulation as well. Ooh, that's a good fun fact. I like that fun fact. Yeah, we've kind of spoiled it. It's uh, Circulation versus Sci Fi Storm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Very good matchup. I'm not the most handsome player, Dom. That's uh, that's Quantum Hornet if you saw the last match. Yeah, it's just trying to understand that. Someone has a question for me. Ask away. I'm an open book. How is five? Yeah, only seed five. Insanity. Oh, it's a lot of good players. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Circulation asks for the toilet. So empty. Got to empty the bladder. Give me a sec. Oh, circulation says. Ready. That was quick. He did. He might. He must have done the uh, hand wash skip. Very popular speedrun strat. Popular, you say? Popular amongst my friend group. That might just be me. Who knows? And circulation got the mountain of stacking opener, which has been gaining popularity. Yeah, especially in PPT. Jesus, lightning fast warm up. And yeah, yeah, you can see it in Kazu's fun facts. I mean, I mean, circulation is fun fact. <laughs> it says, I love Kazu. And Kazu was someone that's kind of popularized it right now. Mm -hmm. Kazu makes waves. This is warm up too, right? Uh, is it? I'm not sure. I, I think it is, yeah. The warm -ups. I don't know if they're yeah. granted that, though. Yeah, this is another warm-up. Okay. Cool. Oh, I saw him with a nice C-spin. This Firestorm is so fast. Circuit with a 7 back-to-back chain. I sure it was just too much for Firestorm to handle. That's insane.
This game's gonna be very, very big, APM. I can yeah. feel it in my bones. I can feel it in my colon. So if you could feel it in his bladder. <laughs> he peed himself a bit when he saw his opponent his Firestorm. I know I would have. Firestorm, jump scare. So he opted for the. Oh, sorry. So he opted for an ice before, which I think was a good idea actually, even though he was so high up. Interesting. But he can't escape from that one. Yeah, it took too much time to look for a combo down, and I just don't think it was there. Gave Firestorm way too much time. Firestorm is a player you you don't want to give any um you don't have to to He'll take it in stride. Firestorm well, looking Jesus. late. Yeah, four point four PPS there from FS. That's just insane. I'm also good. Are they mountain stacking or a game in one of those two? Oh, someone finds a mid game uh, DT cannon into another TSD, but I wasn't able to get the third one off. Jeez. Very high octane round right now, a lot of back and forth. The circuit was kind of stuck in a 9-0 uh, for a bit, but. Made his way out. Mm. That is a very clean 6 3 to work with. One thing Circus is exceptionally good at is building up a back to back chain, as you see here. That was 12, yeah, 12 back, to back. back to back chain, Jesus. When circulation gets in that zone, there is no stopping. Yeah, Sirku said he like studies top players from all different kinds of games. And I think especially he studies causes down stacking. Like he down yeah, stacks without breaking back to back. You can see on stream sometimes he'll show himself studying games of like Kazu or Amamiya and stuff. Mm -hmm. They're high up and around, a lot of back and forth. It's honestly really scary when you think about it. Just like, studying like, extremely high efficiency, but like, way faster. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't seem like he has an issue that some players do, where like, they'll try to be efficient when you really should just speed up. Like he knows when to turn it on and off, which is very good quality to have. Circuit actually set up a good down stack there, but it's just not enough against Firestorm. Yeah, he's too slow against anyone else. That he probably would have got out with. Firestorm is the king of pressure. Very. Quick pressure there from Circu. Yeah, if Circu got, um, I think it was the J piece, if he got it one earlier, I think it would have actually been into a downside combo as well, which would have been like crazy RNG. Firestorm was like at the very top of his field there and managed to get out, but Circu's pressure is too much. Wasn't enough. Jesus. I think every single round Circus did match. And we have a bit of a full ride from a Firestorm. You love to see it, to be honest. I love yeah. to see it. Oh. Into a ball clear. Jesus. Circus would fall out of his own. <laughs> yeah, sending all that cheese back. That one seemed to look a lot better, though, than Firestorms, because they actually sent cheese. I think uh, the fire storms was just cancelled all up. Yeah. 
very interesting decision against someone like Circus that you know is gonna tend no, a lot. Back. Yeah, Circus with the LST going, it seems. At least yeah, got that back to back chaining. It started. But, uh, Fly Storm set so much pressure that it had to be stopped. Mm. Yeah, Circus couldn't find the combo down. Gonna get topped out. I honestly really enjoy uh, watching circulation, like look for those combos out. Can't always find them because it's just too hard, but I do enjoy, enjoy watching him try. Yeah. Nice little multiplier down stack there. Fire Storm is so clean right now. Oh my god. Jesus, that dude. Was oh my god. Really good round for Fire Storm. Two five. Serku needs to re change up his game plan or something here. It's multiplied by Serku. Both players just have clean wells at the moment, but Firestorm's yeah. got his well in the middle, so it's just an advantage in this game. Oh, oh. Circu, insane that down was an stack. Insane smart down stack. I saw that he used his eye on the other side, and I thought it was over for him, but managed to cycle to another eyepiece in time. Both players just going ham right now. Mm. Oh, very smart multiplier there from Circu, cancelling off that a huge spike. We're sensing. seeing a lot of multiplier combos from both players. Mm. Just like this. so many. Oh, that was Circus a really smart play from Five from there. At the and same Circu time, Circu like set up a nice. Points. Yeah, he set up a nice, like, cut copy. Mm. Unless, I don't think it was cut copy, maybe it was something else. Ooh, things are not looking so good for Circle. Ooh, nice find. Ooh. Looks like he's, like, completely out now. Yeah. Jeez, this is intense. A lot of back and forth, a lot of near yeah, deaths. That... Yeah, this is a really long round. Surprisingly, it looked like it was going to end so many times. Mm. Players had like at least three separate clutch finds that didn't survive. Looks like Sushi might get into his back to back chain going here. It found a really nice STSD. Mm. Match has kind of been reset to the neutral game. I mean, no one really has a clear advantage. No one's in danger. Circle might be though if he doesn't start getting down. I think Circle's fine for now. Fire Storm doesn't have anything to work with, and Circle sends a huge spike. Mm. Storm has a bit of an awkward field. Okay, he manages to get out pretty cleanly. This is such an insane round. Circo has a 7-2 going here. It's not a position you want to let Circo get into, and yeah, that's going to net him the round. Use this a lot of back and forth. That was a crazy round, man. Mm. There's, I think Circo needed that win, too. But that would have put Firestorm at match point. Because we've been in a bit of a losing streak there. It'd be a pressure shift that Circo needed. Ooh, Firestorm finds a PC, mm -hmm. finds another one, and then goes straight into doing opener TKI. TKI. A bit of a PC chain there from Firestorm. It's not enough though. That was dangerously close for Circu. Going with death here. It's just constantly close right now. Amazing just find by Circu. Stacks.
So yeah, Circle looked like he was dead there five times again, and finds like these beautiful down stack extend these combo extensions that can survive. Not oh. enough there. Like a piece short there. Three six and five swamps favor, but both players going crazy right now. Match point. Do you know if this is a winners or loser side? I think winners. Yeah, it'd be winners for sure. Oh, RNG game by Circular. Doesn't really do anything to FS, although FS didn't find the most optimal down stack. Unfortunate for Circuit. Circuit had good um, back to back going, but unfortunately left him in a position that was kind of awkward. Yeah, very, very good round from both players. So many clutch finds. Really, really good. Circuit surprised me. I knew Circuit was. I mean, I knew Circuit was good. I just. I haven't really watched too much of his gameplay before. That really surprised me. That was just... I think that was... I think it's safe to say that was the best game so far, in my opinion. That was yeah, it a was, really, really exciting game. I was at a loss for words. I had like a bunch of points. I was like leaning forward on the edge of my seat, seeing if Circuit would survive. And most of the time he did. An insane yeah. like, combo extensions at bottom time. Just so many, just like combo down stacks. Mm. Really good just, stuff. Just... A lot of. All right, continue. I was just gonna say, just how quickly he finds it is the real like game decider. Like it's just, I think anyone can find that type of stuff, but he just finds it like instantly. Yeah. Some parts though, he did slow down, which I think cost him some rounds. Mm. Like he slowed down too much, but still, mm. really good stuff. And the score might not reflect it so much, but it was a really close game. Mm. What even the score is like five seven, right? It wasn't like super far off. Or, I'm actually not sure. I forget already. Yeah, same. I thought it was like four or seven. Oh, how long? Yeah, I don't know, but still, really good stuff. Oh, okay. Jack and continuing with their question. Well, yeah, what is your question, Jack and? I'm looking at chat, I'm looking at chat. Calm down, person. This better be, this better be a good question. I'm not seeing a question. Yeah, I'm waiting. You have our attention. <laughs> yes, you can call me Jim. That... Wow. Well, yeah. What a question. It's... Oh my god. It's not a question you needed to ask. That's what most people call me. Yeah, trolled. S M H. I see Tony uh, when me and Sean can be bothered. I feel yeah. That's how I feel about uh, PC Open Two right now. Bozo, I agree, Mr. Shine Wavy. Alright, we've got our second okay. player in the room. All questions are put on hold until next round. Sorry. Ooh. Very, very strong player here. I think this is the first time we've seen them on stream. Players is laving up. Pooping, I think. I'm not sure if they're pooping or peeing or both. It's always safe to say that they poop. Can you be a third commentator? I don't. I don't get to decide that. Sadly, I think you'd have to go to Renge probably. I'm gonna have to follow Kabu 
booze load as well, and uh, quickly use the restroom. I really need right. to go. I'm sorry. Fine, that's fine. Vince jump scare. What's up, Vince? He's throwing up the peace sign. Um, maybe also a reference to his. Oh! <laughs> Jesus, okay. Bozo, yeah. Poor Caboozle. More... Yeah, more than doubled, I think. Yeah, Vince has double his friends. It is. Yeah, that's just sad. I hate to see it. Hello. Oh, hey, Wrench. What's up? I heard Oliver went to the washroom, so. I'm here to fill in for like the two minutes he's gone. Uh, you okay. know, we got Vince and uh, Caboozled Pie. Vince with a great profile picture. Uh, yeah. Moving. <coughs> Wait, what? Dude, I feel like Vince's friend count meter just like it gets like way too big. Yeah, when, I what, thought there was like a limit, limit of like two, like 600 for supporters or something. Dude, I think because it's, it's the amount of people who have friended you, right? Or something. Oh, is it? Yeah, but like past, I think 800 or something. Like it just, you just, it just, it doesn't. <laughs> what? It goes all the way through this, through this <laughs> triangle, loops over to the left side yeah. of the screen. Wait, is the blue, like, is the blue part it looping over? So the, the blue is how much more he has than Caboozled. Oh, then Cab Okay, okay, that makes just sense. Just like how big of a loser Caboozled is, I guess. Oh, true. Caboozled, the biggest loser in the Tetris no. community. Only 500 <laughs> friends, dude. Left. That's insane. Anyways. <laughs> we got Caboozled on the left, Vince on the right in this warm-up here. Lightning uh, quick. Vince kind of doing a bit of a weird stack, but he wins. As, as Vince often does do. That's like his <laughs> mantra. Weird stack, but it works. Weird stack, right. but it works, though. And Oliver's Excuse back. Excuse me. Thank you for taking over, Ringe. No worries. Uh, hope you guys are all enjoying the show. We got this and the rest of Winner's Side Top 16, and I think that will bring us right into the top eight. So stay tuned for that. Have a good one. Mm. See you, Ringe. I miss Ringe so much. Ringe is so cool. When Ringe joins a VC, it's not like a, it's not a jump scare. It's like a jump excite. I blush when he joins the corner. Damn. He's getting started off though. Caboozle. <laughs> Dude, what is, what is going on on Vince's board? I'm not entirely sure. Ooh, <laughs> that's interesting. Very weird stuff going on on Vince's side, but he's, he's making it work somehow. And now it's just, that's a disgusting spike. <laughs> Huge. I don't think anyone could have survived that. Not even Jesus himself could have survived that. Would have had to <laughs> have like a second Easter or something for that one. A second, a second Easter. Yeah, he would have had to come back from the dead. And Vince just kind of dominating with that opening. A yeah, very quick round there. Well, okay, Cadmus dropping his signature MKO. His iconic MKO. It's for PC! <laughs> Turned into another, it's another one? one. <laughs> oh my god. Someone put like PC juice in this in this Tetra room or something? Like it seems like everyone's getting mid-game PCs. Mm. Oh. Oh, uh cab. I think that was a missed drop from Cab. I think he meant to skim with the T on the left side. He had a multiplier down, but sadly didn't press the hold key or something. That cost him the round. Yeah, a bit unfortunate there. But Cab's oh. able to get his iconic MKO. Into the other PC. He needs to, he needs to like patent that or something before someone steals it. Might just add it to the to a wiki and claim credit. Oh, Ooh. big downside from Kabuzzled. Yeah. From and I'll move his board to the bottom in like half a second. Very good stuff. Yeah, Vince really took his time with that downstack, which is a good idea because now he's got a really clean well. That paid off, it seems. Oh, into a nice SCSD. 
Six back to back. Chain too much for a cab there. Let me get him another round. Ooh, red. Go for the forward. Let's go. I respect it. It Whoa. works. Huge spike. Is that gonna get him the round? It just might. No, it's not. It's not. Oh, Vince. Yeah, yeah Vince had the down stack. This does not die to anything. Love to see it though. Always love to see a cheeky forward. Especially in I, especially in Tetria. Oh, in Tetra League, like every, I'd say every game of the Tetra League I play, I always bust out a cheeky one or two. <laughs> you have to. It's in the rule book or something. Ooh. Of all, the people to die, for that one. of all the people to die to a double PC, I'd expect Vince to do it the least, but it looks like he just stopped at the start, couldn't recover. Oh Ooh, my. DT from Cab? It didn't pay off though, that's not a spin that works. Yeah, definitely not. I respect the BT though. It's not often you see BT in any game, especially Tetria. I don't miss with BT. <laughs> Mid game is cool. Uh, Opening, not so much, but. Yeah, that's true. I don't like loops. Ooh. Very unfortunate. Uh, Blondie Rick and Cab didn't 180 the J in time, then this dropped the S afterwards, and it's match point for Vince now. Really strong showing for Vince. Looks like Cab has a DPC going though. I didn't get the DC off of it, but still got a Tetris. Vince does a bit of a power stack and just, yep, that's why it ends it all. Very quick set, but good showing from both players. GG's to Vince and Cab. Oh, and okay, it looks like Cab sent more lines than Vince. Well, it's kind of expected with all those PCs. Mm hmm. Yeah, very... I think, um, <laughs> sorry, go on. I was just going to say, very good stuff by Vince. Like, he, he looked like he had his missed drops under control for the most part that round. It was good. Yeah, I think, um, in terms of the PCs from Kaboozled, it, it did send a lot of lines, but, like, kind of, like, over time. I know it's, like, really quick, but still standing those lines over time, while Vince just, like, with those spikes, it's just, like... Sending less lines overall, but it's like 20 at once. That's like the whole board. Mm hmm. Yeah. Like more, it's more consistent versus a spike. That's crazy to say that like a, a PC is consistent, but that's the nature of DPC. Mm. I really yeah, respected uh... the mid game BT attempts, though. You gotta respect stuff like that. Stuff you don't see often. It's probably a reason you don't see it often. <laughs> but like, that's why it's good to see. Hmm. Already going into the next one. Oh, this is. I didn't know this person was in the tournament. Interesting. A really good game coming up. Who's the Who's the opponent? Wait, is uh, is it who I think it is? Is that who I think it is? It's who I think it is. I'm hyped as hell. Love this man. This is like the one person I like more than Quantum Hornet. Oh, okay. That's saying a lot because Quantum Hornet is like one of my favorite people ever. Wait, more attractive than Quantum Hornet? Is that? I mean, Quantum Hornet won won the awards, right? But you know, I cast my vote for someone else. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> That's fair enough. Okay, right, it is yeah. what I think. This Got is actually on players. my bucket list to commentate and a game for this person. One of these players is eating an apple right now, apparently. Ooh, an apple. It's, uh, some, it's uh, like brain food or something, right? I, still I was about to say the exact same thing. I was going to say yeah. some brain food.
I was gonna say brain juice, but I was like, that's not juice. Brain juice. Ap apples have juice in them. Good two in one deal. <laughs> this is a good fun fact. There is? Away. Looking this up right now. I don't believe this for a second. I mean, why I'm buying this. This is propaganda. All right. Oh my god, there is. You can. You guys can see the game. It's uh, QMK versus Plug. And uh, QMK's fun go. fact is, there's a Lord of the Rings audiobook on Spotify. I'm st I saw it with my own two eyes, and I'm still not buying it. That's that's planted evidence. But why would, they, why would there not be an audiobook? It's such an old book. Like, why on Spotify? Isn't Spotify like music? I, I think uh, I think Lord of the Rings is so old that it's like open, like. Open source. Remember, yeah, open it's domain. open licensing. Yeah, open demand. Is this, this so, is a warm up, right? Yes. Back to the QMK. Classic QMK. Ooh. The, the Blarg wiggle. Blarg will like wiggle his pieces. When he does yeah, a spin. It's like no one else can do it. Cab has his own like cab the cab twist or like one eight or like do a full three sixty of the piece. But the wiggle mm -hmm. is Blarg's thing. It's These just aren't a all official thing. terms. They're in the Tetris guideline. One that got leaked in like 2008, they mentioned the Blorg Wiggle in it. Yeah, it literally said, it's like page 98. Because there's definitely 98 pages for the guidelines. <laughs> yep. Alright, and okay. here we go. This is... I'm so excited. I'm so happy to be here right now. I love you, Renge. <laughs> I feel like we're gonna see a lot of downside stack in this game. Uh, oh, Blarg might not give QMK the chance with this pressure. Jesus. I think that was Very just a bad decision from QMK. That was, uh, yeah. that was just a bad fractal, to be honest. Players have big well to work with here. I think they both burned through it and cancelled each other off, so now they're at the bottom. I think they just kind of wanted to get down ASAP because I know, especially Blog, doesn't like being in a 9 0 situation. Mm -hmm. There's 9 chain from Blog right now. Has to break it though due to an SP's misdrop. Let's get from blog to stay alive. Yeah, very nice cancels there. That blog goes for the greedy fractal, but it works out. Yeah, something you'll notice quickly about blog is he tends to upstack a lot more than other players. Sometimes can work against him, but very definitely works very for unusual. Him a lot. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Nice multiplier there from QMK, buying himself a bit of time. Another one. He's gonna get him into safety now. Now, he'll be at the bottom of the world. Yeah, both players here in a bit of a neutral state. Blar getting pushed up though, and, has, and uses the eyepiece on the left side. Gonna get QMK the round. I like that QMK kind of does some risky stuff because I, I think he just trusts himself to be able to fix it quickly. Mm. He 
very good at down stacking, so he always has that to fall back on uh, in case of emergency. Very nice little spike there from Blard. And I didn't see exactly what happened on QMK's side, but he had a very messy field. I'm going to assume it was a misdrop. That combined with Blarg's pressure is going to Blarg tie things up. Blarg just keeping up so much pressure right now. Mm -hmm. I think QMK misdropped that old piece. Blarg mm -hmm. just continued blitzing out T-spins and Tetrises. I had two eye pieces, just that there was no way you could fix up those pieces, it was unfortunate. Yeah. Ooh, awkward from Blarg. I think that was Gamma PC. I didn't see exactly. Ooh, very nice Ooh. multiplier using QMK's garbage against him. Gonna net him a quick win. QMK was kind of going for a pretty safe T spin, but like Blarg just like spiked him out at that moment. Mm -hmm. has a, I'd say Blark has a pretty big speed advantage over QMK and it's like he's using that his fullest right now. Ooh, QMK is not in the best Ooh. ball state right now. Yep. Like he miscalculated that down stack. Why I just run away with this one? QMK has to, to do something, maybe change up his play style. Very clean stack here on QMK's end. Borg fixed up his stack, so he has a lot of clean to work with now too. Uh, Borg was thinking for a bit about how to continue with his spins, but I think mm -hmm. it just took too long and just decided to end it. Yeah. So in a fast-paced game like this, you have to know when to cut your losses. Oh, very yep. smart find by QMK there. I clutch clear into like a double multiplier Tetris. Yeah, definitely really good. And lucky with the pieces. Oh my god, huge spike there from Blarg. Six back to back chain. Uh, Blarg is just a monster. It's, it's game point for Blarg now. Is that it? Jesus. Oh my god. Blog. Oh my god. The pressure was just too much at the end there. MK's field wasn't even that bad. He just wasn't quick enough to get to his eyepieces that he needed. Mm. Yeah, GG's to both players. Just Blog just setting yeah. out so much damage, so much pressure. Yeah, that was... I know in some previous tournaments he, he's had a bit of trouble with QMK. I mean, it seems like he, he's really refined his gameplay since the last mm. tournament he was in. I was able to take that. That's, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm happy to see that uh, blog in the tournament. I feel like he's missed the past few, unfortunately. Yeah, he's, he's got super unlucky. He, he forgot to check into last Tetrio Cup or something, then went to sign up for another tournament and like his power went out. Mm. With, like some like blizzard or something in his city. Yeah. Very unlucky, but he said next Tetrio Cup he's in, he's going to put on a show for everyone. And clearly, he's a man of his word, because that's exactly what yeah. he did. Don't really popped off. Who's this player? I am. Do you know who this is, Oliver? I'm not sure. I know they're an Attack on Titan fan, though. <laughs> I don't know if yeah. other people are going to figure out who it is now. Aaron... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. No. <laughs> Look at their badges. I know who it is. <laughs> what are these badges? Is this... I still don't know who this is. Is it Dio? Yeah. Oh, my God. Dio jump scare. Oh, Jesus. Dio says... <laughs> God. 
Oh man, he's never gonna live that one down. <laughs> I was there. I, I was there. You're, you're there when it originally happened? Yes. I see. <laughs> and this is... Yeah, well, it's holy. He's converted to Catholicism. He's seen the light. <laughs> How are we Honestly, in bracket right now? I was about to say, uh, I, I hope this kills the... the the Joey, small Joey meme. Oh yeah, hopefully. I, I, I was like looking through leaderboards, trying to like figure out where someone was, and I like there's like five combinations of like Joey and small. Like the top twenty five. Really was annoying. So yeah. Yeah. Do you know like where in bracket we are right now? Is this like top? Like two or something? Is this grand finals? Uh, to be honest, I haven't had bracket open because even though I have a pretty good computer, I've got like, I've got like a browser open, I've got Tetrio client open, then I've got Discord open. It's just like eating at my CPU. My computer's running slow now. Yeah, battle, battle fight's hard. Okay, Ooh. okay, jump scare. So yeah, we got a Dormy versus DR right now. Seed one. Similar triangles, but Dia has a, a bit less DPS, it seems. Yeah, definitely. Definitely efficient player, but also, to be honest, uh, <laughs> I think everyone knows Dia likes to sandbag a bit. Yeah, he does a bit of trolling here and there. He likes to have some fun. I think, I think a bit of trolling is banned tournament though so mm. you won't see it who knows I'm moving into the warm-ups now all right dormy with some mountain is stacking it does yeah and dormy playing like similar speed right now I feel like this will be a bit of a slower paced game. I think both players prefer to play a bit slower if they can and kind of speed up if they have to. Yeah. That's the kind of feel I get. I I think DL likes to conserve energy. We stand an economic king. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't want to waste any labor. He doesn't have to. It looks like Diaz just like perfectly matching whatever PPS Dormy decides to play at. A bit of an awkward stack now. Yeah, nothing I can one. do about that one. Hmm. Dormy does have the friend advantage. Maybe our friendship and got him through that warm up. Alright. Good luck, have phones in chat. Ready to go. Most players keeping it respectful and classy. Love to see it. One, one thing about Diao is he like. He always finds these like inhuman down stack extensions. Yeah, I'll opt in to not go for the PC. I didn't even see how they had one. Oh wow. <laughs> Perfectly timed spike. It looks like they have just like wanted to end that round as quickly and efficiently as possible. 
Also, I think I was looking at Doremi's board, sorry, when I said P PC, uh, up to the knock of PC, not here. Oh. Doremi upstacking quite a bit. Both players upstacking quite a bit, to be honest. Mm. It's always so interesting to watch DL with his sound sacks because he'll, he'll like find it in his head and then he'll like just do it like in a burst instantly. Yeah, he'll like pause to calculate his down stack and burst it out at 5 PPS. It's always like the, the most crazy down stack combos that like milks every piece for all it has. That was the biggest piece here back I've ever seen. I only got the second. I think he was looking for another one there, but that did not exist. And the yeah, I'm just trying to be efficient now. Fishing for mm -hmm. everything. So he could die here if he's not careful. Pretty high up. Oh man, yep. There's the pausing for the down stack and bursting it out. Classic. It, it works, it takes Stormy out. Yeah, for Dio. Got some copy passes in chat. Yeah, let's go. I, I look down at chat and I see something going on. <laughs> Mods, can, can we ban can we ban Mr. Wrench here? <laughs> yeah, can we ban Wrench? I don't like know what I'm seeing. Ooh. I'm gonna multiply from Dio. Keeping up this back-to-back -back pressure. Some clean. Ooh, nice Tetris Dono there. Still the TSD because he didn't quite have the right pieces for it. Very smart play. Oh, and Diao yeah, keeping this. Oh. oh and Diao was keeping his back-to-back -back by uh, going for two T-spin singles in a row, and then going yeah, right back smart. to the clean well. Yeah, 13 back-to-back chain. -back They're very smart stuff. Oh, Ever skim his way out. Dying himself with the uh, multiplier he had. Okay, interesting skin from Diop. Keeping his field oh. nice and thin. Dormy barely able to get that donation off. And again. Ooh. Can't get to that TST. Mm -hmm. It looks like DL opted to do a bit of the plonker opener for his opponent to send, <laughs> and it works. Game point for DL here. It might be a sweet. Please, Dormy. Believe in Dormy. Ooh. Uh, Hachi spin from Dormy. No, oh my god. god, what can oh. you do against uh... Oh my god. You can do a lot apparently. I thought that yeah, was Dor over to be honest. I thought it was over too, but Dormy survived that somehow, some way. And that's what we were saying before, like, just burst those out instantly. Mm. They're not just like spikes, they're spikes of cheese. Even more deadly. Ooh, yeah, and and that that's the GGs. Mm -hmm. Dharma wasn't even playing bad. He was just playing against the L. Yeah, number but one, um, it's number one seed for a reason. I believe we are switching to our next castles now. Oh. If I, I rest guess this is goodbye. I'm, yep. I'm fighting yeah, back I the tears. A... <laughs> yep. Okay. Alright, yeah, so uh, this is the end for me and Jimothy. Mm -hmm. We'll be taken over by Sinewave and Skyfile. But before that, yeah. we'll be going on a five minute break. Yeah, Jed's yelling obscenities at us to leave, and that we're never <laughs> casting again.
Uh, yeah. Yeah, it looks like it. Yep. A minute. All right, we're going to have a five minute break, guys. Then we're swapping over to other casters. Forget who it yep. is, but. Sine wave and Skyfire. Yep, thank Good you for having that. us on the stream. These games have been so good, and mm -hmm. peace. Love.
Yo. 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 Back. It's a Skyfire reveal. That's crazy. Oh, no, no way. <laughs> it's no. crazy. On my, like, laptop cam, it's just boosted by, like, two books at the bottom. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah. Humble set up the beginning. We'll get there. We'll get there. How's it going, dude? How you doing tonight? Doing good. <laughs> How about you? Uh, can't complain. Can't complain. Just, uh, you know, enjoying some good Tetris. I had some good food earlier. Just uh, having a nice old Saturday, you know? Yeah. Very nice Saturday. <laughs> I was uh, actually spending a lot of time just trying to finish up homework last night just so that I can, could actually like, do this. Yeah. Very oh, nice. We are glad to have you here with us. Uh, I believe we've come at a pretty good time somewhere in winners. I think semis. I've been told right. Uh, got a pretty good match coming up shortly here. Yeah, this is going to be very, very interesting. We've now reached top eight, it seems like. And, uh... Okay. And now, this is the bracket where we have Diao and Firestorm. And Vince and... <laughs> Flarg. And I... <laughs> Larg, I see Wumba Larguyo. I don't know what you're talking about right there, but oh yeah, hey, sorry, yeah, I see only Vince HD, and uh, I do, I, I don't see the allies there. I see Yelena. The <laughs> never existed. Who's the owl? Yeah. All right. All right. Now that we've checked all the boxes off, now that we can get back to business. You know how it is. Yeah, and now. One day, losers bracket will catch up, but in the meantime, we have these awesome matches to showcase. <laughs> and not to say that losers brackets aren't awesome, because they definitely are. <laughs> I sent Jim Thee to the work camp, by the way. He's gone now, because I sent him to the work camp. <laughs> He's got to make T-spins and PCs and good content for us now until we say, okay, you're done. <laughs> Let's see. If the people are asking, or CZ asked, like, Ritter didn't check in, and everyone else wants the Ritter, and Timothy, and everything, and I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> yeah, that is a good way to describe this tournament. I don't know what's going on anymore. Uh, I'm excited to watch some of these matches here in, uh, here in Winter Semis, coming up shortly. Yeah, this is, uh, yeah, I don't know what to expect. It's like, these are like the players that have been competing against each other for so many times in the last couple of tourneys, but each time, like, something new might happen. Yeah, there's, there's always another card that's like, just draw from nowhere, like, oh, now I also do this, you know? And, uh, it's, there's always just something else coming, it's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Now it looks like they're moving on to try to do some warm-ups. And uh, but they're ready to see what they're gonna what tools they're gonna bring to the table. Is that even the right expression? <laughs> I don't know. But like yeah, It's definitely uh one heck of a high power match to start off with tonight, Skyfire. Is a uh, yeah. Nothing easy about coming up on this one. Yeah, I don't know what to expect, but if, uh, that, if we can see that there is like some crazy efficiency from the DL, I mean, uh, Yelena, and uh, <laughs> I have to say DL, I don't care. <laughs> so, like, both players known for, well, I mean, DL is known for his down stack, but definitely, like, his off, overall, just like a very balanced player almost like master of all trades did. and firestorm classic firestorm did, with his apm spam and extreme pressure and now firestorm <laughs> speaking firestorm's, of which he's doing... like listening to you you know you're like ah yes clean pressure okay four wide got it and you know what yeah it's gonna work look at this big fat 25 to start it off yeah yeah okay. he starts off with very extreme pressure that <laughs> And now he's really going at it, and DL is actually on the defense. 
Yeah, this, this so big like, five four is kind of a it's big center wall of APM stacking. That's kind of thing he's known for. Uh, looks like he's trying to fight to get back into that spot. Won't appear. Yeah, it definitely looks like DL is like keeping things relatively under control. Like, he... oh, okay, oh, the, uh, but that C spin might not upgrade be... from Firestorm into the double Tetris was just crazy strong. This is just a warm up, by the way. Yeah, when I mention that, it's just a warm up. Jeez, this is warm. Just trying crazy. to get that SCSD. They're like, first room. <laughs> I almost thought he was going to convert to a NAR SCSD after. Like, it looks like he has some, a lot of clean pressure and is trying to pressure out Diao, but it looks like this pressure may or may not be enough unless Firestorm suddenly were to do huge back to back spikes. And it looks like he might because we're at back to back 8. And we yeah, did a NAR counter nice. spike. So, Holy! They're like a oh, really clean upgrade right there. Yeah. Nice little spike. Yeah. And firestorm. Oh, yeah. another great find is STSD, although a little risky, not having the second TN time. Yeah, we're gonna be able to bust out that spike at the end. Firestorm just couldn't get down. Yeah, definitely felt like much of a patience game for Diao, where he was sort of waiting for the opportunity where Firestorm would like cover up too much. And then just like, just spike. Hey, I, I just want to say real quick that warm up. Diao yeah, sending only 107 lines. The far storm is 238. I think that one's worth pointing out. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> just a ridiculously precise strike at the end. <laughs> yeah, and uh, it looks like we're gonna get to the actual match soon. As both players are saying they're good luck, have fun. And now we prepare for surely what's going to be, like, who knows what's going to happen moment. <laughs> oh, I'm excited. <laughs> yeah, true, especially after that kind of world. Now it's time to get into the first 211, win by two. Oh yeah, by yeah. the way. <laughs> That's how that works now. Yeah, definitely, uh... I wonder if, like, that warm-up was so there for Dio to just sort of... I guess gauge Firestorm pressure, perhaps. Who knows? Yeah, I'm just not getting my second piece of some garbage. It's a little bit unfortunate during the timing. Yeah, but now, like, both players are actually Super starting to go full right speed. Now. Definitely yeah. neutral. Well, look like... at this. Look at this from Firestorm. It's oh, crazy. Yeah, that's a huge really advantage. Pays off getting that clean garbage big time. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna move this drop. Super quick cleanup. Very nice. Isn't in 40 seconds with Firestorm keeping all of... No, he is keeping 4 PPS. Ugh, 200 yes. APM. Oh, and that's a huge spike! <laughs> Big 31. That is a huge oh, spike! Just uh, like a piece away. Uh, really abrupt way to stop it. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna take the first one this set. Yeah. Definitely. I wonder if, like, going as fast as possible might not pay off, because uh, if Dio can handle this pressure, then maybe just going the same speed might make Firestorm too predictable. Who knows? I don't know. What are your thoughts on this? Yeah, there's a lot of different factors at play, I think. It's not just there's their speed, you know, like how maybe one person plays with another, but, you know, kind of how clean they're sending, and, you know, all the other factors about things, how much they're canceling and accepting. And, uh, while we're talking about this Firestorm, look at this big, incredible yeah. back to back chain. It's going crazy in this big oh. middle ST. He went even faster. It's like. Definitely, like, Firestorm strat of, like, pressuring more was definitely probably the biggest thing that would end up, like. That would actually be really important because, like, if you can spam enough APM where, like, the out has to stride, then that's where, like, the real mess starts to begin. Yeah, Firestorm definitely has quite a few weapons for that, whether it's PCs or even stick spin. And it's consistent back to back. Yeah, definitely on that PC at the start is a bit of an interesting choice. Getting a really good pass through right there. Accepting all that clean garbage. <laughs> Clearing that one yeah. APP mark at the end of the game, by the way. Crazy. Yeah. <laughs> oh so this look like the wind conditions that like DL will be going for are the big clean spikes. 
Oh, Firestorm getting that second PC, that's huge. <laughs> Not huge enough, it seems. And yeah, it's currently going for a huge spike, back to back of four, and keeping it up at these down stacks. But that's... Oh, that, that pressure was just crazy for Firestorm. Everything just kind of lined up really nicely into yeah. that. And he's like so proficient in like doing these mid-game 7-2 stack. You get that situation right there, it's just nuclear. Yeah, that's one of the PCs again. Almost had that 30. Yeah, Firestorm is just a crazy player. Oh. I mean, both, both, these, <laughs> both, these were, both these were just insane, really. Yeah. Dio yeah, making that spike pink and trying to... But those huge spikes are what, like... Catch Firestorm off guard, and how is he gonna prepare for them? Maybe. Do you see? Do you see that crazy good foresight from Diawis down stacking? And finds the teaspoon at the garbage at the very end. Very nice stuff right there. Firestorm with a little bit of a pickle. Oh, not getting the teaspoon at the top, and that's uh, gonna even things out here. Three three. This is gonna be, I think, a long one. If it's first to eleven, win by two. You know. Yeah. Like say they're very close in both regards. Where. Uh... Firestorm can win by like out pressuring with Dial, and Dial can win by doing a huge unexpected spike. And not to say that like either player can't do the other's win condition, but that's what it does seem like right now. I just want to say right now, Firestorm 250 APM almost. Like this is nuts, and Dial keeping up 200 as well. <laughs> Some oh, absolute geez. insane stuff right now. Yeah, it's very, very crazy. Oh, great garbage. Oh, Look at this. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, dude. Super fast burst by Diao, the down stack. Yeah, but Diao with some excellent garbage. Really great force stay. Huge spike coming in. Firestorm accepting yeah. it like nothing still with that 4 DPS, yeah. 200 plus. Like, ah, uh, this is. Yeah. This is a level beyond sometimes what I've seen Firestorm play, and oh. uh... Is he gonna be able to get out? Okay, look at this. Holy... It's like... Look at this. <laughs> He's still going. See how... Yeah. Almost oh. killing Firestorm, like twice there. Firestorm now completely out. This is actually, like, pretty nuts. It's like, you push your opponent to the top, and everyone says, like, you need spikes to finish off your opponent, but, like, you need, like, two full screen do? spikes. I was gonna say, what do you do if that doesn't work? Like, look at Firestorm. Yeah, but, uh, you just need more damage here. somehow? It's like, it's... heck, doing nuts. I cannot like... believe he was able to maintain 200, like, 30 for, you know, a minute and a half. Just very crazy. <laughs> yeah, it was, uh... What is this PC? What is this Tetris PC? Oh this is God. Right, Firestorm. Not looking He's promising. Yeah. If a man just to get out, and that's How a lot of clean garbage. Line? Firestorm ready with that back to back 5, 6, 7! How is Diao oh, still alive right now? Really? Holy. Get... How is Diao still alive <laughs> right now? This is just incredibly <laughs> monumental. Like, both players, again, like, you. Having seen so many of these tournaments, you still always have expectations, and then they're always just blown away every time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at Goes this upgrade. For loading here from in and stacks up. Trying to get some extra damage with that back oh, with the to back. Yeah, his yeah. drop is going to be really rough here. He's a little bit in the back. Firestorm! With his big down stacks. Yeah, that Firestorm keeping like consistent over 200 APM. That's like 220, actually. I see. I see. You could write like a book about some just moments in this game. Just in this one game right here. <laughs> Like, there's just a whole book about this stuff in this. This is insane. Look at this down stack. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like... Oh, Firestorm with that SPs. This is a little scary. I'm super fast skimming, but I don't think he's getting through this one. Yeah. Oh. Now it's 5-3. A little bit of a point advantage by Diao. This is... <laughs> Yeah, Dio that has fire. slightly moved ahead here. Oh, this big... Okay, it's gonna pay off big time. Starting off with a 19 spike and clean garbage to boot. Firestorm. 
just playing 200 APM. These, you know, that's what we do now. I have a DL actually. I was accepting it for them. That. Nice little multiplier from Firestorm to stay in the game there. DL, really, really good board state. Easily clears through this. <laughs> oh, and DL trying to go for perhaps a bit of a power stack. That's a bit of it to cancel off some of that damage. Oh, Firestorm with an accidental misdrop, but look at this. Oh, man. Dang, that T hurt. Yeah. Like, great fix for that TST. What a nice little upgrade to fit the T spin double in there. Uh, it really hurts not rotating around a second time. Yeah. I saw what Firestorm was going for. It would have been insane. Like, like the T spin into, like, a TST. That's nuts. Like, yeah, we're going a little crazy if these T spin triples right now. Yeah. But finally a little bit less and a break in the intensity and it's you know kinda of yeah. funny that this is the round that you described as a break in intensity where they're still playing on like two hundred never mind. Still two hundred and fifty game. It's never gonna stop. <laughs> yeah, but now it's I wouldn't say the tides have started turning, but it's more like the tides are shifting further and further. Yeah. And, uh, seriously. Yeah, it's like so like Firestorm with the big spikes, and maybe DL won't be able to handle it, but suddenly DL finds that amazing down stack. But Firestorm is still pressuring. Oh my god. Yo, barely survived power stack, and that's not enough! And Firestorm 276. 276 APM right there. That... That's unreal. I... Honestly, right now I'm watching, this is... Again, it's always just that new level. The, today is no exception. I cannot believe like okay. how much pressure it took just to like finish off the owl. Like that was at least like three screen full screen spikes at least, right? Yeah, seriously, three. it's 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 you know you see DL sitting here surviving 250 APM for over a minute and it's like what can you even do anymore at this point? What will kill this guy? I got okay, some is... stick spin. <laughs> Huge garbage. It's a big return to Tiao. Immediate counter spike. Great garbage to Firestorm. I think is on the out for this one. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. This is like turn. I, mean, I don't know what to say. It's like Tiao has like been winning for the last couple of matches so far, but it begins with DT Cannon. Yeah, but like. Like, oh, and DL missed drops. Yeah. It's like. It's like, what do you expect from, like, is the goal, the end goal is just training with bots and trying to get better than, like, a bot? It's like, CZ oh. was training with Tetris. And, uh, okay, that garbage for DL was just so perfect. Squeezing in that T-Spin triple, I think, a little bit of a risky decision there, but Firestorm with modern art over there. Yeah, this is this, really rough. Yeah, this is really unfortunate. And now it's a uh, match point. It's like, dude. Definitely, it seems as though like both players have very similar capabilities when it comes to up stacking, but when it comes to down stacking, DL seems to win out in those battles. Oh, the big so, like, stick. And that's a huge amount of cheese on the that outboard. Is, yeah, with Firestorm having this pretty alright harvest to use, we can find some big spike here. We could get a little bit of a good position to start that typical Firestorm pressure we've seen. Yeah, there it is. Yo, let's go. 10-6, still on the edge here as Firestorm needs to win a consecutive four more games to keep things close. This is now win by two. Oh, just the PCs we come to expect. Yeah. Not quite getting that second might, one, but still back to, to a pretty good board state. Might be trying to get another one. Almost He's, gets it. Yeah, it's like, his, the vision that Firestorm has for these kinds of things is just insane. Oh, and that's a rough miss oh, drop. Wait, yeah, maybe he's still get out. Super hard. Uh, Not a chance. Unfortunate. And uh, that seems to be game. Super yeah, rough that? way to end it with uh, Dial seeing the kind of situation over there and really up stacking, finding the TT INQ for that fractal Tetris all at once, huge spike to end it. But uh, seriously, well played both players. Firestorm yeah. still putting up one crazy fight, uh, putting up some numbers 
I, I, I feel uh, like I say this all the time. I'm not sure if yes. I've seen before, really. <laughs> God, my heart, actually. <laughs> it's racing. Yeah. Racing right now. And uh, I gotta say, uh, thank you, Dormy, the raid. Uh, we do appreciate that. You guys came at a really good time, it looks like. <laughs> that was... It, that was insane. Yeah. And now BL moves on, and uh, let's see, what will be our next match? Will be Vince versus Bar? Oh, Wumbo Argyo. Yeah. Excuse me. Let's go. I feel like this is a bit of a classic one also, too. Vince Blarg. How many times have you seen this one, you know? Oh, look at that. Things yeah. have changed. That's crazy. We have some no people way. in the losers bracket now. Looks like we have QMK. Okay. We'll be seeing yep. again later. I, not a huge surprise, you know. He's a bit of a regular around these parts. Uh, yeah, Cirque. A bit of, you know, kind of the same deal, but... Have the orange juice? Ooh. OJ, let's go. New, <laughs> fresh blood, fresh juice here. The, uh, the top eight. Always great to see some people coming out. Going crazy. Let's see. Vince versus Blarg. I am very uncertain about who will win. Not gonna lie. Uh, Mac, I'm very uncertain. That's all I can say. I'm not gonna this influence is... any decision. Yeah, I'm with you there, you know. I don't wanna I don't wanna I don't wanna say any predictions here, you know. But I'm just mm -hmm. gonna say there's history this matchup, you know? This is one of those it's like in a lot of other sports they have this big rivalry rivalry, I can speak, uh, weekends, you know, uh, like the big the big football games in the end of November or but we hate the other team on the other side of the state or whatever, you know? I feel like this is one of those kind of situations, right? This is yeah. like a this is like a, a this is a clash coming up right here. I have voted for someone. That's the thing. Yo, true voting. Let's yeah. go. Yeah, let's go. You see predictions moment, J.K. <laughs> Dormy with the hot intel, the last top eight slot between Garden Sale, Simp Shrimp, and Kabuzled. That is a, definitely a trio, I think, for the fighting for that. Yeah, that's gonna be super interesting, actually. Really. Actually, okay. Simp Shrimp beat Garden Sale, oh. so it's Kaboozled. Yo, Simp Shrimp. Yo, Simp Shrimp, no way. This is actually amazing. <laughs> that's nice. Oh no, jump scare. Okay, and now, oh, oh. <laughs> it's funny every time. Yeah, every single time that like, oh my god. I'm thinking, I'm thinking the colored part of the bar is like the difference between them and the other person. You know? Yeah. Oh man, that's I, <laughs> quite. And in this difference. case, yeah, it's looking like this almost has that full screen difference. You know, almost. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. You... Holy, I don't got that popularity button. True. Yeah. True. All right. Holy, let's see here now, uh, seems like we're having a bit of a warm up for now. No PC for Blarg. Yeah, this is a little bit of a rough misdrop, but he's gonna fix he's it. It's Vince. What do you expect? Yeah. <laughs> Vince Blarg with this big it. mega up stack. Oh, but it's a little risky. Yeah, Vince's missed job fixing is like Ooh, probably one of the this... best, but not that best. Look at the survival oh. from Blark though. Yeah, and it looks like Vince ain't getting out of that one. Damn. Nah, that was just a warm up. And now let's see what happens in the actual match. You know. Pretty good. That's a pretty good little warm up right there, you know? It's like. <laughs> like, perhaps, like, you may have, like, like, you could be 1 PPS, 1 APM, 
and like you you still win because you may have one billion more friends. To, like it's kind of like you win because of your friends and friendship and stuff like that. It's definitely the same thing. Yep. Yeah. Like Mark Vince Jamashiro right there. Yeah. I I should really stop that. Uh, yeah, Mark <laughs> the nice little Jamashiro opening right there. Vince having the biggest upstep, getting pretty good garbage. But this this misdrop is gonna be a little hard to fix. Got that? Yeah, but I. Man, just getting these IPs is just still not time. out yet. Definitely still not out yet. This is a. It's like immediately when you miss drop, you're me you're like at a disadvantage. But look at that! Ooh. That is what is that? All right. <laughs> that teaspoon. Nice <laughs> overhang there, and uh, Vince overhang. really hanging on by a thread, able to pull something great out right there. We'll see if he can do it again here at the top. Yeah. Both players truly insane, but Vince is the one that get topped out. With a little bit of a just kind of extra kick at the end, there able to able to give Vince before the big down stack. Let's see, Vince beginning with a bit of five four stacking, but we're getting into a bit of a DPC. It seems like oh, but it's so good. It Look at, it's leaving him in like such a good board position. Holy, and what a down stack Vince, by Vince! Vince looking terrifying. That kind of down stack, though. Oh yeah, my like, god! What is that continuation? <laughs> Dude, that's an 11 combo. What the? That's a, what? Really nice count to four, also kind of snuck in there. I don't know if you saw that from Vince. Yeah. Oh Lord, my god. He's gonna try and go for it. Yeah, oh, but like, I don't know if that power stack is gonna be enough. Yeah. It barely is. Yeah, I don't oh, know. I think like... Mark's looking really good right now. He's got a pretty good ammo, but Vince coming all the way back through. Bug doing a bit of tanking, definitely being the one on the offense here now, but like Vince getting out those crazy down stacks and make one of them might just catch Bark, who knows? In the moment everything is seems to be fine and neutral, but like you know it, it's very unpredictable. Yeah. I think well, Vince is sneaking in that little multiplier at the end again there. Keeping things he can't keep getting away with this. Oh, yeah. you know? Rough miss drop by Vince. He's gonna just try to fix it. He manages Mark, to fix it. I like... think they get a little bit of up stack here. I like the decision I'm seeing here, but Vince is just able to counter it anyway. Yeah. Mark slowly working him up. Oh, that garbage is just too perfect. Oh, this is man. kind of a moment that Vin, uh, Bard can really use to kind of take this one. Uh, yeah, there's no way. There's no way Vince gets out of this, right? No. Yeah. It was close though, like you almost saw a glimmer of hope at the end, but like... Blarg well, able to keep up that pressure in a little bit of a 2-0 right now. Yeah, it's like... One thing I do definitely note that like... It's like, is that like, Vince's playstyle seems a lot more volatile when I... When compared to like, other players sometimes. Like where like, you generally expect they'll like, APM spam, they'll be efficient, and they'll like, do something like that. It's like... But it's a lot harder to tell what Vince will do, and that's why I think like can help him give the advantage sometimes. Yeah, that's definitely true. I, I do think that Vince is playing a little bit more volatile gameplay. I think Flark seems to be playing a little bit on the safer side tonight, and I, I don't mean like kind of holding back, but more hunting for some pretty oh, good decision making. And, wow. Uh, I think it's you know I think it's going to be a huge key factor here. You know, not necessarily just pure raw attack here, but I think there's going to be a little bit of bigger keeping the stack cleaner kind of upkeep. Yeah, definitely like... Really going to determine this one. As you can see, they're both really capable of just throwing out know, attack after attack. Holy... Yeah. But it feels almost kind of like they're like sword fighting, you know? And it's like every, every blow, you know, like if you don't take it just right, you're not going to be ready for the next one. I like, Blarg barely kind of hanging on right now, but if get something good set up here, this could be, you know, this could switch oh. in a moment. How does Vince, like, turn literally every miss drop into a counter spike with multiplier? That's uh, it's like... just nuts, man. <laughs> it's just Vince things. <laughs> just true. It's just Vince yeah. things. Yeah. Actual crack. 
Yeah, and uh, as we come up, uh, like, a little bit into, you know, almost a minute and a half in this game, it feels like an eternity is gonna pass. They almost get a 300 piece mark. Just, what a game at this pace. And look at this down snap from Blorg. That's a lot of cheese. This, again, a kind of a key opportunity here, but Vince That's escaping cool way too fast. Yeah, it's like, so crazy how, like, with, like, normally if you're going, like, Three point like three point eight, you'd be expecting a person to just be striding all the time. But it's like Vince's burst speed is just so fast that like he can time like comfortably while like bursting and it still be like three point eight. It's crazy. Like, yeah, like this little burst kind of DS that you see there, you see a little bit of a weight back into this burst, you know, I'm gonna place the whole bag at once. Borg's <laughs> still keeping up with him now. Yeah. Uh, like feeling real good right now. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, both like both both of them are playing just insanely solid. But right now, yeah. Oh, but I'm a little bit worried. Oh, for this that, one is that that impross was a bit risky. And it's able to claw a second one. Things evening back out. Ah, oh, man! Imagine if we had margin time and then we had pro players like. Spamming a hundred APM, like hundred like attack spikes. Oh god, Lord. what a nightmare that would be. Okay, it would be Lord funny. Or trying, trying to bail out of this LST. I think he's getting a little risky close to the top, but you know he's escaping like it's nothing, no business right now. Now Vince, yeah. TSS Tetris, and kind of neutral with a, just a much more volatile neutral game even in this one than some of the other sets we've yeah. seen. It's like. Like, it's one thing to, like, have... Oh, that's Ooh, a rough Vince, this drop. Was bad. How no way it, it fixes it! What? The speed cheese demon right there. How does he get through that? God. It's like... Yeah, it's... Insane. Oh, oh no my way. god! Vince, no Vince way! Vince for that Tetris PC. Oh, he almost no had way. it, too. <laughs> I can't believe... I think he was gonna start DPC, actually. Oh, but the that. T. Okay, this DT, this is a little risky. This with yeah, the lag jutsu, it? but it's not yeah, great. Yeah, is, is that lag jutsu gonna out? punish? But, like, who's gonna get punished? Oh Lord, my god. Not yet. Lark's still in it. This, is, this match is crazy. Oh, this is. Okay, I'm a little worried for Blart again, yeah. Oh. Hanging on by a thread, just one little mistake, and it's uh, all over for either player. Right. Real question. Someone in chat mentioned how much you have to study patterns in order to be such an escape artist. I think a real quick, like, how much do you miss drop in order to become an escape artist? Like, you, it's like, if you're prone to miss dropping, then you're bound to learn a lot of, like, patterns that, like, allow such a flexible board overall. It's like, quite, quite crazy. It's like, it's like rather like than. I like the like, click up forward there from Blard a lot. Really good. Vince in a little bit of a tight spot. Able to get a down stack now, but Blard with the up stack, the clean 6-3. Ready to blaze through. Keep pumping yeah, it out. Yeah, but like, Vince getting out the counter spike and trying to keep back to back. Oh, Blard's got a little miss drop. Back 7, 8. Oh my god. The counter from Blard is unreal, but Vince still able to keep out this big pressure. Oh, almost having that insane multiplier there at the end too. I'm not, I'm not liking this 9-0, Vince. Just getting out of it like immediately, which is a pretty good decision. Yeah. A huge amount of bursts right now, but trying to cycle for the TPs. Has to skim. Will we get out? Keeping up and miss drops. That's not enough. Are you able to pull it through? Yeah, now it's 3-3. Three, three. Three. I can't believe it's only 3-3. Three, three. Like all these matches have been so long. This Yamushiro. Oh, but Vince gonna beat him with the PC punch here. Yeah. A nice Sick. little setup here from Blarg. Squeeze out a ton of APM. Starting to hit this oh, big three wide floating spam. Oh, he's so trying to get clean. a huge amount of pressure with that spike. Vince missed drops a little bit. Ooh, and Blarg keeps pressuring with that fractal. This is unreal. <laughs> oh, look at that perfect. Oh my Blarg. god. It's just not fair. It's just not fair. Yeah, but Vince but is Vince still, still keeping in it. Up. No way. Oh, but is it nice going to be enough? Prop. It was so close, and that's a... 
Blurred playing a textbook <laughs> picture perfect round right there. Genuinely, wow. Oh my god. Honestly, that one, that one, flip it, ship it, put it in the textbook. Dude. That one is your new study material. Actually, yeah. 280 APM. Unbelievable. What kind of insanity is this? Actually. Oh, this is. I don't have any words to describe other than crazy, insane. This, they're all understatements. This is we'll like... with a little bit of a pause. Oh, here. that's a lot of cheese. Okay. Yeah, he accepts a lot of cheese in doing that. Lord, yeah. again with this big up stack. Clean, ready to go. But now it's yeah, all clean for Vince, too. I think we're gonna get this big spike ping pong in a second here. This seems to be kind of dominating this. Oh this my god, what? You found, what, co okay, what? The combo extension. <laughs> oh, oh my, I'm barely surviving at top end. Oh, That's a no. rough mid -drop. Two missed drops at the top for Vince there. Super fast, gonna put him back behind. Four, now up five, three. You know, the crazy thing about this, so I have a pretty good computer, all things considered, you know, as far as Tetris standards go, right? I recently put the graphics back on high because I like that shockwave, you know? It looks pretty cool when you do a spike. I've never yeah. seen the game lag from so many shockwave effects as I have until now. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I think that, at least for me, Ooh, the, the biggest the issue with the, like, this is scary. shockwave is like, it's, it looks so intimidating. It's like, it you send like a 10 spike and it's like, oh shoot, I got sent a nuke. And it's like, <laughs> you start yeah. panicking. It does. It makes you feel really good when you get these big sends off, though. Yeah. Or the miss drops in the beginning, a little bit of a mishap, but set free and uh, back into this game. Oh, it's not maybe not free enough. And that's oh, a huge Vince amount there. Not getting out of that one. This is nuts. Oh this is God. crazy. This is like the last set. This is like the last set plus ten right now. This is crazy. Oh. <sighs> Man. Oh man, Bar getting it to some 7 2 stacking. He's hitting oh, that big yeah. LST. And. Dude, this is, this is insane. Stacking. Oh, but the four line from Vince. There's oh no way to find Vince. He's, he's gonna get garbage, out. At least. He's gonna need to try and find a way to get lower because if Bar no keeps up with alive. humongous spikes, then it might not be enough Bard, to stay please. that high. No oh, way. Oh no, that's a missed drop. But like. Pull it instantly into a multiplier spike. What an exchange! Yeah. <laughs> Password never will never get removed. <laughs> Password never removed. Actually, like unironically, it's like imagine if like people just like abused lag through in a Team TFD event. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, yeah. no, the bad ending. <laughs> oh, look yeah. at this huge down stack from it's this, this pressure from Blark. It's like it makes me unable to speak properly. It's crazy. Yeah, but Vince still somehow surviving it. He's got a cheesy board, and he's gonna be like, oh, Watch me go down through all of this. Don't care. Look at those hands go. He said, Blark's board is always so clean. Like, oh, yeah. Vince There's playing some absolute speed cheese right now, but Blart with this fractal yeah. Tetris upgrade, yeah, getting some 26 more. Fight, little misdrop of the last TP. I piece, think he missed the kill. Time. Yeah, he missed the kill with the first one, but he's still able to egg it out with the second one. Nice. Yeah. These big spikes. It's like all those attacks are like combined with the speed, they just chain together and become spikes. That's the craziest thing. Ooh, oh, okay, that's, that's a huge weird. PC and that's a Tetris PC! No way, he's trying to find another one! Yeah, Blarg's Can't still find in another it. One. That's so like, nuts. by the way, there's a really good LST pattern that Blarg's in there. Little known. Nice little fix for that bag oh. there. I gotta go back and watch that one. You know, oh, that, that is some rough book. misdrops by Vince. And I... Oh, oh but barely... Fighting I know we that, but like, that might... That's not enough. Not nearly, and uh, Blard moving ahead to 8 3 now, looking pretty serious, you know. But with how hard bot, you know, all these rooms are, I still yeah. think there's oh still hope God. for, you know, both these players to come out. Yeah. Oh, look at that, okay. These floating T spin upgrades from Blard, too clean. Yeah. Vince, looking for this multiplier, gonna find it yeah. incredible. Yeah, but I'm find another one! No way! Oh my god. 
bringing it back a little bit. 8-4. Proving yeah. there's still a lot of gas left in the tank. Yeah, I can't believe, though, so far the way to kill Blarg is do a huge multiplier spike and then do a, another huge multiplier spike. Alright, Blarg, Blarg with a 4.5 PTS MKO complete TSD. He is just like me. I do that too. That's crazy. Nice opener. Yeah, this is, this is uh, looking a little rough as we are at 9-4. And, and uh, Vince actually to get a bit of a power stack going. Trying to send a bit of cheese. And this drops a little. And manages to get out. And Blarg is still covered with cheese. And look at Vince's board. He just made a little bit of a tactical mistake here. Cleans it up super fresh. Look at that. Oh, yeah. look at the vision on that with the floating T spin. Might be a little greedy. Gonna pay off big time. Humongous. Oh my god. 27. It's still oh, pressuring even CDs. more. How does he see these? Yeah. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah, it's starting to close nine things five. off. This is a 9 5 here. Is, uh, you know, it's. You know, he doesn't have a ton of room to work with as uh, Lars does get closer and closer. Yeah, oh, that's one PC. He's bringing it back. Tries to find second one. The garbage oh, and a wag through. Flarg is oh. way too clean. That's match, match point. point. This is one. Oh boy. Oh. All we can do is watch. Yeah, all you can do is just like kind of watch and hold your breath. Vince with such a super greedy way to start things off. Finishing that one in all the way to the bank though. Pays off big time. He's got this huge spike ready. Oh, we missed. Cancel all of it. Trying to go for a C spin. No Ooh, way. That's way too risky. No way. No way. Just is he getting risky. out? No chance. Not with this SCSC lined up with Blarg. There's got to be way no, too much pressure, it... right? Yeah, it looks like it is. Holy. And uh, Blark, oh. moving forward, moving ahead, and this yep. well fought, crazy fought, 2,000 lines sent victory like here. 500 more? Genuinely a, a huge moment. What? Right here for, for the Blark, sir. Oh, hey, that was a great showing of both players. Ah. Oh. Really, I feel like I need like I need like a I need like a nap on the water after that. That was that was, <laughs> that was crazy. Holy. Oh my god, yo! Quick jet intermission. Could someone get the dot TTRM? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Whoa, no way. Bro, you were about five seconds too late. This is a Dazer. Dazer's still there. I know we can do oh it. Oh god, Dazer, click it, click it, Dazer, click it. it. He did it. Thank he, you. He, he, he saved all right, it. love you all. Thank you all for the support. Love you and. I'll Let's keep it going. Thanks. That's my dog. Yo, let's go. Yeah, my dog. <laughs> that was crazy. Oh. Uh, I, I don't know. Back, back to the camera. Oh, boy. <sighs> I'm, I'm genuinely in shock after that one. That's... True. All right. I wish Jed had mentioned that. That one is a big Blarg certified Friday moment right there. The realest madman, indeed. Could not let those be unspoken. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I. I don't know. I'm just still uh, like in disbelief. Like, and then like we just permanently be in disbelief as we keep seeing more and more matches. And I, like, every, everyone is crazier than the last, and it only goes up from here. It's just <laughs> crazy. Yeah. Oh, so it looks like we may be going to loser's bracket now. Uh... <laughs> True, I agree. You couldn't hear it. Skyfire and I just had a simultaneous uh, audio hallucination where, you know, that, whew, you know. That big, that big exhale after you've been holding your breath for a while. I agree yeah. with that one. <laughs> the crazy Dazer voice really? strikes again. Yeah. Hey, look at that. It's the bracket. It's crazy. And we've got an opponent for QMK. It's fan favorite, Kaboozled Pie. Kaboozled Pie. Did uh, Kaboozled Pie beat Simp Shrimp? 
to take that top eight drafts. But like QMK versus Cav as a Oh boy. It's a Alright, Dormy with the hot intel. No way. No way yeah, he did that, Dormy. No way. Is this the truth, Kaboozled? Then he beat QMK like 7 5 at one point. At least once. Dormy, honestly, coming in here saying tear down that wall. Going crazy right now. Oh, like, center four see. wide. Center four wide. Not only did he beat me, center four wide. Simstrom on match point. Game with him. That's crazy. Okay. How many points do I have? Let's see. I'll, all in one person. I don't know who it is. Well, I do know who it is, but I will not reveal who. But I went all in. That's all I'll say. Will we get an upset? Will we see something truly spectacular? We will see this match. <laughs> Hard to tell. Ow. Ah. <sighs> yeah, I agree. Just, ah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, like it's like kind of like. Oh wait, I know what the feeling reminds me of. It's like those Osu players when they stream, and then it's like, and then they're about to like full combo a map, and then it's like everyone's like, oh, no way, and then they're just holding their breath, and then like they do it, and then there's a like, hi YouTube, oh my God, no way. It's like. And then it's like that exact same feeling every time we watch these maps. It's like, no way. <laughs> like, <laughs> <it's> like, <laughs> holy shit. <laughs> Are you, am I watching <laughs> Osu or Tetria? Yeah, yeah, the Team TSD is the Osu stream. We are a, we're a top yeah, what one. Is it? <laughs> what uh, is it? As, as, as the old saying goes, be with Ikoro. Yeah. What is it? Plus two hundred and fifty. You know. Yeah. I don't know. Azer <laughs> has this magical ability to always catch me while I'm like moving or shifting around in my chair. It's really, it's really <laughs> oh, funny. No. It's really funny. Um, I always gotta, I always gotta go over and be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah but it looks like it's time for seat six and seat seven. Oh. Oh man, every time you see that long friend count bar, it's like so crazy. But like now, we see that like QMK, it's like, I would say we know him for being the tactical down stacker. And that's like, and he gets fight like Caboozled Pie, DPC, mid game, pro, something, volatile, something, something, pro player. And now we get to look at mid game as we begin with a PC and two. Eventually, LST stacking. Oh, that's a big cab spike. A little, yeah. Oops, the end there. And uh, gonna be a quick one, eh? Yeah, and now with the 10 second round, uh, like a QMK is going to be uh, at, uh, doing something real, real quick. And uh, yep. Be right back one minute. And, uh, in the meantime, it's like, I don't know, it's like, uh, stats are pretty interesting in general, but then it's like, like, one day someone is gonna go into, like, attorney, and then they're gonna, like, they're gonna have, like, two PPS, like, 60 APM, and they're gonna be seed one, or something like that. And then it's like, we're gonna compare stats right now. And then it's like, it's clearly like, it's 2 PPS is too slow. And then they go 6 PPS, and they're like... Yeah. Yeah, those stats are pretty legit. It's like... <laughs> yeah, I don't know, but... Whatever, it's like... Of course, like, people know that stats aren't everything, because, like... 
that's what we'll talk about, like, how much ATM you're sending, how much TPS you send, but it doesn't really showcase maybe, like, how would you use that APM? Like, how would you, like, prepare attack to, like, gain an advantage and stuff like that? Um, but now we're actually getting right into the match. And first to 11 of Caboozled Pie and QMK. The QMK beginning with a bit of back-to-back. -back. Try to get that C-spin. Managed to get it. And Cab is actually going, uh, 4.2. Three PPS. Just okay. Donation. Give that multiplier stack, but I'm a little. I'm looking a little cheese here that he's made some of his own. Let me get through that though. Yeah. Totally. Good. Ooh, another nice donation. <laughs> Keeping it clean. Yeah. Doing a QMK, doing a bit of down stacking while keeping back to back. Let's go. You love to see that. Yeah, it looks and Cab trying to find send some cheese with that seven combo. But oh, the QMK is doing a huge no, spike. No, not the TP fish drop. No. And trying to get the extra TP, and this is looking really oh. rough. Oh, that's oh, so from... unfortunate. Yeah, how quickly that one turns around. That one T yeah. fish drop. That's like the kill to like that first thing. That's a drop. Oh, that's a speaking of miss drop. Oh. It's, uh, it's gone. It's actually just gone. Yeah, no mist drops. <laughs> yeah. yeah, the mist drops are just fancy teaspoon setups, but that is a nice extension by QMK. Yeah, you see him pause there, going into absolute calculator mode. You yeah. Figure out this big combo extension at the end of this. Yeah. Holy, and that's a lot of pressure from Cab. Like, definitely is the. I wonder if it'll be too enough. Clean. It's too clean. Okay, finally gonna answer 1-1. One, one. Yeah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Another Ooh. missed drop bike, because it's a... The QMK oh, no. immediately at an advantage. He's trying to APM spam cap, and it works out. Yeah. The Puyo player is at a slight advantage. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, definitely oh, Cab trying to plan way too fresh with this LST. Yeah, but a little missed drop, but fixes it a little bit, but it's still not in a good situation. Oh, oh, oh. but he's okay. He survives. Okay. That's crazy. Let's go. Okay, kind of fishing for something, anything right now. I'm not. I mean, yeah. you know, nothing too crazy. Keeping it pretty simple, pretty basic. Pretty clean. Yeah, simplicity yeah. works sometimes. It's just too clean, you know. <laughs> like maybe a little too like slow, though. No way oh, he gets out of this. Speaking of which, oh, like this survival is unreal. Definitely, if like one thing is like trying to increase burst speed, it's pretty helpful if you want to get faster. Although that yeah. said, it's easier said than done, but like... Honestly, honestly, I'm in no position to be coaching QMK about anything, you know? Just like, <laughs> I'm in no you. position. Hey, hey, hey you're gonna, we're gonna tell... <laughs> what? Oh, Both players are yeah. super clean right yeah. now. How about this nice DC Tetris upgrade, saving his skin at the very top. Just yeah, slowly making like... his way down here. But Cab keeping up with those huge spikes, and QMK just can't get out. Just barely caught at the top, not quite having that full down stack, Goozle evening things out here. Yeah. If it looks like QMK is starting to get that burst speed out, speaking of which. And, uh. Or TTS QMK. Let's... Yo, let's go, that's the six back to that. The... Oof. Going crazy. Yeah. Super fast PCO here from Cab. Looking for that second PC, not finding it. Going into some crazy. I, I don't know. A little bit of a misdrop action kind of happening with Kabuzo there. I think he was looking yeah. for some interesting, uh, like DPC form I've never really seen before, but 
Finn finding this nice little juicy multiplier. Pretty good stuff right here. Good STSD yeah. upgrade. That's the TEC magic oh, right there. Oh, yeah. All the TEC yeah. work. Like, I think, like, the, one of the biggest thing I do enjoy watching QMK is the fact that, like, he has been, like, working, like, offense over, like, the months, and it's definitely gotten, like, significantly oh, better. Tower Goes... Oh, yeah. Oh, my... It's, like, definitely, like, showcased a lot more confidence, perhaps, and, like, definitely, like, it's really cool to see, in general. Bro, I'm so I can't believe this. He really did just walk up and and TSD and tower with the C spin at the bottom. He really just did that and Cab let him get away with it. It's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely. It's like I think it's like one thing that one common situation that tends to happen or go level you are is that oh, offensive Caboose. player, like slower player, then you'll tend to just like end up in situations where. Get a counter spike, your opponent's almost topped out. And then like you just and then you just don't have the extra bit of damage. And like so regardless of your speed, it like becomes important of like learning like like the fundamentals of like up stacking, regardless of whether you think you're slow or not. It's like super important. And uh the cab here with going at four PPS, speaking of up stacking, that's a huge amount of damage. <laughs> Yeah, how to do that is really consistent and yeah, really hard. Yeah. Ooh, I like this conversion from like the second PC thing to STSD from Kabooza there. Bit of a risky thing to do it, you know, always a chance to get one in ten from Stinky yeah. Dark, but always nice. Oh, okay, oh, playing with cap? absolute fire at the oh, top right there. Kaboozled, I don't know how you're still alive. Playing Damn. perfectly right now. Cab tanking that, that garbage instead of canceling might have been a bad oh, take. Man. Yeah, QMK's got that one anyway, though. That was crazy, though. <laughs> yeah, it's... <sighs> it's like... It's like, if you're trying to, like, be on the offense, it's like... It's like, you have to actually test, like, how much you can greed against certain opponents. Because, like, Cat clearly was, like, trying to... Like, he could get a... Thinking a little extra bit, but it doesn't work against QMK in this case. He's, He's just... like... He's just playing too freaky fresh right now, honestly. It's, yeah. <laughs> look at this board right now from QMK. It's just oh impeccable. And oh, okay, the STSD a little bit of greed. I, you know, yeah. but he's gonna at least be able to clear yeah. through it. Might have, uh, the day. might have, might have not read Q a little bit, but whatever. Managed to get out. Oh, the oh that's a Tetris Tetris upgrade conversion. From QMK. All right, that's crazy. Oh yeah, no, it's a three-seven. The oh wait, yes, what a TL match. Yep. Like That's oh, crazy, that is man. a PC, and oh, that would have been <laughs> Cap is going five PPS. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, but that oh, team missed drop. This is gonna be serious danger. Okay, yeah, the... he... all right, all right. The the Z spin triple. All right. Okay. Ah, uh, the efficiency from QMK. QMK is literally uh, just, he's lording right now, honestly. He's just yeah. playing at, like an absolute lord. Holy shit! He's gone beast mode, even. No way, that was, what a, that was a four wide moment. <laughs> Not that a four scratch. Wide is Not a scratch on QMK. Like, Cav trying to find any sort of attack or method he can if possible, but he might be having a bit of trouble because QMK seems to be able to defend against almost everything. Not a scratch, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this is yeah, but it looks okay. like okay. yeah, this is a lot, a lot of, of cheese. cheese. But like, he's probably gonna get out very soon. Kabuzel going crazy, kind of missing the teeth. He's been there, able to quickly get another one out here. Looking to try and keep this back to back up. Accepting a lot of this clean if you can get it. Oh, nice little spike developing here. Oh, this is bursting into a that lot of damage. And still, the cab is still continuing with back to back at eight. And huge spikes. But Ooh. like looks like they're back at neutral. Because, you see uh, that down stack at the end from Kabuz? Just a really fast little burst. That was crazy. Yeah. Holy. This is crazy. 
Definitely, like, how do you keep, like, how do you keep your board clean while upstacking? Like, it's like, if you're fighting against someone who is, refuses to, like, get topped out, then you have to get greedy. But, like, you can't, you also have to, like, have a way out to prepare for it, because if you cover up your holes all the time, go for it, then, like, QMK or anyone and just punish. Oh my god, it's going for limb oh, special moment? No way. No. Yo, 22 spike, no way! No. <laughs> a bad ending. This is the oh, bad ending. The bad ending. The oh. third comes uncanny. I'm actually dead. Oh my god. Double PC. QMK with a huge amount of damage and Caboose was low, jeez. Yeah. You know? We did. The... Ooh, okay, oh, alright. That, that, that is a nice but It's a nice T spin, it ain't gonna work out with that Q. But uh, it, you know, A for effort on that one. QMK yeah. taking that one back. A little a little mad, you know. I don't know about you, I'd be a little mad about that. <laughs> Here comes Caboose looking for that trademark. Yeah. I don't know why I say that. It's oh, been around for a while, but he's really made something out of this MKO start here. Yeah, if the cab's trying to pressure with that LST stacking. Oh, but the early second eye was oh, really good. Oh, manages to pressure just enough. Oh, look funny number. That's uh -huh. it. Yeah, very yeah. Nice. nice. Yeah, we have finally reached that point. You finally get the funny number. But. That funny number is important because maybe like there's a chance for Cab now. Uh, funny oh, number is important, but it's also which? fleeting. It's also fleeting, and now QMK at match point. This this is it. Oh, this is time to pull out the stops. You know, it truly has uh, the commentator's curse. Oh, uh, Listen, this person this won't win. Fire. You did it. Wasn't me. Don't look at me. I wasn't saying anything. <laughs> you did this. This evil's on you. Oh boy. Oh, it's like. Dude, it's like when I like, it's like when I told someone in the tournament to like, breathing manually and just... Shaky. Oh, no! at the very top. Not like this. Alright. <laughs> I'm so sorry Dang. for cursing the match. <laughs> you better yeah, what's that? Like, QMK no. wins with uh, six, with seven, excuse me, 11 points. Not seven. And uh... Oh, that was a good showing by both players. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely, definitely both players going crazy. That said, really nice, really nice uh, set to watch there. A lot of fun, honestly. <laughs> that uh, QMK able to string that one out. Very yeah. end was with uh, some kind of unfortunate mishaps. Yeah, the commentators curve gets it every single time. <laughs> It's like, I should, it should mean I should be commentator. I'll just curse everyone. And then, yeah, definitely. Okay. And no, I'm just kidding. So it well, looks like we do have a bracket ready where we see, uh, we are going to get, uh, I see, of course, Dia versus Blarg, but we see Firestorm versus QMK, the classic matchup. Yeah, this one happens and, like every time I'm commentating a tournament. It's really funny at this, <laughs> at this point, you know? I'm like, all right, it's the end. Time to check this one off the list. <laughs> yeah. And now, uh, Circu and Orange Juice are still going? Or just paused? Are, they, are we still in, like, every, I guess we're... You know, uh, I, I was hoping to see that one. I'm pretty sure maybe we will. I was hoping to watch that one. It's all. We might be watching it right now. Who knows? True. <laughs> like, yo. Shout out to a short Mexican with the big fat prime. I agree with what? Any primers? Let's see it. Yeah, seriously. Check it off your bingo board. Oh. Wait, predict. Ooh, this will be interesting prediction. Who will win? <laughs> Of course, no bias. That's big money on Cirque right now. There's no love for OJ. Very sad. What's up with that? What's up with that? 
Let's see, how much is, uh, how many channel points do I have now? 4,300, we'll go all in. <laughs> oh my god, that's exactly 4,300, no way. Oh wait, no, there's a Twitch bonus. Wait, I can bet even more. That's 50. Oh my god. There's Literally. Five pen strats right there. God, everyone with like no hope in OJ. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> uh, that's a uh... holy. Holy. <laughs> JK. Ah, <sighs> but like, I might be curious about like how that match will go. I don't know. Would you? I don't. I don't know, I like, kinda know things about OJ, and I know that like, in, in like, PL, he's actually like, pretty high rank, but like, I don't actually like, know anything about like, their current playstyle, actually. You know, like, I don't either. I'm gonna be honest yeah. with you, total unknown, kinda going into the night here. We're about to find out though. I'm like, yeah. in the lobby. That's it, man. It's like, OJ is good at perfect clears, and then I remember one time, like I said, oh, they're plonk heavy to someone who's trying to fight them, and then when and then like the and then the person who was fighting them lost, and he's like, Bruh, he was, he, he was just he was just going like full PPS or something, he's like, oh, whoops, <laughs> and so I, I, that was like a long time ago. Let's see about now. You know, it's, it's, it's very curious. See, like, will Circu take it as most people would expect, or will OJ make an upset? For this is. Oh, I wonder what will happen. <laughs> Just <sighs> yeah, uh, I can't really say much about this match other than looks like both players have joined a lobby. Yeah, we're in it almost. Oh, looks oh, like nice. OJ is top twenty. Collecting vital, vital information about the players right now. Indeed, second, you know, gotta give you those big up to date fun facts, or else what's the point? Indeed. <laughs> Yeah, that is a, with a very nice efficiency from OJ, looks like. It's, uh, it's, we'll see very soon. But, like, Yo, it's a big triangle. It's almost entirely filled out. That's crazy. I am, let's see, Serky says that he's drinking his next opponent. Also, love YouTubers. 2D and 3D. 2D and 3D. And uh, OJ likes turtles. Oh, greater. Oh, shoot. <laughs> it looks like that's crazy. Too low risk. <laughs> you know, all I gotta say is that's a lifestyle. You know? That's a lifestyle. It is what it is. Yeah. <laughs> Liking turtles to blasphemy. No way. I I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. Well, it looks like uh, we're starting to get a warm up going, perhaps? Yeah, that's it. That's the one. Yeah, and now... Circuit Circuit with that with mountain is stacking. Stacking, and uh... Oh, that's a PC for... That's yeah. Stacking. Gonna bop the PC off of MS2 real quick there. Yeah. Oh. It looks it's like... <laughs> pretty Circuit. neutral game, but... OJ is going at almost basically two PPS. Oh boy! This is very, very uh, kind of floating, very free on his board, just kind of like waiting, kind of dancing around almost, just kind of waiting some moments and then just flying all over, just all over the yeah. board. It's crazy. <laughs> Looks like a very uh, low tension match. Feels like 
definitely like we don't we haven't seen these players truly go their full speed and pressure so like not me now we will with this match that's about to begin <laughs> holy and now we're off Oh, that's and another the massive picking moment. And there go a Epic garbage moment, too. Oh. Look at this. Oh, God. Oh, oh. that's a little bit of a misdrop. But, like, Turkey, you doing a decent job fixing it. I'm trying to get the STSD. Oh, come on, the garbage again. Oh, my crazy. God. Are we going to get out? Oh, my, just barely. Playing oh, so God. risky right now. OJ putting out so much pressure. Yeah, Who's actually gonna take the first one? That's crazy. Oh right. That was first blood. No. Ah, <laughs> oh, that. Bro. Okay. Don't tell yeah, me, he's... Circus. He's just gonna do this. He's, he does this every opener now. Must be. We only <laughs> MS2 now, right? Huh. Oh no. What do you guys like? That's the hit cool trendy month thing. <laughs> Oh yeah, this is the new DT cannon, basic. Or is it literally like a better DT cannon in a sense? Like just literally sending a C spin. It's like... I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't know. <laughs> They're pretty close. I think if anything, I you, you know you can definitely prefer it to DT because you're gonna get garbage in the middle. Where you can you know there's a higher probability. It's a little bit cleaner to do with that. Whereas the PC is a lot more consistent. That's the deal. I don't know. There's probably a lot of good things to actually do it. Yeah. He does this every game now. Yeah, I don't know. Feels like he's experimenting with it or something. But like... Uh... Ricky barely getting to find me that fix, but OJ was a little bit of a... misdrop and a rough board. Ricky trying to go... a bit at three back-to-back -back with a huge spike. But OJ finds a huge down sack with a lot of cheese. Oh, Is Zergy trying to go for some back to back and OJ was trying to go for back to back but has cheese on his underboard? Oh, no, that cheese about is Zergy's no position here. Yeah, I wonder. This is... Uh, this is gonna. Now OJ takes a second point. But who knows what will happen? Because this is just the beginning. It's, uh, generally the first few rounds is when you figure out your opponent. And anything can go. Like, you could be like... Like, 2-6. Like, in like a first to seven. And then you could suddenly just sweep all, like, like the next nine rounds. It has happened. Ooh, look at this like, big spike coming in. Holy. Hey, okay. it's like you barely surviving. Yeah, but, but now, like, that is, uh... Now. Dude, that, that's like crazy efficiency with OJ right there. That's like more efficient than Cirque right now. What? Like, it's a litter. They're literally. What? It's literally like almost like. Like 180 APM at like. A 3 PPS at one point. Yeah, definitely so like, putting out some work right now. It's super clean. Yeah, truly, Cirque is lagging. Oh, oh not the DC. Okay. Oh, Cirque oh, with no. the, the Omega <laughs> lag jutsu back to back 25 Omega. spike. This is I so cursed. I wish I saw whatever happened. That's so cursed. <laughs> with the, you know, the old reverse DC cannon. It's like. Oh, uh, yes. Awesome game. Yeah, definitely, uh, I don't know, uh, how hard Circu is taking this match, though. Because definitely, like, because <laughs> literally just that last round, he was just back-to-back -back 20. Like, what? <laughs> He's just focused on keeping back-to-back, -back and it's actually... So, like... I do wonder whether... It will happen if Circu keeps playing like that. And that uh, OJ in a rough board state with no way out. Unfortunately, making an attack. It's like. I don't know. At least for me, when I like. 
were to consider making building an attack like that, high, then like be like need to consider like do I is, is like I'll either get the attack or I go for this like twelve spike that can kill it. It's like Ooh. it's just uh that's what I mean by Plan B getting out. I think, uh... Are you already yeah. up two rounds in the time you've been talking about that, by the way? Just, just yeah, I right. know. Here. Um, yes, quick little crazy. reversal now, 4-3, bagging two quick, like, 10 Oh, seconds. that's a PC! Oh, but, like... Not enough OJ kill. To get this. Should be the nice little floating upgrade there. Gonna keep out the big 7-2 stack, really turning on the pressure right now. The big yeah. new LST that he's been crazy about lately. OJ trying to get a big spike going, sent a little bit of cheese, and Cirque missed dropped a little. Let's see. Spike gives a little opportunity for OJ to send a bit of cheese, and OJ is starting to send a bit of pressure. But Cirque is all the way down, and the, the tides might just reverse. So Cirque Ooh, is with this quite the material cross. Yeah, that will fractal new oh my Nice God. upgrade, but very greedy from Cirque. He's really cycling for these two T pieces oh. and the signature big down stack. Tetrio. Yeah. Gonna be enough. We're all yeah. a bit ahead now. It's like. It's like, you could go for the most greediest setup possible, but as long as you. It's like, you gotta build like a triple. Piece and hold, then like it's probably fine, anyways. It kind of it depends on the situation, but like, yeah, it's, it's like if it's greedy, I'd say like that's it usually means that you're you have to commit to something and build it all the way, or else it doesn't work out. But Ooh. speaking of which, that is uh, yeah, huge that's a huge 20 kind of situation where it does work out. Like, you see, OJ really piling on some pressure right there, so you're kind of waiting with this fractal Tetris. Able to chain down through that cancel off and then down into some of the garbage. Huge multiplier at the end there to take that round. Yeah. Now again with this just amazing garbage. Oh my god. And trying to keep back to back again? That was it too was... risky. Sure no, no, no. It's working out. It's totally working. <laughs> no way. Oh my god. Just a That's... crazy burst right there. OJ barely in a nice down stack to stay god. alive. It kind of really makes nice you point. think that uh, OJ is going to need to s try to find some more pressure somehow just to prevent like Zerky from being able to do this stuff. But it's... <laughs> yeah, this is uh... <laughs> not looking good. It's like, so like, trying to tank the garbage. Really. Definitely an interesting decision right there, but it pays off a little bit nicely in the beginning of things here for Sir Q. No, for a long time, well, I but... love that super idol in the chat. Yeah. yeah. Oh, another practice Sir Tetris trying... along combo. Look at this yeah. huge attack. Sir Q literally waiting to, like, tank that garbage by just keeping on upstacking. This is, like... Almost like he's kind of waiting for OJ to empty the tank a little bit, the attack, tank as much as he can, and then at the same time he's also like cycling to get like, oh. a T, like his T's and I's in combo, just so he can do these huge mega spikes. But the yeah. two PC is not enough to take out Cirque. OJ struggling at the top a little bit, but like they're going to get back down. Yeah, definitely like a good strategy is like, especially if you're, I mean this is not really the case, but it's like, if you're fighting someone who's like generally like will wait for you to do something, like they will have like a Tetris ready to cancel with, then like you just keep you just keep building up your attack or something green. It's like they will be forced to attack or else they just die. Usually. <laughs> I think that's like pretty cool tip. And uh Turkey is speaking of which trying to go for more greed. And that sends a little cheese that's non existent, apparently. Like, and that, but like OJ trying to get the damage going, might be a little uncertain about the piece placement, perhaps. And now they're on pure defense. A Circu is actually sending so much pressure right now. He sent another bike. That's a match point. Yeah. 
think you're looking pretty dominant right now. Yeah. Definitely a thing to note is that, like, you could be the same speed as someone. Is like you can both be three PPS, but it's like one player would will like hesitate at three PPS, while another will just keep on going. And really, the like, hesitation is definitely a big part of like proficiency. Four wide. <laughs> oh my god, is he gonna get it off? Is he gonna? No, yeah, I don't think he does. But like, in fact, oh, in fact, it kind of backfires. In fact, it actually might backfire. Both, unless like, but like, a little bit. Turkey is yeah. actually, Turkey is playing uh, like, uh, oh, <laughs> lag through. <laughs> Why? Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. Yeah, but it's like two point three PPS by Circu. It's like, oh my god, he's going for it. But as a uh, Interesting. He's got really good wide. garbage for this. He yeah, pull this him. off. Uh, not that meme, Sturkey, No, not that meme. I don't know. This is questionable. He's yeah. not even trying, man. Yeah, <laughs> come on. It's like, what is this? He he's very confident in his abilities. What is going that. on, Sergio? It's like he, he's like it's like the thing is he's like so many around. Experimenting with this, it's not. It's like, well, he does get punished for it, but it's like, at some point, like he's bound to like go back to try hard mode. This one's for yeah, like, looks like he really wants to get this limb special off. But it looks like he's actually getting into LST. Okay. He's... And now, very fast LST here. Yeah, it looks like LST things has, are starting has... to get back to normal. And, uh, OJ is actually going faster at 3.6. Okay. And, uh, Sergio is, uh, in a rough board state. Trying to cycle for a T-spin as OJ does a spike. It looks like... Ah, man. So much is going on. It's like... Oh my god! It's 28 spikes! No. That is one way to go right there, OJ. Oh, now the moves got to the very top. I can't believe that he actually would have gone. <laughs> we're we're going to miss drop, but like... Yeah, that was a good showing from Orange Juice, as we see, like... And Sir Q, definitely, like... Ah... <sighs> Definitely, <laughs> oh no, it's, it's a crazy match in a different way, it's like, uh, it's very yeah, quite a finish. Quite a finish right there. Uh, yeah. Finishing up, really good run, uh, not quite all the way for orange juice, definitely still great showing as uh, Circuit moves on, going the tournament. Yeah, I think Circuit is facing... He's either facing Firestorm or he's facing Vince, one of the two. Vince, right? Because uh, we have the Firestorm versus QMK match. Ah, that's true. Yeah. It looks like. True. Let's see. DL versus Blark, Firestorm versus QMK, and Vince versus Circu. Let's see. It's like, who will take number one? Who will take top three? We'll find it. <laughs> I wonder how this match will go. Okay. Time. No, Ooh, looks like we bit. might. We're at a little bit of a break, but <laughs> as we're preparing another match. And, uh... Yeah, continuing yeah. on with the circulation story here, as we'll get right into that next game here versus Vince HD. Indeed. Huh. 
Okay, and now they're looking for a warm up. And uh, let's see. Um, honestly, like, I don't know. I think I should just discuss about like what I think about like the players when we actually get stats or something. Or like, definitely, I'm, overall, I'm kind of unsure about how this match will go. I think they're pretty strong in their own, in their own regards. Let's... <laughs> yeah, definitely the stats are not the full picture. This set here. Uh, this one is going to be certainly a hard fight. Either player. Yeah. And definitely two regularly seasoned. I feel like I've seen them before play them, you know, play each other, but, you know, I'm not quite sure. Uh, yeah. but, uh, certainly pretty, pretty big powerhouse matchup coming up yet again. Yeah, definitely. So I, I'd say, like, in general, Circu seems to have a lot more consistency when it comes to Pete's placements. But, like, Vince definitely has, like, a lot of speed and a lot of ability to back it up. Both players can be pretty volatile. You know, like, and it's hard to see who will edge it out. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> indeed. Indeed. We now have triangles. <laughs> okay. Fifth seed versus second seed. Interesting. <laughs> uh, There's that down. big bar every time. It's so yeah, funny. Every, every time. Yeah. I think yeah, really quickly, all right, while we get this big epic warm up, I don't feel like spoiling the surprise. So, uh, <laughs> real quickly, Circulation has apparently forgotten how to play Tetris. Uh, Vince repping that Philippine Wi Fi. Oh, but, uh, Wi -Fi. while we get into this little warm up here, I'm going to take a quick bath and break. Okay. Hopefully, it's not all two second hard and I just missed things, but I will be right back. Yeah. And okay. And so now I will take care as a solo commentator, JK. It's, a, it's like, looks like we're in our warm up. Man, that like, literally that friend count, it's like, it's penetrating like, like so hard that it feels like it's gonna extend to my second. Month. It's like, oh my god, that's the, that is the PC by Vince. And Circu is. Currently, looking looking like warmed up. Trying to get, obviously warmed up for the last match, but looks like he's planning to take this match a lot more seriously. And Vince is ready here. Just who knows? Just get warmed up. <laughs> you know, would the would the Filipino Wi-Fi cause problems? Real cool. It's not a not a skill game. It's all about Wi-Fi. It's like your opponent disconnects, and uh, how unfortunate. So it looks like Vince takes this round with a big, with a big spike. Definitely, who will win this match? And predictions are up, and uh, we're ready to see. Yeah, we saw. I mean, predictions were up a while ago, but like. Well, now let's get ready to see who is going to win. <laughs> but, very curious of how this will turn out. Currently, I see we'll begin with a bit of voting. And there's a bit of lag, but whatever. And now the match begins. It's uh, Sir Q and Vince. It's a Sir Q beginning with. Mount is stacking and Vince going for PCs makes me wonder whether Mount is stacking is necessarily the best choice. But like, Turkey Mancing is managing to send a lot of cheese, but like, is not ready for this combo. And Vince has such a clean board to deal with that it's like, just you wait. <laughs> it looks like he manages to handle that spike. And Turkey is focusing on trying to keep back to back. And Turkey gets pushed to the top, and Vince is, might just get another spike out of nowhere. Definitely, like, it does look like Vince is definitely playing, like, a bit slower than, like, what we've seen before at around 3 PPS. Or a bit. Actually, playing slower than Circu. So, like, definitely, like, 
though the misdrops are quite rough and he's trying to do a little convert that what the oh my god no way that's the 39 spot no way no way he's still going he's already dead no no way no. Oh my god, that's... Big actually, the bang. Yeah, it really is, actually. Welcome back. Because, uh... This is truly quite the banger match, but Vince has a ton of misdrops, I wonder... I don't know if we can get through this. This is looking a little rough. Yeah, I don't think so, I think. This is... Definitely, this is, uh... I'd say, like, this is definitely, like, a win condition that Turkey may or may not be able to take advantage of. It's, well, like... It's just big immediate like that. Like, it's kind of goal with the MS2 is kind of bust out that attack and chain together some yeah. garbage. Yeah, Vince trying to go for a very... Cool. Has to skim out of it and manages to get out, but does a quite a big spike, and Turkey is at the top. Turkey so barely surviving at the top. Running a really clutch down stack, not quite out of the water yet. And then still in some trouble too, though. And with a down stack like that, it definitely. Turkey going crazy with that one. Dang. Yeah, like, we're, I was saying how it would be quite the rough match, or be hard to tell who would win. It really is showing. It's like, I don't yeah, know. Pretty, pretty good back and forth. Like, I went all in on someone. And, uh, I don't know if it'll backfire or it'll reward me. <laughs> but DL, or not DL, Turkey just getting just some epic RNG garbage right there. Able to go off like crazy. Hack. <laughs> Hacker moment. Yeah, hacking the mainframe. Let's go. Begin with a bit of mountain stacking and finds the PC, but fortunately has a garbage. garbage. Yeah, look at that one. Good. Trying to do a bit of tanking. That's a lot of tanking. And Turkey trying to get a bit of burst in. But it's gonna need a cycle to another T piece. So Vince in a very rough situation. It's now 4 1. Cirque's starting to get these decisive counter spikes. In this kind of early middle game here, and it's proving to be pretty pretty effective so far in these yeah. first five rounds. Oh, yeah, but like that that is he's not cooperating. Commentator's curse moment. But wait, is he getting out? No. Wait. No way, he no. might. He actually might. He actually. No he, way. He, no, 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 no. No, he. There's, a, there's still a chance. No. That's an escape right there. That's a clean escape, clean getaway right there. No. This is. Rob a bank and not a, not a day in jail. Definitely, this is the. Uh... This is like... you take it off. Really getting this kind of janky up stack. Vince keeping it. I like what I see from Vince here, but. He's gotta find a bigger down stack than that. Yeah. Ah, <sighs> is it definitely like the bursts that Vince do are kind of like I don't know, they're either like a hit or miss, where those bursts can be super lethal, but like if he miss drops then 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 like it becomes like super rough. Oh my god, it's some yeah. crazy risk taking from Circuit here that I don't know if I really vibe with, honestly, but he's still in the game. He's able yeah, to but find the PC. Vince's gonna try to find another one. I think he missed PC. Show me a classic yeah. Tetrio moment. Find them yeah. in the game PC. Oh, it's just crazy every time. <laughs> yeah, but like, no. Oh, but the mid game LST from Circuit, this is huge. Yeah, but we Vince is the one it. being pressured really hard. This is looking kind of dangerous. Circus is not stopping anytime soon with this back to back right now. Yeah, but like, Vince is trying to burst out and manages to barely get out, but his board is a little rough. And right now it's just really, completely fixed. I'm a little, yeah, I'm a little sussed out by that. So if you really wanted to keep the back to back chain alive, and kind of that 9 rail was very risky. Yeah. But this huge multiplier, this nice multiplier, setting up the donation way in advance with TSC Tetris is crazy. Really good Holy. vision. Holy. Vince just oh, a little too Oh, that is a lot of greed. Yeah, Vince just a little too overpowering at the very end there. Holy. 
Yeah, it's uh, definitely like, oh my god, that PC. It's, uh, but it's gonna be kind of rough for Vince because like Cirque has a lot of weapons at disposal that could like. But I think like the biggest thing is the fact that like the biggest weapon is like Vince himself, which may be like. But like it's other than that, it's... the very end. <laughs> Oh god, this uh, risky up stack. This is... Yeah. Scary, a like, really scary situation here. Force cancel out at the very top. I'm like it. Oh. Barely escaping, not gonna be able to get the despin in time, and Vince clawing his way back. I do think that one thing that Vince definitely is able to, like, can capitalize on is, like, if Cirque gets too greedy. Especially, like, if he's up stacking at the top, then, like, Vince has a good chance of dealing a huge spike, and that might just be it. A little bit of weird bag for the MS2 that round for Cirque. If yeah. they get back into this mid game and get through that, Vince with this nice floating T spin upgrade into the Fractal Tetris, ready to get back to the LST there. Yeah, but really now fighting back right now. We're starting to see a little bit of a comeback going. Um, I'm not like, will we see it all the way come through? I'm, not, I'm just trying to like add words to what I'm saying so I don't create commentators curse. I don't know. I think it's too late. <laughs> I think it's too late. Second, <laughs> struggling through that MS2 again. So Rupert solves Vincent with yeah, just but amazing like, well, the pressure. That is a huge amount of cheese and now... Like, Vince is trying to get a huge power stack going he and that's 25 it. spike. He finds it. Vince evening things out here. 5-5. Oh, like, five, five. Yeah, Vince is definitely starting to like, like get like into a rhythm right now. Definitely yeah. like that mid game four wide was incredible right there. The two PCs not enough. They got Cirque this round, only arming with a lot of good garbage. But Vince striking first. Yeah, he holy. doesn't even need that T-spin triple. Yeah, it's and now the tides have turned again. Vince it's like, activating right now. Yeah, in demon it's, mode. Definitely like. Vince's like power stacks are just like the most insane thing that like he can capitalize on or take advantage of in general. It's like he's flying really close to the sun there. Circuit also has some nice APM self. Really good upgrades. Both players getting through that opening phase. Like I'd say like one of the biggest problems with back to back sometimes Ooh, is like that like if that like the fact that you actually need to do a bit of cycling to be able to like, keep a T piece in hold and such. And if you're caught out at just the wrong moment, then you just punished. And meanwhile, like Vince's stacking in general allows him to actually like get out a lot easier and may not necessarily be like consistent pressure, but at least like he has a way out and he can still deal a lot of damage if he manages to pull it off. Speak uh, speaking of which, Vince is in a very rough situation, and I don't know if he's getting out. He barely gets out. No way. Oh my god. Gives the T-piece, and Cirque is trying to keep back-to-back, then back-to-back 11. Oh, Vince be at the punish. Vince is just primed right now to go. Look at this board. Going a little greedy, I think, for the STSD, but gets both the T-pieces in there. It's a huge combo. Big pressure. Pays Very good choice, actually. Definitely, uh, Vince needs a spike. Stopping right there was a serious kind of misstep, I think, or like kind of hung up on some way to move forward. Let's circuit escape. Yeah. Oh, again, there's this huge clean well on Vince's board now, ready to take advantage of. Yeah, this is, uh. This is where uh, Vince starts to take advantage of his burst speed a lot. Definitely, like, their burst speed is definitely allowing him to get into. get more greedy in general. And uh, he gets away with it. This gets how fast he's going. Oh, now Vince is really turning on the Jets. A little bit of mischief. Yeah. That's not making him actually right into some more clean stacking. Really well fixed. Actually. But now, okay, this oh, is but that's speed. a bit of pass through, it seems like. Oh, I'm not able to get out of that. Circuit so barely. Oh. Really fighting to stay this one. This one's neck and neck right now. 6 6. Yeah. yeah who's going to win? Oh, God. This is like. Very hard to tell. Consistency yeah. versus volatility. It's like 
Cool, went out. Like, oh, Vince looking to upgrade the Fractal Tetris and another one. Yo, yeah, that's a huge good. 25 spike, and I don't think Circuit's getting out of that one. Be a really good thing for, uh, for Vince to secure the kill there, had a series of misdrops at the very end. And now the chat is absolutely screaming. Yeah, it's trying to crazy. like, yeah, it's like this match is actually so close and not even funny. It's like, yeah. and those huge like finds from Vince just changed that even more and more. That's a, nice that little, a thirty. Like, I still prop there, but Vince caught kind of in a weird spot here, and I don't think he's yeah. gonna get out of this one. Circuit's no, pressure 230 APM, way too much. And uh, bringing it back just again, 7-7. Seven, seven. This one, I feel like could go. Yeah, this, this feels like it can go either way, but... That one... Definitely looks like uh, Circuit's spikes are definitely a lot um, cleaner in general. It's like, like, he'll try to mix in like, the cheese, but like... But like, really, like, Vince's tower stacking is like, oh, speaking of tower stack, that is a misdrop. On wrong. That's a square. Ooh. On wrong. Circuit not stopping. Yeah, it's like... Like, just to send so much cheese that you, even, like, you can't cancel it, it's like... Definitely, like, that is, like, a menace to, like, deal with. But like, looks like Vince is going with a bit of DT cannon, trying to get a bit of multiplier, but he's gonna have to cycle quickly. Not the quick enough. Circuit way too fast the opening game right there. Fire going off with the immediate return. Garbage right out as soon as he gets it. And that's gonna put things 9-7 now. Is uh, Circuit finally with a little bit of quantifiable lead? We'll see how long that lasts. Uh, as we get a little bit closer to this set, Vince, two PCs. Not, not enough. It never is this level anymore. Yeah, that... huge counter. Oh, and that, yeah, now it's a uh, match point, and yeah. um, some people's points are gonna go down to drain. Who knows? It's, yeah, uh... this could be it right here for Vince the tournament tonight. Maybe yeah, it's to be. There's unless I have a fight to go. Circuit tanking is perfect clear with the MS2. Looking for the down stack, not able to finish it off the multiplier. Still able to get a good combo out though. Yeah, oh, but this fast is dropped. This is scary. You can never give up on Vince. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. He's powering through this down stack right now. Yeah. A lot of persistence. Both players. Yeah, the circuit's board is looking a little scary. He's going with some serious commitments right now. Clears it out yeah. real quickly. Vince on the ropes. Vince put really good down stack. Immediately. Come right back down. Definitely. Oh, oh no! Vince with these misdrops. Oh, but oh, he gets a full board and Wait, a crazy is he gonna get away with it? Vince gets away with it. Oh my it. god, that's a huge Vince spike! Wait, this huge wait, spike. is it <laughs> crazy? Vince playing out of his mind right now. Holy, those fixes are like actually a god, and that's another misdrop. Oh, but it's not even gonna stop him. This quick S spin right there. Oh, this Vince is barely surviving. honestly really scary. Yeah. No way. No way he's still in this. Oh, the delayed kind of this crazy finds right now. Oh, that's a 10 though. combo. Well, we've been managing to cancel, but that's this. a huge... <laughs> Look at this. Circuit is what? all the two spins right now. But that's a 20-spike, and that's not going to be enough. But Vince is preparing with huge amounts of... That's a 12-spike, and that's 7 back-to-back. Right. -back. This is crazy right now. Dude, this is actually the battle what's back. Go, what is going on? This is insanity. I don't know. Vince is Vince still keeping back to back. How? He's too clean in the middle. 15, 17. He's still going. And... No 19, way. 20. <laughs> That's 20 back. That's 20. That's a... What? That was nuts. <laughs> oh, God. Dude. That's... That's, the... That's so crazy. That's like... That's the yep. kind of round that Vince is going to have to play every round from here on out. Yeah. Definitely, this is, uh... You'll never... The match is not over until it's over. It's literally it. You never give What's up. What's going to happen now? But, like, oh my god, now it's, uh... Now it's really time for Circuit. Circuit kind of sweating a little bit as, uh... Yeah. He doesn't get it now, it's going to be deuce time. 
Yeah, it might be a quite a problem <laughs> if we get into Deuce. It's really so mounting it's... crazy effort here. Right. But Turkey yeah. beginning with a lot of cheese there. <sighs> trying to do a bit of up stacking quite high up. Managing to get it right down. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, this is uh honestly really nerve wracking. Like yeah, my face is glued to the screen right now, honestly. Cool. Yeah. Vincent. I'm barely surviving right now. Vince with this big pressure, I think Vince is gonna do it. No way! Vince! No, I oh so my good. god! We're a deuce. That's a deuce! No way! Yo, we actually did it! No way! All those 11 fives, 11 sixes, this is what you waited for. This is truly the moment. Is this the first time we've gone to deuce? I think. It sure is. Oh, oh it's my. crazy mode tonight. Yeah, Cirque and now... Is mega up stack. This is crazy. Cirque is really looking to end it early right now. Yeah, this but like Vince... Uh... A successful down stack. And now Vince Cirque just keeps you... pressuring. Oh, no way! No way! At the last second, now Vince match Cirque. point. Could this be it? Yeah. It's now or never for gonna... regulation to get back in the game here. He needs to have the leave in himself with confidence and stuff. Quick I don't know. PC. So like, is so much clean garbage. Definitely, Vince definitely tried to give it his all. Just, and like, Ooh. oh, and that's a rough miss drop. Oh, oh and now we're back, back at Deuce. The game. Back oh in the game, God. baby. <laughs> this match is actually 11, bro. Both players in first to 11. Who wins? It's crazy. Holy, Holy what? He's <laughs> Both players basically did the same opener. Vince trying to keep that back to back. He's gonna have to skim. So like, it's... oh my god! Ooh, with this fractal. Oh, and that's a huge 16 down. spike. That's more damage. Vince is trying to pump out even more. With this crazy counter port, the very top of Cirque he saved his skin. The very top is still chance. Oh. That's a oh, rough miss drop. Art. Yeah, Vince with a little bit of art right here. Yeah, but Cleans it up, puts it away, just... back in storage. Yep, both players trying to get through some cheese right now. Yeah, so it looks like... Tricky. We've got a lot of clean right now, if you can get to yeah. this, but it's... Nah, I don't know. Tricky is being pushed up, but Vince has a slightly messy board. <laughs> Vince trying to go for an extra T-spin. And both players seem to be back at neutral. But it does look like Vince is starting to take the initiative. And will Cirque get out? And oh again, my god. You're for Vince. Like, actually, oh my god. What the heck? This is like... We're back at match point. Ah, this Yo, is truly... Hello, Stacky Awards 2022. Hello. Yeah. I, I cannot imagine, good. like... Maybe how, like, if, like, these players are, like... How nervous these players are. Or if, like... I mean, they have a lot of, like, tourney experience in general, but I'd say, like, even this situation, where it's, like, so close, it's, like, it's hard to tell. You know, like, Vince with a lot of cheese, is now just gone. He's just up-stacking. So, like, Ooh, wow, that's a stack. nice combo for Vince. It's not enough. Cirque really applying the pressure now. Going with this fractal Tetris, looking to upgrade yeah. more. more oh, and that's a huge spike! Back to the deuce, 12-12! 12, 12. Oh my god! No, no, no one's giving up! <laughs> no one's the giving up! The show goes on. It is truly a battle of determination. Oh, oh. wait, both get PCs! All right. They both got the PCs. Holy... They've been tanking. Trying to clean up his board, but like, Cirque was a back to back of six. This is nuts. And, uh, yeah. It's like, every match is so nuts. Oh, but Vince with this big down stack. This oh my like... god. And that's enough pressure. We're... That's 200 This is a match point again. Dude. This is insane. You gotta stay focused, even in your head. That's. Who will give out first? Insane speed. Definitely. Like playing with some serious might right now. 
Oh man. Oh Vincent no. I peed. Oh my god. It's all Zerky. Oh my god. No! Zerky getting too greedy! No! That's game! That's game! No way! Dang, son. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> that wow. match is like that. We need to save that. We re That's like what? <laughs> oh, holy shit! All I can say is like, oh, wow. Like I, I, I saved a replay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pause, 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 pause. Uh, save replay, save replay, save replay, save replay. Oh. Wow. My... Oh my god, oh my god, that was the craziest shit ever, 22, it just started, 22, Team TSD, don't oh. you cut, that's all I'm saying, say replay, thank you, love you, bye. Oh. Love what? you so much, please save replay though, send that to me, Jed, uh, yeah. jedxo at gmail.com, thank you, say it, thank you. <laughs> Jedxd, Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> shake, I'm like shaking, quaking, and... Oh, well, that God. was nuts. Dude, that's like, what the hell? Becky Awards 2022, let's go! Really? Showing up. Oh my God. <laughs> Holy shit, X. Just God, wow. Looks like people's channel points are safe and other people are in ruins. Holy. Yeah. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. What a hard one to predict, you know, and then going down to, you know, um, 12 12. Just unbelievable. Ah. Man. <laughs> like, even my heart. Like, like, how many more matches are there? Too many? All right. It's like, like, come on, I wasn't even, that one was so, that crazy, and it's not <laughs> even in place. Yeah, I, I, I don't like, know. Azer in chat admitting he's still shaking like the rest of us. Vince yeah. is like, oh, why? Vince, you don't understand what you just did. That was monstrous. That was crazy. Oh, yeah, that was uh, actually a monster of a set. Like, honestly, like... It's so volatile to imagine that I don't know what to expect. It's like God, like what? I mean that's what happens with Vince is like he has those like huge like pop off moments and it's so crazy when like he can keep it consistently. It's like God, I don't know what Turkey putting up a, ch a fantastic show as well. It's like actually so close. Really? Which, yeah, truly like quite the efficiency master. If anything. Just that. Great set. Uh, Vince moving forward. Now Firestorm QMK okay. fighting it out. Who will be facing Vince? That's that man. I've been going all in for literally all the bets. It's, I hope I don't get. <laughs> oh wait, I got ten more channel points. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, bet more. Bet more. more go. Betting pool. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like if you don't commit. Oh no. Here's like, a curveball. I'm gonna wait until the betting is closed. I got a little curveball. You know what? I'm not gonna wait. I'm lazy. You, and you know what? I'm thinking QMK is a solid shot at this one. Way more than way more than the best man fly. You know? I saw the we saw that Firestorm gameplay a little bit earlier. Uh and, you know, maybe because it was Diao. But uh it kinda kinda got pounded on it right there, you know? And uh I will say QMK was playing pretty hot <laughs> earlier, you know? Yeah. But we'll see. This, this, gonna be, this one is a little bit back and forth. Yeah. So like so we, I mean I do have some information but I don't know if I wanna say it because then like that would be uh No Skyfire is going to secret information, no 
Yeah, yeah, you see, <laughs> secret information is a is so valuable. Information war or warfare, excuse me. That's a insider trading. <laughs> Illegal. Not allowed to do that. Yeah. So like, yeah. Now, losers' quarters for the eleven succeed. And seed six and seed four. Oh, this is... <laughs> well, it looks like uh, their friend count is like pretty much the same. So I'd say they're pretty even. Actually, you know what? They're pretty even in general. Not gonna lie. <laughs> but this is a, the classic matchup. It's like. I don't know any more classic matchup you can get unless you like get something like Kibo Mai or something. Like, this yeah, you can like, get. Yeah. This one's like definitive Tetrio Classic series right here. You know, yeah. it's one of those. It was like I swear this one was played in like WPL one. Like it goes all the way back. <laughs> get Micro Blitz in here. Like you can really talk about old <laughs> Tetrio matches. <laughs> So like looks like uh we're getting into a bit of warm up and uh, Firestorm is going for that stick spin. You know what it do. Yeah, gotta do what you gotta do. And uh Kim K barely finding that down stack. Like And now that's <laughs> They're doing a bit of garbage exchange and Ooh, QMK nice. going with that floating. A yeah, nice upgrade. Yeah, and now uh, on some big back to back pressure here. Like QMK actually trying to like Oh, Fire that's a PC. PC. That's so yeah. dangerous. Oh, that's a Look at this big return from QMK. He's just really? big chilling at 26 PPS right. He's like, "Yeah, whatever. I'm just uh, I'm just cruising." Playing very meticulously this matchup. He's just yeah. down stacking, dude. Just good, clean, straight up Tetris. Yeah. Definitely Our is. Storm like also keeping it mad clean right now, though. Starting to pump it back up for the APM zone. Look at this nice little TSD cut STSD. Yeah, but Not like, the way you'd think, though. Firestorm with the back to back of. Well, had a back to back of 10 for a while. Oh, it, Definitely, yeah. Uh, QK doing a bit of up stacking, which leads into a seven combo. No, not a it's seven a combo. combo. It's huge. Nice little kite on upgrade afterwards. Really squeeze Yeah, but this APM might be a little too PTSD. greedy. Yeah, it's way uh, too greedy. Yeah, not a chance. Unfortunate. Both players were around the same APM. Yeah, FS kind of ramped up a little bit at the end there. End up matching it out. Goes. The Q and K so seriously go search Lord of the Rings and Spotify. Firestorm is colorblind. Fun facts. Yep, yeah, which is crazy. But he's talked about this before. Uh, I want to say that he's he mentioned that he was like completely colorblind, just like crazy. Yeah, which to me uh, is crazy because I like actually have to have colors when I play Tetris. It's how I see the Q later on. I, it's yeah. crazy to me. It's just that much more impressive, you know? Yeah, it's like. Definitely. It's like, I don't know. It's like, it, it's one thing to like have like, be like, it's just red and green. And it's like, I mean, you can still tell colors apart, but like, they, like being like monochrome is quite interesting. I mean, yeah, I don't know what I was So, like, that hasn't impeded Firestorm anyway, seems like. Yeah, it's just, it's crazy to me, truly. <laughs> yeah. Like, Joey, and now we begin with the set. QMK actually choosing to go at his like typical three PPS and finds a nice multiplier spike. And like manages to punish Firestorm. And that, and QMK takes the first set. It's like, I think I like mentioned one time, like, not, not in here or in commentary, but it's like, 
the idea, like, when I was, like, coaching people and stuff, and, like, people were trying to ask how to get faster, like, there are a lot of slower players that are lower ranks, and, like, they'll go super... I think, uh, one thing to note is, like, the fact that you, like, there's, like, playing with, like, solely your brain, and then they're playing with, like, intuition, and, like, I think to be able to go as fast as far as develop like a good intuition about pieces so that you don't need to be thinking about I need to place these pieces right here and such. And so but speaking of which uh, we had a a lot a big barrage of like PCs and damage going about and QMK seems to have an advantage at the moment. Fire's really greasy down stack right there. Put on some big pressure over QMK. QMK reaching this clean garbage wall himself. Would be a nice chance to get in some damage right back over, which is uh, cheesy. Really rough to deal with. Yeah. Like, and that is a huge back to back. And that is a. Uh, wow. Okay. Okay. Kind of down stacking like a, like a jod right now. Yeah. But also, the fact that, like, he can deal so much damage by combining it with his up stacking, it's like, that's probably one of the biggest win conditions. I mean, def definitely his offensive abilities have definitely gotten a lot better. You can depend on them. As well as, like, his general consistency in as well. And it's looking like it's, uh, that's four points. Like, and FS just kind of has these moments where it might click one must drop or like some kind of like a little bit of sketch placement and it kind of locks up and that's QMK's moment right there. He just kind of nukes him a little bit every time. Here's yeah. a little bit different story though. Is FS is not stopping with these PCs. That's four counting. Yeah. Oh for the my fifth. god. Is he going to get a PC six? vision. That PC vision. Is he going to get a seventh? Show what? me. What? No way. All right. FS, honestly. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty impressed. Almost doing a 10 PC in versus. People can't even do that with like time to think. I can, you know, myself included. Just crazy. Yeah. God. Yeah, vision is And so yet it's crazy. still not enough to take QMK out. It's nuts. Yeah, QMK is, uh, ac what is actually popping off so hard? What? It's like, That's they're actually cool. like, you know what? I would say it. they're like very close at, I don't know, their speeds are very close in some cards. Like, yeah, that's true. QMK is playing with, uh, with, it feels like renewed vigor from kind of the past where we've seen it before. He's really playing well tonight. Definitely, it's like... Definitely, it's like, when you play with confidence a lot, it's a... ...that, like, this is the force that you have to deal with. Like, this is the type of player at the fight. And then it's like... clean right now. Yeah, it's cute. The QMK is really going at it. It's so clean. And like... He's actually putting... Like, he's so efficient that he's actually starting to put, like, Firestorm on the defense. At some point. It's like... And now we have a lot of garbage ping pong going on. It's so nuts. I think I didn't miss it. I feel like that message could get lost, especially at the pace of this game. I gotta agree with Kaboozled. How can you root for just one of them? This is... the players playing just so great right now. So clean. <laughs> How can you root for one of these guys? Just uh, Because we have yet to discuss about Firestorm yet. We take a lot of time to discuss about QMK. Because, uh... Spin. Definitely, if anything, like... Of course, Firestorm has consistency and like PCs. But definitely, like when he's like playing on his game, like he's gonna like actually fire. Just like and like uh, definitely more fire than perhaps we've seen so far. Oh, Kim's got like, a nice little multiplier extension there. Looking for this fractal tetris. Definitely, this is looking quite rough. Kim's just just playing crazy. Never seen like this, like this kind of like one-sidedness to this fight. Yeah, 
This is a... I wonder how, like, this match will go, because... <laughs> who knows? Like, I, we can't even guarantee anything, because, like... Maybe FS will figure out something. Honestly, yeah. Q2K seems like the game plan working out pretty well so far, and it's just playing solid, good, clean Tetris, not making any too crazy mistakes, letting Firestorm kind of dig his grave sometimes, and striking yeah. at this perfect moment. Oh, but this, uh, you know, as you say this, you know, the classic, you with a brilliant solution to get out of that little mishap, not totally out of the water yet. Holy. Yeah, but that's a lot of pressure, and oh, we might get out. And now oh, Firestorm is ready with the pressure. That I'm painful. Finally. Oh, finally here we go. Here. No sweep. Nah. It's got to Like, even when you're losing, you have to believe. Because, like, you can... If you believe hard enough, then, like, maybe that comeback will become true. You can't give oh. up. This is really not cooperating with Firestorm this round. It's a painful yeah. mishap. Oh, but that is keep it in play though. That's a lot of cheese on QMK's board. If there's one person who's pretty well equipped to deal with that, but well, there's definitely more than one. But that uh, QK certainly is in that list. <laughs> so now, like Firestorm is actually starting to get off more combo multipliers, this... and uh, per and perhaps maybe like letting QMK be the offensive play here. Although this is dangerous. Well, the QK is in such a good board position. Firestorm is so much clean garbage, though. Nice little combo multiplier. Definitely. Firestorm just keeps hitting these little dingers. He just keeps just keeps hitting these nice little dingers of these multiplier combos over and over again, keeping the game here. Definitely, like, like whether you can like tank QMK's clean and use it to your advantage. Is oh, but it's way too much. FS with the overwhelming <sighs> attack all at once. Speaking of which. <laughs> We see Firestorm get get their second point, and now. All right, it's PC time. Yeah. That's two. Okay, the QK is... managed to break it. Starting to bring the storm. The and so need to be down. careful. The QMK is not letting up. But <laughs> definitely like. Holy. Oh, yeah. Keep yeah. super clean here at the top of the board. Really risky. Oh, that Ooh, is a rough miss drop. Let's see if uh, nice if that's what we have to cycle enough to be able to fix it, but looking really rough as QMK keeps. <laughs> QMK really. <sighs> What a tough opponent. And going for the PCs, almost gets the second one, a third one. You see the four PPS QMK coming out the door here. Quick return on those PCs, get all the way back down the bottom of the board. Firestorm yeah, right back to return as well. Definitely uh, Firestorm gonna need to find ways of somehow doing bigger spikes because 10 to 12 spikes may not be enough against QMK. Yeah. Might not be able to completely outpressure QMK here. And uh, oh, yeah. but these missed drops from QMK, right. this is going to be serious. Nice count really to get out of it. Really good way to open the well up, but. Like, you definitely like. Yeah, they have, like, have to like power stack a 30 spike or something, I think. Like in this situation, it would be actually pretty useful. It's like. Oh, look at this. It's mad. Oh, that's a nice right down now. stack by Firestorm. Really getting it. They're all. And it's starting to work out as. It looks like Firestorm is starting to adapt to QMK's plan. Looks like. Yeah, it's nice little. Oh, oh my that god! Big, see, that's huge, but this is a lot of clean garbage, and QMK is one yeah. of those opponents you really don't want to give that to. Yeah, definitely, like. I think the tides have started to turn a little bit, despite the score. I think the actual, like. The pace of the match is starting to, like. I guess it is changing a little bit. Yeah. With it. yeah. It's like, and it's if good. this keeps going, what's gonna happen? As this run gets a little bit longer and longer, and QMK's having to work a little bit harder and harder to keep Firestorm yeah. in these dangerous situations, though. It's 
you know, FS yeah. going with this nice 10 wide down stack. Yeah. FS choosing to play more defensively, and it seems to be working out for now. Right there, they can, like, find some extra damage. That's a... Definitely, maybe, perhaps by taking advantage of QMK spikes. Who knows? <laughs> and it looks like in... It's very close to working out. Both players are at the top, and Firestorm is half a PPS faster. This is one of those rounds that just like fries your brain, just completely overloads you with adrenaline, just completely burns you out. Every, nothing is the same after this F1 engine. You know, like an, you know, like yeah. you play a round that you feel is like this. You know, objectively, it's nowhere close. You know, like <laughs> just yeah, like two minutes at 150. You know, no. But like you play a room that you're like you play the living daylights out of, and like it lasts for a super tense battle. Yeah. No matter who wins, you're both exhausted afterwards. I, it's one of yeah. these rooms. Definitely, if one thing is like the screen yeah, watching, it's definitely hard in time. By the way, holy, that is a lot of cheat. This is looking super dangerous, but now we're en starting to enter margin time. It's truly. I think this genuinely stands to benefit QMKs. A lot more down stack. I think you know. We'll see. Yeah. It's like so we started to get into Tetris Effect connected levels of uh, gameplay. Holy, and that's a humongous Ooh. spike! And Firestorm wins that round. It's three seven. <laughs> it's like this is like like every time there's like a huge round, it's like, it could potentially be like a blow to them. Way, whether it's like conscious or not, it's like you're spending all this time like trying, and then it's like even after like five minutes, it's like that can be pretty painful. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Things, you know, you just you just like whoa, after the watch, you just one particular game. Yes. Definitely, like if anything, Firestorm has definitely seemed to like play a little more meticulously in some sense. It's like where like. He's like, he may be going still fast, but he's they're still choosing to go for like more defensive options while mixing in offensive ones. And like, I think it's starting to work out. It's like, not just pure yeah, offense. As these, these runs become a little bit longer, you definitely can say. And like, the green Yeah, but like, this is looking yeah. dangerous. Yeah, this is a scary situation for Firestorm yeah, here. Barely getting out. It's not it's gonna... dead just yet, but I fear the worst may come soon, as he's uh, in a little bit of a pickle still. Yeah, but like, manages to like, seemingly really, get out. Really Very escape. close. Very scary. Really? Like, yeah, it's definitely getting a lot more consistent, the fact that like, Firestorm is surviving that like, pressure okay, with thing. It's like... And now, uh, I wonder if Firestorm fully adapts to this, then would they be able to, like... Oh, will QMK, like, end up in a bit of trouble? But, like, we'll find out. Who knows? But, yeah. Yeah. QMK is slowing down a little bit. This is uh, a little bit of a slower run than what we saw earlier. You know, I'm thinking these yeah. are maybe starting to show a little bit of a toll. Firestorm able to keep up that pressure. Uh, kind of yeah. hot off at, like, what is it, 90 minute, like, 1k line, or 10,000 or something like that? <laughs> it's like... Definitely, a like... Oh, oh wow. No. You can get out of this one. Oh, but I mean, that's what a crazy escape. Holy, barely. Oh my god. It somehow gets that. Yeah, well, honestly, very defensive play, both players here, as you mentioned. Yeah. A Oh, nice yeah. multiplier. Oh my god, that's a it huge multiplier. This is looking very dangerous for Firestorm. Yeah, that cut copy, not quite able to really make it fruition for Firestorm. There's Kim K able to get the spike first. Now, eight. Yeah. Eight. Definitely, I wonder if, like, stamina is gonna play a big role in this matchup. Let's see, like, it's it's back to that 4 PPS, you know, kind of opener speed burst here. Playing pretty good so far, too. Yeah, with that back-to-back -back of 4, it's still keeping up the pressure. I'm playing 220 APM right now. Oh my god. Very efficient. 240. Over, 180, oh, over 1 APP for over 100 pieces. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh <laughs> This is actually insane. QMK is still surviving. Bro, this is so much pressure. Oh, but this I think that nice. moment of hesitation yeah. is gonna kill QMK. Literally waited oh. for one second. The Firestorm 262 APM right there. Can what? we just talk about how crazy or consistent? God. It just it's does like, stop Firestorm. Yeah, it's like Wait, to be able to like Oh my god! No way, he still gets the PC. Like to be able to like even like keep with that pressure like... But QMK unfazed. Right. Still setting this up this big way. down stack. Look at this. Yeah. Oh wait, and that's a lot of cheese. That would like this. like the firestorm is returning the cheese back. Like, oh, and that's a nice 18 spike from Firestorm. And QMK gonna get out. It looks like not. And not quite able to. Is Firestorm 5 8 now against QMK? Still a little bit behind. There's still some room to breathe. Yeah, this is like. Like, I remember, like, I talked to, like. Two. Oh no. That's three. Oh, wow. Like, I talked to, like, uh, Firestorm recently. Like, one thing they noticed, or they noted, is that when they fight, like, other Ritteru and stuff like that, it's like, it becomes a battle of... It's like, if you play too defensively, then you just die, because... And, like, I wonder if, like, if, like, that would work with, like, QMK, and so it's, I mean, it's a dangerous gamble, but it's like... I wonder the if, like... Can upgrade. What a great payout here if Firestorm gets to this. Yeah, we may just find the way out. Very nice. Uh, find the nice spike and QMK. Punish for greed. Yeah, FS crawling back 6 8 now. Definitely, like. I think, like, when you start off as a defensive player and, like, you, you have to work on, like, up stacking, I think it's, like, Definitely hard to keep the mindset of like APM standing sometimes because like it's not what you're used to. Definitely that's where a firestorm would have the advantage. But it's like sometimes you can't give out because if you do then it causes a lot of problem. Firestorm going with a huge spike in order to try to punish that one cancel and but QMK seems to barely did not get out. But like now it's a six seven eight. Yeah, now uh, Firestorm is actually being off like opened for like down stacks and such, and now it's been has been complete. I've been informed by the uh, Team TST facility security that uh, they've, they've spotted. They think a suspect individual who appears to be Tom Brady on the premise, but uh, no way. Whether that remains to be identified, we'll find out later. Stick with us. <laughs> Holy Tom Brady. Oh, man. Attack. Yeah, this is... Yeah, this match is actually crazy, like... It's like... Comeback uh, so far has been pretty good. Yeah. Yeah, actually. And, like... And QMK being very pressured and... Firestorm consistently to carrying it to 8-8! Eight, eight. Tiebreaker! How did we go from 0-6 to 8-8? Eight, eight? Oh my Sweet. god. That's actually so cracked. Wait. Definitely, it's like definitely gonna be a battle of like whoever plays the. It's like and like looking a bit dangerous for QMK if uh if he doesn't have a good game plan. Is Firestorm and... starting to unlock the secret a little bit here? Yeah, perhaps they are. <sighs> Starting to like pressure out and mixing that cheese as well. The like, QMK is like super good when it comes to like, dealing with like huge amounts of, but mixing in some cheese will catch off anyone. Over Firestorm's back-to-back -back oh. pressure at the end there was just unstoppable. Yeah, now we get to see finally with Firestorm actually making quite the comeback, and taking the lead. Jeez, this is actually... Yeah, and oh, QMK! 
now it's match point. Just like this. Oh my god, it's actually- no way. This is nuts. It's, it's like... The mental stamina is like... So difficult to like be able to keep a pressure when your opponent yeah, is pressuring just as... Oh, like, oh my god! This is nuts. This is nuts. That's what he needs right no now. No way! Big time. Big time. Show me the deuce. Big time. One time. Oh my god. 10-9. This is and it. Now it is, this is it right here. This, is this where match really counts. Both players really need to focus. Oh, but QMK, no, that garbage. Yeah. No. QMK in a rough situation, trying to find a down stack. And manages to find it in the yeah. clean solution. But Firestorm oh, just I keeps on pressuring. Pressure is way too and much. And I need to Lord. watch out about like. It's now sending huge spikes, but it's all clean garbage. Let's okay. go. Show me. Oh, goes for the STSD and cycling for the next oh, attack. Is that garbage. gonna be too greedy? Okay. He really and playing this not. with lots more now, by the way. I've just, I've just noticed he's really hanging on right now. Show me the big counter spike. Show me the deuce. Yeah. Let's see it right now. Let me see it. Definitely is. Oh, look at this nice little upgrade from QMK. Really squeezing out all this pressure. I do wonder whether if. This oh my god. That was almost it, man. It like flashed all before Firestorm's eyes. Yeah. It's like... What's crazy to me is QMK is still managing to get like 50 APM for PPS with this right now. It's just bonkers. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty bonkers. It's like... Well, he's like... looking for something big here, not able to really seal it. Firestorm's still going off, going down, getting the big multiplier. UK in a rough spot. Yeah, Opens but looking it up super like... nice though. This is really it. Yeah, definitely. He's really in this one right now. Oh, look at this multiplier. It's, yeah. it's great. It's really what UMK really needs right now. A little bit more of that, you know? Both players do not want to give up at this point. It's the like, big Firestorm oh, doing a big amount of pressure. This is oh, looking it's very dangerous. Q okay. Ow, QMK. Oh, that's a big you? end spike. And that was... Holy... That was... Firestorm that... takes it. That is... That was Oh nuts. my god. Firestorm that was... coming back from the brink of death to all the way back. That what was... Around actual insane it's like oh holy man uh i don't know it's like i did think that like <laughs> like <laughs> it's, it's like did my like webcam just break or something? One sec, let me check something. I think I know. I I know what went wrong. I know what I Skyfire. I miss Skyfire so much. He's gone. Oh, it's, it's crazy. Unfortunate. Yeah, Skyfire no longer exists. Unfortunate. Very sad. It disappeared from our existence until now. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. Oh, no way, it worked. Yo, he's back. It, I was scared. Yeah, I was scared. Yeah. This was my mistake for installing Great Suspender on my computer. It's like, after two hours, it just shuts down inactive. It just shuts down my... It shut down the video cam, like, tab. So, like... Holy... Holy... What? Before we get to the next round of lizards, I think you know, I just I just have an idea. I think it's time we return back to uh, some old friends up in the uh, old winners bracket. I just, this is just my estimation. Watch me be completely wrong in a minute here. Watch it. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Now we have predictions again. Diao versus Blarg. Oh. That is going to be interesting. Um. Yeah, let me, uh. 
vote for someone before I go explaining stuff because, uh, it's honestly, I can't tell, not gonna lie. It's like, I think, like, I mean, like, I'd say, like, we've seen DL and, uh, is like, back to back, as well as counter spikes. And like the absurd speed when it really commits to it. It's like Blarg though. It's like <laughs> Heck. Let's see if I take it. Let's see please. Yeah, Blarg though is like incredibly like clean stacking. I see not just clean stacking, but also like Intense back to back, like almost like the definition of offense. The cases, let's see. Yeah, Lord definitely is earlier was uh, on, on another level with that back to back. Some clean pressure right here. I think, yeah, will be uniquely well equipped to deal with that. Mm -hmm. uh, this is going to be. Ridiculously hard challenge for both players. You're gonna have to see who moves on at Grand Finals. I don't think it's the end of the story for either player tonight, though, if you ask me. <laughs> but we'll see how things move out. Yeah. Just currently, just doing a bit of waiting. A, you know how it'd be. Uh, yeah. yeah. Whatever. Here. <laughs> ah, yes. Collecting the uh, very epic and important player information you so come to expect, know, and love. <laughs> Trying both. The winner's finals, oh boy. Seed, or seed 3 versus Seed 1. Wait, where's that profile picture from? From for like the owl. Feels like it would come from something like Attack on Titan or something. I got like, no idea. Like that's shading though. I feel like. Go down. Play Genshin. I didn't eat another apple. Oh no. Didn't eat apples. That's rough. Dang. <laughs> Play Genshin. Propaganda. <laughs> like. Oh boy. <laughs> like, it's like, what if what if I don't want to? How about I don't? You know? Just <laughs> What if I don't want? Yeah, it's like, what, like, yeah, I was gonna do self-promotion to Genshin, just change his name to Play Genshin and I'll cap. Yes. Just like, yes. Play Genshin 1, 2, and 3 is gonna be the new, like, gigawatt gaming trend. I can't yes. imagine. Like, that would be, like, actual <laughs> BTMC moment. <laughs> Truly. When will BTMC become Play Genshin again? That said, we are now into warm-up. And, uh... <laughs> yeah, time to play warm-up impact. Yeah, and, uh, we have caused quite interesting amount of discussion in, uh, <laughs> Twitch chat. Unfortunate. <laughs> Why would that oh, that's a up? huge <laughs> spike! That... Diao going crazy! Oh my god. The 15 second little, little warm-up. Holy... For the homies. No. Mm -hmm. Messy stick. But damn. That was quite the warm up. Already getting heated up. It's uh 
Hard to tell what's gonna happen. Let's see. Because those spikes are insane. So, so Bark back to back is also insane as well. And, uh, we'll see what happens. And now the match begins. And, uh, we begin with DL. Darn do a. I cut coffee. Oh, that's Ooh, a little bit That's gonna be tough. A little way to open things up here for Dio. Blurred with that misdrop. Not able to get back down through it. He had a little really out pressure. Nice little exact same over exact same frame. Oh. Same thing. It's just the same all around right now. Blurred getting down that garbage open. first. That was a huge amount of damage by <laughs> Dio is down stack. Not enough. As Blurred is ready, is right prepared for that. Both players seem to be in pretty neutral state until, but DL is now trying to stack up to maintain that back to back. And right. might just get dangerous from here on out. Look at high speed gameplay, really able to fix his stack. DL also playing just crazy fast. Both players are playing in 4 PPS for a while. DL still is, which is just yeah, but... he's only getting faster, which is just insane. Yeah, but like, Mark so, has such fast up stacking. So crazy. It's true, Bark doesn't get some of these big clean spikes oh, immediately. Oh, gets punished. Like, it's so tricky. In like, a second one. Like, it feels like at the top level, it's like where people have like their abilities. Like, part of it is screen watching, but also the fact that like, whoever like, he can keep their board open like, the most usually wins. Like, Ooh, Blarg with this really creative donation. That was crazy. Oh, and that's a nice down just, stack by Blarg. But like, kind of DL at back to back oh. a 10. This is looking very dangerous. DL just keeps up stacking. Has to stop back to back, but has a lot of clean garbage to work with. Ooh, but there's too big of a spike. Just Blarg, get out of this one. Blarg is in a Oh, he's gonna escape. Look at this. Oh, situation. Now it's big, big pressure time for Blarg back in a safe position here. Yeah, also looking to get out this big pressure here, finding the CSD touch of the zone. This is just back and forth right now. Yeah, definitely like a battle of uh, clean garbage, mostly. Except now, speaking of which, DL actually gets cheesed and he has a messed up board. This is a great moment for Blarg, but made a little bit of a misdrop of the Z piece here, gonna set him back, not able to yeah, secure but... the kill. Very sad. It looks like DL is all the way back down. Nice T spin down stack here from Blarg, although when this happened, OP is going to set him back again. Not stopping him too much. Still getting some good pressure here. Now, yeah, looking for this big down stack right there. It is. It's immediately returned by Blarg. Oh, wow. Control, and and able to get a f the door. Blarg managing to top out the owl. And then. Oh no. Oh my god. That was uh, quite the PC. <laughs> and uh. And DL managed to take that round. Let's see, DL going for another PC. And she's going to build a TKI esque setup. It has a lot of. It's a very flat board to continue attacking with. But Blarg here managing to deal quite a big spike. Well, but look and Dio just returns right well. back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Garbage yeah. is ju it's just too clean, but that little mishap, little mishold there for Dio. Set not. back. Blarg getting back in the pressure train here. Nice. Yeah, little, tried to yes, do a huge up back. back. Ooh, oh my god. That? The wow, Blarg that with was the cheese such... attack. Man. Yeah, with such a huge burst at that moment. You see, this is where your sprint speed actually becomes very helpful because if he bursts fast like that, he can get away with so much stuff. And it's going so fast! What? He just the board narrowly out. escaping. That was crazy. I cannot believe he's still in the game. Yeah, I can't believe he spews. I can't believe Dial spewed spe out so many attacks all at once. And it's like, and I can't believe that Blark survived all of that. That's amazing. 
Okay, so that's playing really, really hot right now. But the Lord, look at this. Yeah, this big pressure. It's a little too hard. Guard takes it. Three. Mark with this non-stop assault. <laughs> oh boy. Really a game where it could actually go either way. Honestly. Yeah, this like, one is uh, honestly by an edge. Just an absolute riding the edge moment. Yeah. Like. Will the Blarg with like, the scary commit at the top? <laughs> and, but unfortunately, with a little mishap there, but. <laughs> this is still in the early rounds. Blarg doing a bit of tanking. No. Oh my <laughs> god! Let's go! He did that one for the fans, for the people. Almost yeah. had a PC afterwards. That's my dog. Yeah. How can you not love that? Actual That's the one homie. that wins the hearts and minds of the people right there. Bark going crazy yeah. for this fractal test. It's not worth it. That yeah. TSD that was just uh, not worth Bark it. Bark going, is oh, going a little too greedy. A little too high up. And an unfortunate. But the fin was worth it. That was very, very nice. Nice yes. little MPO PC to start things off. It wasn't like trying to find a grace, oh, but the fin is not all the way there. It is huge clean garbage up for uh, Yeah, with a nice multiplier of his own. <laughs> Stacked up and ready to assault. Blur <laughs> super quick on making this clean yeah. pressure do right back at him. Definitely, like, one thing to note about, like, when you're doing counter spikes versus like back to back is that like get the... fresh. holy shit <laughs> I was gonna say that like the patterns that you need to recognize are different and that you need to accommodate your stack for whether you want to go up or down but speaking of which Barg just pulled it off quite the yeah, victory in that round that I always love doing that for the opener here but Diao with this epic clean well he gets the yeah. right piece there could be some great down stack action right there Definitely. There's a lot of clean incoming, but we're just not in the best to get down through it. <laughs> he gets down, but not really sending anything over here. Nice position, ready to fire back, but Tiao always ready to answer with this one. This Yo, one. that. He does nice. not to go for the Tetris, I think. It's like. So. Both yeah, players are. Yes, Steve. I think this is a really good idea to keep the stack super clean. Nice yeah. TS Tetris to get all the way down there. Bang out another one. This is uh, now 6-3. Yeah, definitely uh, quite tricky. It's like the moment that like Varg has this like board like kind of stuck, then like or covered up, and like that's really dangerous. But that's a oh, huge spike, and it could have kept on going. That's this crazy opening pressure from Varg. And more of these rounds is really what Blark can handle. Really what he needs right now. Like starting off super fast. Yeah, oh my god, that's a, what a seven. continuation for TKI. Yeah. Seven. Except in going the T spin trip was interesting for Blark. Huge counter spike immediately anyway. Yeah. So much T's forced up on the DL's board. Yeah, the and the Blark was so much clean. clean and garbage to work with. Oh, and that's a rough oh. miss drop. The, oh, no. try to do the ice spin. That SL misdrop for Blark is so painful. Now oh, he has that chip tooth, that heart shape, the overhang there. That's rough, man. Yeah, putting out crazy pressure, finding the LST PC. Always super fun to get that one. But yeah, but that is a 24 to 30, 37. Dangerous for exactly this reason. Blark yeah. just immediately gets back up 5 7 again. Really, would would Blark needs to kind of get moving forward more of these right. kinds of rounds. What a fast! I don't know what to say. It's like we're uh, our brains are so time. beyond fried. That's not even funny. <laughs> you know, it's Good. just disturbing that we've come to the point where like the game plan for some people is like it's not a full board. It's multiple full boards worth of garbage. <laughs> yeah, it's just great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> God, it's like Mark Super six, Saiyan mode. Oh, the oh. Is decision I think over DT Cannon. He's yeah, looking DL very rough. But DL with an insane down. Which yeah, might not be enough. 
really Mr. Up really kind of screwed him off a bunch. Oh and my now god. Blarg, even a great, really a great round right there. Again, for Blarg to get back and even things out. Dia really needs to kind of get things under control a little bit. You know, he wants to keep moving ahead here. Can't have him run and start off like that one. Gotta start him off like this one instead of the crazy back-to-back -back pressure. Although, the double Tetris is a bit of a risk. He's gonna get through it. Blarg looking to get back in this clean garbage. Barely getting there in time. I'm not sure. Oh he's my god, and Diao just doesn't stop the pressure. No way. Oh. But Blarg cheated survival there, like, way longer than he had any right to. It's still insane, nonetheless. Diao, god. back ahead, 8 7, just as soon as the tie appears. Yeah, this is uh, looking to be a very tight match. But, like, that's a huge spike, and that might this just is... punish Blarg. Yeah, it is. Just the garbage lined up incredibly well right there. Diao also with that STSD, able to combo into a Tetris afterwards, having a TSD Tetris again. Just too much for Blarg to handle now. 7 9. Yeah, that's so what like. Here. That Tetris PC, and Diao tried to find a second PC, but Blarg just keeps on pressuring. And that's a lot of cheese. And it turns a lot of cheese back. That's even yeah. more cheese. That's it insane. Is this is rough for Diao, but Blarg not Diao finding just the opportunity to kill. Like nobody did oh this. no, the double misdrop oh, not like this. That's so rough. That was painful. Uh, now we're at match point. This is looking very dangerous for Blarg. You know, I had to pull through. Now... Oh, that's a little bit of a misdrop Diao. Blarg with a risky teeth for triple. Not sure if he's going to be able to fully get out of this one safely. Yeah, and yeah just putting on too much pressure. But oh, Blarg really? is down stacked. That yeah. clutch factor that's right there. That's insane down stacking. Oh my god, that's a huge burst. And Diao is trying to get the... Diao with the risk at the very top. This is it for Blark right here. This is a chance. But Diao escapes. I don't that know how. Genuinely. So close. It's like... Genuinely don't know how Diao escaped that. Yeah, I know. Mean, uh... This is definitely like, oh my god, that's another oh, round. That's an eight. Yo, it's, yo are, can more. we get a nine in the chat? Maybe? Two more. Yeah. Two more. Show me another yeah, nine. Let's go. Like, <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, go for a double Ooh. PC. Wow. And Diao is the one with so much garbage. That pass through PC, intense. Just all the Blark fans are in. cheering on with their nine. At the, and Blarg does a fractal and is trying Blarg. to do another one, but risky and no. That is unfortunate. And DL takes it. Just... Unfortunately, Blarg has lost to the Genshin player. Oh no. Actual, actual nightmare. No way. It's not unfortunate. Is how crazy good of a showing that was, though. Blarg it was. It, it... It's still looking supreme. It's looking beatable, honestly. Like, yeah. it's looking like either player could take this one in a yeah. day. I'm just saying. So, like, you know what? Great showing right there. Yeah. That's all, honestly, but Diao looking like a menace still, too. Able to put that kind of attack pressure out. Just disturbing. Yeah, yeah if anything, I can definitely, like, I can definitely see Blarg beating, like, Diao with time. 100%. Yeah, it's like, I, like I, I would not doubt that at all. When you say time, do you mean maybe about 30 minutes to 45 minutes? Because that's what I think, maybe. Yeah, probably. Yeah. And that much time? Just, yeah. <laughs> not much time. Is it time? Yeah, we... <sighs> all right, real quickly. Now, that one yeah. was too crazy for me. I'm going to... Yeah. I think you're also going to join me in this, right? We're going to take yeah. a quick breather here and uh, leave you in some capable hands for this next mm -hmm. match. Because you know what? You guys deserve some people who are fresh and happy to do this, you know? Indeed. So uh, we'll have a little two-minute break. We'll come back and uh, see it, you know? We'll see it. Yeah. See you for a swap out. The next commentators, which we'll see.
What? All right, what's up, folks? How's it been? How you've been enjoying? What a crazy tournament! Oh my god! This has been insane. Like we got my man's FS play crazy BQMK. We got fucking Blarg beating Vince. That's that's a first timer. You've never seen that in your life. Uh. We got top four, right? We got. We got next up and circle, a circle versus vids. It's like every set is just boom, 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 and you just get beat up. So, um, honestly, yeah. I think we're just set up for for a great event, and I this hope has we can. Been such a good event, like true. It's, act it's actually just kind of insane. Yeah, so I'm hoping that uh the flow keeps going. We have three matches left. Next up, we have loser semis, which should determine our fourth place, but also extremely high level. Nothing to scoff at. We got FS versus Vince, if I'm correct. FS. Yeah, FS Vince and Cultural uh, Clash will play Larg, uh, which who will in turn uh, have to take two sets off Diao to win the tournament. Uh, Diao looking That's... very, very pretty in, in winner side grand. I will say. Yeah. You know, uh, Diao, Firestorm, Vince, and Ritteru have been, like, the very, very, like, big top dogs in the past recent few events. Blarg kind of taking Ritteru's place uh, with uh, Ritteru's absence. It, the top four is just, it's just Diao, Blarg, Vince, and Firestorm now. Straight up. You know? And, it's, you know, Diao's been playing, like, Diao? Just, just you know, punching Diao my mans for no reason. For no reason. Why does he do that well. for? I don't know. He just beats him up. How does he do it? Um, he has like Tetrio Misamino level five, three billion APM. He's just he's in a hyper chamber every day. It's crazy. Um, you know, you know, seriously, I don't know. That guy sees the game. He sees the game quite differently. Facts. Uh, but yeah, it's. I don't know, man. This whole tournament's been crazy. That set earlier with uh, with Vincent Blarg, the other set with Circu in it. I don't know. Who was it against? God, this this set had, this tournament's had too many good sets. <laughs> They're all, like, insane. Yeah, and as you can see here, we have next up our triangles. Ooh. We got Ooh. FS. We got my main man, Vince HD. Vince has been the playing for 70 years. Um, That's how Vince, you know. he's been around. Vince just knows. He's just so he's good. Got, they actually have pretty similar looking triangles. You know, focus on uh, on that offense. Not as much down stack as some of the other people that we've seen in this tournament, but I mean, it's a great balance, right? You can only get here if you're good at everything. Yeah, death. You get it, death triangle. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, more death <laughs> on on Vince for sure. While uh, Firestorm got a little bit of a speed advantage, which is crazy to say, considering that Vince uh, used to be well, he still kind of is like the best winner ever. Um, he kind of is, straight up. He kind of is, you know. Fun facts: Messi spin. That's a who added that? Rico added that in there. Argent, shout out to Argentina, Tudors. Um, <laughs> uh, Firestorm is like colorblind. Them. That is a fact for sure. Dude, uh, people are asking, colorblind, colorblind Tetris true. community, you know. One people time. are saying, uh, "What does FC mean?" Um, you know, imagine, but it does mean friend count. You clearly see, Vince is a social bird. He, he has a thousand friends on. That's like more followers a than a lot of people, people on Twitter. Friend, a thousand people have friended him. He has not friended a thousand people. I'm just saying, okay. He's, yeah, he's followers. Farming. He's farming we got followers, friends. we got leaders, and we got warm-ups. Uh, Dude, Vin's a little bit cheesed up here in this warm-up. Uh, he's a little cheesed it looks up, like but... Firestorm is just going to take it off the cusp. His performance is not based on on that. Actually, he kind of got out of that. He's, he's, he's playing fresh. For sure. <sighs> Who do you got? Who do I got on this on this specifically? Honestly, it could go either way, but I I'm cheering for I'm a little bit of an FS FS fan, you know. I love Vince Slow, so I would be I would be happy if it went either way. Uh, oh the God. last couple of sets, Vince has been 
taking it over FS in a lot of these past tournaments, losers, semifinals. So, you know, FS a bit of the underdog in this situation. So, oh, you always got to root for the underdog just a tiny bit. True. Um, I'm certainly rooting for, uh, for Firestorm here, but Vince consistently top three in the world. We got our set coming up. We got El Cla one of the classicos here with Vince H uh, with uh, Firestorm QMK, with uh, Rivi Blarg, with uh, ZZ Diao. This is just an absolutely fine set here. We got FS with the stick spin. Uh, Vince positioning to what is a 5 4 stack. Doom Spike. See ya later. Mm -hmm. It's the, He's classic, so the classic SS, you know, double Tetris fight. Ooh, but we got. We got both Vince, players both on players PCs. PC. Ooh, Fire and Vince. Third. Is, is Vince trying to 1v1 FS on, on PCs? Yo, PC open? Yo, where you at? <laughs> I love Shout PC out of, open. Shout out to PC, out PC open. Uh -huh. Yo, ooh, Jimothy, Jimothy, Jimothy was here? Uh, he, he did some stuff out there. Shout out to him. Shout out to our uh, commentators from our, from both of our uh, last oh, two blocks. A bit of a lag spike there. Just sending a 30 spike, but Firestorm able to cancel most of it off. Gonna live to see another day. Vince speeding towards this next spike. Dude, it's so crazy to me that these players are able to play so fast that individual attacks will like chain together as spikes. You know? <laughs> like, that's Ooh. so fucking insane. True, and it's such also a factor how they can manage it with like a ping difference that's you could say it's a little significant considering that, you know, when Vince has those those lag mm. spikes and FS is just like, oh, I just came a little a little later. Whatever, dude. Pass through who? Pass so through blocking a recent implementation in <laughs> <laughs> Commercially available <laughs> lag switches coming out. <laughs> dude, Vince here with a twenty spike to take that second round off of Firestorm here. Looking a little dominant, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, 2 0, very, very strong. FS is the type of player. He needs to pick up some steam, definitely. Um, last set against KMK, he wasn't. He started off not the hottest, uh, mm -hmm. I think most people would agree. But uh, as you can see, he can he did get bring it back whenever. Sure. Yeah, and uh, oh, also a kind of a. Spike 13. One more? Oh, and Vince, Ooh, Vince kills himself. Get there. Very, very unfortunate. Yeah, Firestorm on the board now, 1 to 2. This is going to be a first to, first to 11 uh, with deuces as uh, our top eight have tended to bin recently. So, you know, if it's if it's 10-10, we're, we're going. We're off to the races, you know. Oh, For Vince sure, and FS it, is going to heaven. <laughs> that was so insane. So nasty. FS was just intimidated by the fact. So he said, okay, next game. Um, Run it back. And yeah, we got an LST uh, TKI on opposite sides for both players. It's a little bit of a knowledge of mid game PC for oh. FS. Oh FS unable God. to get the second one. And it's just a big, clean exchange. Look at all these, both of these huge, huge wells. Ooh, Vince so transitioning uh, into a sort of wide, sort of, uh, sort of build here. And he tanks just Ooh. enough. Firestorm getting full speed spike. That's straight out of Diao or CZ's book, dude. For sure, just that all the way to the floor, touch your knees, spike that that you could only see. He's from doing the he's doing a burpee spike. You ever you ever done a burpee in your life, Jed? <laughs> a burpee? <laughs> Dude, it's like it's like you do a you do like push up a and then you hit up. Yeah, <laughs> he's doing that as a spike one time. <laughs> Yo, cool. Focus. Ooh, <laughs> but FS is doing a 237 APM, just power point push madness. True. Power point pusher. <laughs> For Ooh. sure. Firestorm with some great T spins here. Gonna skim down towards this well. So much clean on Firestorm side, and he sent 17 and Vince missed drops. Ooh, and it's it's getting close Three here. Four. One game difference. Vince still mm. in the lead, and we got a bit of a TKI spike here. Ooh, here we go. But FS misdrops that T piece on the beginning. Ooh, maybe that was a mid game PC strat that I, that I'm actually too dumb to see. Oh, sorry. 
you never know, dude. You never know with mm -hmm. FS whether anything's like actually, you know. I guess you never know with any of these top players. We've seen Vince pull a couple, a couple big ones out of his ass, you know. And yeah, unfortunately, Vince couldn't get the pieces there to down stack FS, tying it up. Mm -hmm. Finding that PC that... to end things off as well, insane. For sure. We got a PC yeah. back here. FS opts in to do a. Yo, what what was that? Yeah, I'm just saying. What? Yo. <laughs> <laughs> Opposite to uh, pods. <laughs> let, me, let me search it up. But um, still managed to get a very clean wall here. 200 mm. APM for what's well, going to be for both players here soon. 400 versus this is... four. This was if you had seen the gameplay last year, and then you see stuff like this, man. It's just your yeah, brain. it's insane how much people are improving even at the top level. Like you look at play from January or February 2021 and you compare it to here it's it, like the difference is definitely night and day Firestorm now with the stick showcasing some of that new Tetrio tech you know 11 for sure. spike, but that's all clean for Vince yeah both FS and, and uh, Serku were, were showing very high levels of of uh, stick spin which is normally not really seen in the top uh, mm. top of the game Ooh, stick spin. but Definitely stick or no stick, off. you're going yeah. up. In the in the mid game, you know, openers they don't particularly matter if you if you end up getting to a mid game regardless. And True, you see that for there. sure. Firestorm finding both players finding a two line, and it passes Pass through. through Firestorm finding the clean well first. Ooh, and Firestorm, but but Vince so so precise there to not get locked out. Ooh, but still is in a very oh. precarious 9-0 situation. Is speeding Holy as fast Lord. as possible tonight there. What a great survival there from Vince HD. He needs to down stack. And he's gonna, ooh, down, he's gonna get there. Oh a great Shachak uh, Shachiku train there. Great donation into a 19 spike of almost pure cheese firestorm able to defend most ooh, of it. But but the black the oh lag my. spike comes through hidden stealth. <laughs> Stealth flag <laughs> switch sponsored by Elgato. <laughs> shadow, dude, shadow leg, no jutsu. <laughs> Straight up. Ooh, and FS but here. unfortunately, and caught with his what, why, oh, what just is kidding, just kidding. What, what's he waiting for? New Year's? Oh my god, wait, Vince could have won that game easily if he just did anything for a second? Dude, both players, uh... On, on some working around this lag that's been that's being introduced time and time again uh, for sure um but right now both players just sending an insane amount of back-to-back -back. you can really see their dominion of uh, lst type stacking because it's just they can very very efficiently produce t-spins oh, that, that are nowhere i didn't fall Ooh, but super, a huge fractal stuff. spike coming so strong nearly 500 versus score there for firestorm so so strong and oh my god can i get a pog in the chat for that <laughs> holy moly man that's, so that's so strong like an insanely practical spike too just the fractal over the tetris well but we see these these uh, incredibly strong players utilize that to like the, it's like like the full way up you know like absolutely players would just get like 15, 16 spikes no vince and firestorm they're juicing out like 30s Straight up juicers. Ooh, but regardless of that, right now, Firestorm needs a TP urgently here if he's gonna get out. Uh, Vincent T gets very, very good RNG uh, garbage. Ooh, and both players are kind of going back and forth here. Vince is a little stuck on that 9 0 well, but Firestorm misdrops and loses the game. That misdrop Vince cost a ton. Vince eking ahead 6 7 now. Crazy, crazy close set. Oh, we got a stick spin versus a gray system? I know my PCs. Uh, for Vince HD there, couldn't get it, unfortunately. I think he got the, the wrong solution, or I don't know how it works. PC nerds, PCO open, too. <laughs> but this time, you just teach me. Firestorm uh, here, a very, very, very good there. Up. He is yeah, Vince tried to do some, like, wacky-tabacky, like, aerial T-spin yakinery. And he's, uh, going to Arby's. 7-7. Firestorm tying things back up once again. How close is this set? Oh my god. It just doesn't stop. 
Firestorm with the six spin now. Great well for it. Not gonna be able Ooh. to get the make the most out of it, but it might just be enough. No, Vince with a great awareness. Putting that Z piece Ooh. up in the corner where it won't immediately kill him. It might be too little too late here. Ooh, just barely edges out that, but what he's the, still in a very this? dangerous position. What is this he needs to... That's so smart. Oh my god. That was that, did you see that? Holy moly. I see, oh my god. Oh my god. That was such an insane survival from Vince there. I feel like literally every player in the world would have died there from just Vince somehow, some way finds it. But mm. Firestorm is still not done with the pressure. Both players to get it. now. 100, Ooh. floating like 170 APM. Firestorm just that barely not going to live. <sighs> Vince going to take that round 8-7. Yeah. Unfortunate LP's mister up there from Firestorm and also amazing spike there from Vince HD. Just absolute insane spikes. One error can just cost you the game so easily, but... At the same time, the, the ability for these players to fix their mistakes is is insane here. Vince looking for the center well. Wombo Ooh, Jumbo. Triple, but it's a tad it's a tad greedy. Let's see if Vince is able to uh Ooh, mid game DT from Vince HD? Ooh. No, Dude, you can't do DT. So crazy. Uh, Vince, what are you doing? My friend! That's a that's a fractal you I don't even know. He got too ambitious. Mm -hmm. Maybe he didn't read the Q well before he did the fractal. Yeah, he just saw all freefractal.com. And it actually wasn't freefractal.com. It was actually fractal for money. .com. Paid fractals, dude. I've just been informed by staff that uh, they really want the replay. <laughs> I got y'all. I got y'all. <laughs> um, but I wonder insane if we can't Ooh, mid game C spin from the RNG garbage from uh, Firestorm is really impressive. Um, but he mid is very, very right cheesed game. up here. Vince HD is looking to end this game. FS doesn't. Oh, the eyepiece. 29 spike from Vince. Eyepiece in shambles, and Vince just finds that opportunity. He's holding on. He's been on a slump. He's almost lost these sets, but right now he's playing extremely hot. Don't discount FS though. Two PCs from FS. Miss drops the O. Very unfortunate. Gonna transition here to a 6 3 stack. A great mid game. Oh, and miss drops the IP. Miss drops. Gonna cost him. That's unfortunate. 500 versus score and the match point for Vince. Oh my god. Let's see. Two TKIs here. Vince going into that classic Impross follow up, but he does the, he makes a washing machine by accident. I don't know how that one's gonna work out for him. He is just gonna transfer to a mid game. Uh, washing machine meta? You don't get it? I, I, I really don't. But you know, Vince HD finding this great, great wide, gonna get some good combo, a bit of cheese on Firestorm's board. Doesn't quite reach the, the opponent, but. But right now, look at F. Look, this spike hasn't even come through yet. Vince's internet is like, hold on, big dog. I'm not <laughs> it's like, to hold, do on, that. hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. Hold on. <laughs> and now we're we're at the most important game of the set here. This is either FS is going to go to Deuce or Vince is going to close it out here. Um, FS, not a stranger to to bringing it back, but oh, ooh, Vince. Vince is not playing spike, around. FS it. doesn't have anything. And he just couldn't know the positioning mm -hmm. of that garbage. So the unfortunate. The two S pieces there, really, really rough. Vince going to take it 11-9, sending almost 200 fewer lines as well. Really goes to show that the few moments that Vince really used, uh, he really used that timing and that sort of macro-ish gameplay to kind of edge out Firestorm. Really, For sure. Really good stuff. Very, very well done there. I did save the replay. I will share the replay for the peeps. For the peeps in the chat who've been holding on here as we have a five hour stream. We've been we've been pulling through uh since the start of this tournament. And I just want to five thank hour tournament, I feel like it's actually been like pretty like fast. It's it's been down historic it's it's down from the historical 80 billion year tournaments we used to have at the beginning, really? but but still, uh, quite a long time. I would like to thank all of you for for uh, 
being here, supporting us, following us. Uh, you can donate to the prize pool if you want to have the players uh, receive more money than the uh, the amount they're getting now. And honestly, I just want to thank you all for your support. We got it. We got a shell for the folks. One time. One time. Shilling, shilling. These... Shilling for the peeps. These. And we do have bracket here, as you can see. Yeah, we got uh, Vince now in losers finals, and Blarg gonna. Actually, he's getting the re the the run back against Blarg, who eliminated him into losers in winners semis. So this is going to be a big one for sure. Very true here. And again, that 11-5 was the first time Blarg ever beat Vince. It's been mm. just this constant curse on him that he finally lifted. But now we get to see if that was a fluke or if uh, if Blarg is the real deal. Blarg think, plays so good. I feel so like good. Blarg is playing so hot today. And he could definitely run it again. And he could definitely take it against Diao. I mean, in winners finals, Blarg got eight off the DL, and uh, you know, if he beats Vince, he could be running on a, a very, very hot streak. Right, you did it once, but can you do it twice? That's the big question. We about to find Tell out. Tell him two times. So crazy. That's the question. We about to find out. Two times for sure. Um, but yeah, we are waiting for the players to come here again. I would like to thank all of you for for coming through, watching the stream. Actually, while uh, we're waiting, Dazer, can we can we flag, can we chill some other events that are coming out throughout through February and towards the end uh, from the end of January up to the end of February? For sure. We let's got, uh, got let's get our one, main, Ooh. our biggest, uh, Pause. our biggest TEC event to date. Huge, huge ups to the PK team and our team here at Team TSD. Uh, they got Crag on there, dude. You see Crag? Yeah, That's crazy. True. They it's got Chad Blink on the art. Iga Chad Caboozled Pie. I'm telling you. <laughs> they got Ash. <laughs> Silver <laughs> Surfer Caboozled, man. Dude, Caboozled uh, like one year because he's insane to prove it. True. Don't forget um... to uh, check out Square One at Square One TV and follow the Puzzle Kingdom Twitter account. Someone can link it in the chat to uh, get updates as we move closer to the event. The first event, the first group stage, is going to be on February 11th at 2 p.m. PST. That's Pacific, uh, Pacific Standard Time. Uh, that is, I'm, just, I'm uh, so excited. Seven, for it. That's 5 p.m. Uh, EST. For, yeah, for my my East Coast boys <laughs> who, who rep it all the time. Yeah, all the time. And uh, yeah, uh, check out Square One, and we should be coming back to the event here. But again, check them out. We love Puzzle Kingdom, and you're gonna love Square One. Tell them. But coming back to business. Just kidding, Jed. Get owned. We have another oh. tournament. I've been saving oh up for this Oh my bit. god! Uh, I've... Star Cup Regenesis, uh, hosted by our friends at. Puzzle Kingdom, who are working on Square One with us. This is a 24,000 TR rank cap tournament. So all you mid-U players, all you 23-5s looking for a chance to prove yourself, this is the tournament for you. If you're below U rank, you're also welcome to participate. It is going to be on the 29th. That's this coming Saturday after today, seven days from now, at 4 p.m. PST or 7 p.m. EST. Uh, make sure you join their Discord. Use the command exclamation point star cup and click the link. Big shout out to Edge and the PK team. And we got, and we got one more event for you. MCTT <laughs> Anniversary 2. Doubles Not tournament. much to here. It will be on February 5th. That's two Saturdays from now. So we got Tetrio Cup today. We got Star Cup tomorrow. And our <laughs> Star Cup next week on the Saturday. The next Saturday over is going to be MCDT Anniversary 2. Make Find sure you your use partner. the MCDT. Hold on. MCDT command in chat. Exclamation mark MCDT for the link to Modern Mino Community where this event will be held. This is actually the first event that I kind of like became really good friends with Jed through. The first edition. Tell of this. 
And, Straight up. You know, I love this event. Great, great stuff. Yeah, so big shout out to Bag, big shout out to Alex. Might get to sponsor me for this event one time. And, uh. For sure. Uh, triangles sure. Are, are coming up, but uh, make sure to check out um, MCDT, Star Cup. There's so many events going on. I love the yeah, Tokyo community. February is going to be packed the end of January as well. Vince versus Blarg. This is going to be crazy. Uh, El you can Classico. see that Blarg even more focused or less defense focused. More, I feel like that, that graph just like it physically can't go any farther, you know? So it looks like it's the same point, but Blarg is like a little bit extra juicy on that on that. True. Offense. Like, look how I want you to know how Blarg has more wins, but substantially less friends. That's a Tetris <laughs> analogy, right there. Blarg dude. is on this Sigma grind set. One time, <laughs> no new friends, dude. That's what he's trying to say. He's been trying to tell you this for a long time. Blarg um, done got the apple. You know he. He has shaved down his fun fact to simply Apple. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, you know, actually, you know what? You know what? My seating for our seating for this tournament. Oh, chef's kiss. What can I say? So crazy. So crazy our, how we're good at seating. It's so crazy. <laughs> the meme is over. Stop. The meme is over. <laughs> stop. Stop criticizing. We think we're trying. <laughs> It's not my Took fault that that juju on the beat upsets your favorite player. I can't control that. <laughs> but Blarg but, gonna uh, take this over Vince. 3.6 PPS, 185 APM. Uh, yeah, Blarg and, uh, looking like a menace. Big, big menace. Apple Gaming right there, bro. Apple Gaming. Hashtag Apple Gaming on Twitter. Get it trending? No, no. <laughs> are, are we going? Yeah, are we not this again. again? Not again! You can't, you can't be doing this all the time. You can't be doing this all the time. Apple gaming on the spot. Nah, nah. Um, Apple gaming aside, we got some real gaming, real Tetris gameplay coming through. We We're got get into the start. real set here, looking like an MKO tournament. start. We'll see what both of our players go for. Blark with the MKO. Vince choosing to do PC. Gonna find it. Blark pushed a little bit up, but it is all clean. And as we know, just look at this. Huge, huge, huge of the garbage ball. Five spike. But this is not there a little bit. It's crazy how if you see the pause, it's still four PPS. It's like okay, yeah, <laughs> yeah nice pause. Ooh, but pause, no paused. That's a dub ski for Vince. Takes the first win here. Very characteristic. Very similar to what happened in that uh, that firestorm set, but. Blarg looking for, for a win here. Ooh, and oh, this is a Tetrio a moment right here. This is the most, Ooh, no. of this is the most Tetrio Tetris. thing I've ever seen. This time, though, neither player gonna die, but Blarg gonna yeah, get you're the wrong. round there. Dude, oh, dude. If, if Blarg didn't actually properly place the piece and Vince didn't misdraw it, that would have been exactly a Tetrio Cup 5 moment that we had. Uh, I was it six? No. Yeah. One of the earlier ones. I know exactly. It was yeah. one. It was, was watching that one too. No, no. It was nominated for an award. Sorry. Ooh. But unfortunately. But Mark, uh, let's see if he can get out of here. He might. He's just able to. Just get out. Can, you, can you make up your mind whether you're going to do the aerial? He almost he went the for the floater. That was insane. He oh, did go for he it. It did quite not get the work. In time. It, and Vince gonna go up two to one here. Dude, he did the Blarg Wiggle on the floater. He's actually insane. Shout out to the it Blarg takes, Wiggle. It takes some balls to do the Blarg Wiggle in tournament. But I suppose for for him, it's like it's like instinct, you know? It's, oh, great. It's his yes, that's from Blarg. And then another parapet. He's sending a lot of pressure with through these Keyspin singles. Now transitioning into this bigger Keyspin double. Back to back 12, 13, 14. 15. Oh, oh but he it, dies for it. And who Vince cares? Getting, like, that, Philip, like, absolutely, like, 
Filipino. <laughs> he liked her, dude. He just, he he just flipped the... him out of the wind. He just... You, you can never... It doesn't matter how many shots you throw if you get sniped. It's True. just that simple. But right now, go. though... And look at all this cheese being sent by Vince on Sublarge's board. Oh, man. This is insane right now. This is just playing too fresh. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. But right now, he's a little bit cheesed up. A little bit of an awkward stack here. So has to go all the way down. He's like, I'm not playing. Gets a 9-0 stack. Ooh, a little bit dangerous. Passed it on the Tetris there. A little bit, like, very, very... A 180, stack. though. He's definitely playing a lot more aggressive. Uh, which I think is characteristic of the kind of Bark style gameplay. Vince, with so much pain on his board, is going to be able to get down and send a tad bit of cheese. Let's see if Bart yeah, is able to down it. That Vince plays a very hybrid style, right? He plays like, sometimes he'll play like FS, or he'll play like uh, Vin, or like Vince. Vince plays like Vince Omega. Um, <laughs> or he'll play like, like, um, yeah, or ZZ. He's a very uh, dynamic player who learns very fast. So it's just. You know, we're surprised, but it's so much practice he puts into the way he plays the game. Vince definitely like the... If every other player is oh, what the one heck? play style, Vince is the melting pot. You know? Like melting pot culture, one time. R yeah, okay, Wrench, I got it. I live in America. I love, I love melting pot culture. Vancouver, one time. Let's go. Shout out to, <laughs> shout out to, to melting pot. Shout out to internationalism. Anyway, back into the match. We got uh, oh, a dead board. Yeah. 600 Blarge versus score? That's, oh That's a fully loaded sniper and a headshot. I feel like we've seen so much more of that just like right at the perfect moment, sending a huge, huge spike and just killing off of that alone. Blarge with a great floater. Oh my God, that was insane. A really nice upgrade right there. Squeeze Ooh. it a little bit more damage in the down stack. Vince with this weight no Oh, Vince, deals. yeah. Oh my god, he's gonna live. No way. No way. Oh, he's he's holding on for dear life. He's literally, oh, he, he tried to died, fight his dude. internet. He literally fought his internet provider with all his soul, and he, he just couldn't do it. Vince, you know, in that pause, walked over to the router, punched it, walked back over. Straight <laughs> up. <laughs> Oh, boy, I see if he's able to get anything with this. Now, Stack, he misdrops a tad bit, but he is going to live to see another day. Making that TST so dangerous, but it's a season he's with able some to big pressure right now. It. Big pressure is coming from Blarg. Vince escapes pretty easily. Pretty good, but there's a little bit of a decision at the bottom of the board to be made here, and Blarg stacking up this big pressure again. Looking pretty good, you know. Both players looking look for the kill. Really hot right now. Yeah, Flag looking for the kill. Not quite able to find it there. Now things. Ooh, does the wiggle? The wiggle into down stack? Oh, what a great down stack by Flag! Such a good right out of that Blark. situation. He used to get out, but yeah. Vince won't stop the pressure, and now this is probably gonna kill Blark here. Oh, it is. Three five. Oh. I feel like I've watched like three full length sets already. Like top level gameplay is something else. It's so insane here, but you we just, gotta... It's, it's just so exhausting so quickly, you know? You're like, oh my gosh. Oh, oh Blark, no, Blark, no! Off the gun Mishiro stacking. Just gonna be forced to accelerate into mid-game. Getting a ski spin, though. Damage. Nice little compromise. With the Tetris and the garbage, too. Not gonna take the TSD. Yeah, they didn't have the pieces there, Blarg. And now Vince... Ooh, doing that T-spin mini into Tetris is gonna put Blarg in a bit of an awkward situation. But Blarg just... Rips through all that garbage so instantly. Dude, just, Blarg just boomed him, honestly. He just boomed him, you know. <laughs> Crazy. Ooh, and again, another weird, uh, too wide situation? For oh, Vince, no. still managed just to bounce back through it. Very nicely done. Vince really Blarg. playing all over the board right now. Like, it's, it's kind of fascinating to watch, you know? It's oh, really that was dangerous. a great cut copy! That was some great foresight on Vince's part. Blarg able to survive it. Let's see if he's Ooh. able to get some pressure back at Vince here. 
And the Larg is looking for some kind of way down, barely still finding it, but I'm still a little bit concerned. <laughs> Alright, that's the down stack. Attack from Larg. Oh, Vince. Spike to the face. Vince going and crazy. Finding a mid but this is really good fuel right here for Blarg if you can get to it. Oh, but that eyepiece, that's not, that's not good. Working really fast through it, though. Oh, a great prophecy uh, sort of forecast on Blarg's part. Gonna get to the next. Uh, well, we got a bit of a fractal and a huge misdrop from Vince there. He's gonna need to buck here for a little bit. And he's probably gonna have to speed through all this cheese, all this. This is a great moment for Blarg right now to take advantage of. Although Vince just magically made it all disappear. Like, it's just... Ow. Houdini. You know, just <laughs> Just Houdini? All that garbage? Oh, oh, <laughs> seriously, oh, no, you Blarg, really did Houdini it. Oh. The position is not great, but it's good enough just to get there. 6-3 over Blarg right now. That was such a Blarg was like, drop. for my next trick, double <laughs> hard drop. Um, but yeah, very, very nicely done there from Vince. A three game lead right now. You don't want to extend that Vince lead because he's such a good player at holding it. Okay, all are going crazy with this LFC right now. You love it. Ooh. Larg oh my with God. so much pressure and Vince, no eye Vince piece does not, no. No, no pieces at oh, all. Oh, yeah. Spider-Man, no, no way home. Yeah, Spider-Man, no way home right there, dude. No way. Very unfortunate there from Vince, who... Yeah, no eye piece, no, no wind perms. Vince is Spider-Man, no way home. Barb's still in it, though. Oh, what's uh, Peter's what best friend? Y'all remember? <laughs> uh, <laughs> straight up. That's him. That's him. Yo, Uncle Ben X2. <laughs> Uncle Ben and X2's Uncle rice. Ben X2. That's crazy. <laughs> With great Uncle stacking ben. comes great responsibility. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fucking funny. God, Blarg here transitioning into this LSG stack. And you know, if you've watched any Blarg streams in the past a billion years, you know that he's been training himself for this. And he's, he doesn't, he, he's able to find a kill off of it. Vince at the bottom of the board setting up a tease, tease the triple. Dude, honestly, they are truly going sickle mold right now. This is crazy. No? Yes, definitely. Ooh, but right now. Spark with this intense back to back is really keeping it alive. Has to break it a little bit. Oh, okay, this down stack is a little sus. Oh, huge, huge cheese attack coming in from Vince. Blark working through it very, very well, though. Vince with the and big up stack. 10 spike. Blark sends it back. It's so hard to follow. Oh my god. Oh, look at this look at this back to back from Blark again times 10. Busting out these chains like crazy. Still surviving, Vince putting out so much pressure. Very well done there from Blark here. Ooh, he's gonna have to skim a little bit. He's not gonna to do any real pressure to Vince, but Vince misdrops himself. Nah, Again, Vince Houdini. just made a sick TS combo, dude. Houdini with the oh, spell. Oh, the luckiest Blark, garbage for Vince. Thrown back at him. Honestly. Blarg was just shafted, not gonna lie to you. Vince getting all that garbage in the middle of his board, perfectly accessible. True, truly great situation to take advantage of. Let him block that round out. Oh, and the both players pass through the garbage! Pass through again! Ooh, very happening? well done here. Oh, oh no, oh no, Blarg. Blarg needs to be really precise here. Oh, it's not fixable. Get there. Does not get it. 262 p.m. Vince, 478. Bro, there's these are like 400 averages almost every game. Players? And to say that a year ago, you, you would just not believe it. It's so crazy. Ooh. Wire here. Great, great cut copy. Up nice here. little cut offset Take fractal crackle. there. Gonna take the round. Three game lead though for Vince. Very, very close to victory here. Blarg has got to be feeling the pressure. Yeah, but you know, Blarg, I feel like today especially is in that, in the zone. He could do it, but. Oh, what the fuck just happened? Finds a four combo into Tetris PC, and that's just like, what, what are you really going to do, you know? 
we are entering a territory right now and it will only happen if you believe if you believe in the legend of the funny number it will happen Lord, but only show me if the you funny believe number. god show Lord, me the funny number Let's see if he's able to get anything out of it gonna get some great t-spins using a couple t's but no instead a little bit of a crossroads here but blurring not able to capitalize and he's a little bit cheese himself. He's doing the Blarg Wiggle on the on the down stack. It's one time for just, people. He, he he does it for the fans. Yeah, oh, look at this down stack. This is crazy. Vince with a bit of a misdrop. He finds a great spin to get no, out of Blarg, it. No, 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 not the misdrop. Oh. No. Oh, look. I, I don't know if he's gonna be able to get out of it. He yes, he is. will. He survived. Barely. It's crazy. Oh my God. He's crazy. He's on a new I... level. He's looking for the funny number. He's He wants the funny number so bad. Come on, show me. Oh, He's searching for Oh, the That was so scary. But, but right, Vince, Vince does not want that to happen. This is nuts. Oh my God. Okay, two speed triple there for Blart. But I don't Vince, know how Blart is staying alive through all this monstrous assault from Vince. This is nuts. Look at that. Vince now, with so much clean on his board, he's gonna get there. Huge spike coming in, another 12 spike. Oh, but Blart gets the multiplier. Blart looking for the floater. Okay, this is a little bit. Alright, I'm a little scared now. Oh, Blart going for that T spin. Gonna count that up to four as well. Some huge attack oh, and Vince the kind risk of from Vince. Oh no, a missed drop from that eyepiece. The eyepiece missed drop is gonna be. Ooh, but the, what it's the? Fine. What oh the? My what? God. Funny the number. Funny we number, believed hard legend. enough. We did the it. Legend of the it's funny number, nice. folks. We believed. Drop your nices in chat. Drop your and nice also, in the chat right if now. If you watched a little tournament called Wrench Revolution, you know that Blark has come back from deficits greater than this but will he wrench will he be able this one's a big one this one's a big one to come back through 610 against Drop a vince who looks... seven if you want to see blarg looking number Clip seven for tetra cup number seven let me see that seven Ooh. does not get the I second one he i am about... alone seven or in know. chat what a god Vince accepting so much clean garbage. Ooh, Blark was a great, a great find there. This is very close. Oh, he's playing fresh. Ooh. Oh, but Vince is also playing it fresh. But there's a little bit of a sus overhang, and this is the moment for Blark. Oh Vince with the sus mega downstairs. What is this, dude? All right. This is crazy. Is I'm on. Awesome. Back fourth fire players. And a huge STSD coming in from Blark. And he gets a What was that? Oh, oh my god! This? 7 10! 7 10! 7 10! 7 10s! If you got an 8, it's your time! Anyone? Holy moly, this is. This is actually. We have had so many sets that I'm ready to call the set of 2022 tonight, folks. This is such a crazy. Oh my awesome god! And look at Blarg! <gasps> 8 10, that's 8 10, 8 10, baby. <gasps> that's a comeback. Did somebody say 9? Tiebreaker. You need to put your nine. You need to put your nine. A set so strong that the stream cannot withstand it. A set so strong. You will remember. Oh, let's go. Let's go. And Vince's the internet APM. not playing to his He's favor right now. APM. Blark going Some nuts. Great Just a T spin display. And Vince is oh dead. God, and that's, that's a 9 10. That's, that's nine, nine, that's nine. Do it's... I see a deuce? Do I have a deuce? One time, one time, show me a deuce one time. Let's You're go. Gonna have in, to in the chat. You're gonna Blark have to type opening up the Hachi spin. That's a new one. Oh, it's huge. The big down stack. And Vince Ooh, missed Vince's the internet. Time. It's not the being internet. cooperative. Blark, Blark. What is happening? Ooh. Ooh. And they what? had to pause there, what unfortunately, for Vince's internet. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm so scared! This is crazy. I can't believe Oh my god, okay, oh my god. Blark looking for the like a copy here. Tetris. T TSS, and Vince doesn't have to oh, pieces, it. and it's a, deuce. Deuce. <laughs> and it's a deuce! It's a deuce, it's a deuce, it's a deuce, it's a deuce! Oh my god. That's it, Oh my god. 
Oh my god. Lord, it's a fucking here. deuce, folks. He came back from hell. He came That's back through everything. You counted. We got the deuce. Oh my god, folks. This no. is That's insane. It, Six, now, ten, who's gonna ten, ten. It? Is it Blarg caught off the presses of taking four rounds in a row off of Vince? Or is it Vince, you know? Like, you never know who's gonna do it. Blarg sending so much cheese, but Vince so smart, canceling it Vince all playing off. Defensive. Vince playing super defensive this round. Mm. I think Vince is a tad bit, he's a little scared, you know? Like, he's kind of shaking in his little, in his boots. True. And honestly, who could blame him? Real, we're just spitting fire right now, just straight up factoids. But oh, look at this upgrade from Dark the Kaidon TSD into the Tetris. This is just gigantic. Now it's all clean. Oh, Vince with a great down stack here. He decides to cancel off more of that cheese, only accepting a tiny bit. Oh, and oh my god! god. Oh, oh my god! god. 11 10 for Blarg. Oh my god, folks, this is literally... <laughs> this is the- is this the set of the year? We Are you starting the game? Show me the money. Oh, it's been another PC oh that's just god. gonna feel Blarg more. Ooh, but Blarg is kind of peace deficient right now. I'm he's scared, kind of... I'm scared. Oh, he's so he cheesed up. down right now. Vince but he's gonna still has... Great down stack. He's gonna get there! Ooh, still and look alive. at those misdrafts from oh, Vince! Vince! He's dead! Vince, Vince he's dead! Done. No, Vince is not dead here! He's gonna oh my find god. the way out! He lives! Crazy. He lives! He lives! Jesus. How did he Oh live? my god! It's Vince! Oh my god! No, no Blarg with the TP's misdraft! No! What oh, is happening no. right now? What is going This is nuts. Oh my god! That sounds like on Blarg's side! But he's Ooh, right back up. What is going on? What is going on? God. What is happening oh. here? Now we're back at a neutral position. Blarg doing the game of Shiro Vince, uh, I think, with that lag. But Blarg's but that's big game of Shiro can get there. Gamu win? Gamu win? Can I get a Gamu win in the chat? Gamu win? That's, that's oh my huge. God. That's huge. That's, 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 that is the previous ultra world record speaking right there. Okay, oh no my God, but Vince, Vince, Vince is looking for a win of his own. Misdrops on his entire board here. Wait, this might be is super, super dangerous for him. He, t he closes out and Blarg wins the sets. Oh my God, Blarg wins the sets. From oh six ten, that was so insane. Oh my god! Oh my god. From six ten oh. to eleven thirteen, I have to take the replay. Comeback. That's crazy. But more than what that, that has been saved in my soul. That Real. has been saved in my mind. Oh my god! The most insane sets we've seen out of like a million insane sets we've seen. God. Oh my god. Oh my I god. Agree. I love this earth? game. What's that? I love Holy Tetris. Moly. And I love you, Dude. our viewers, for getting to experience this with us. God. Thank you so all great. for being here. Dude. This is this is so insane. We are oh floating god. a breath That's 400 weird. viewers. Thank you all. This we're, one. We're gonna, oh you know what's crazy? crazy. We're gonna save a PNG of that replay file onto a throw pillow. We'll sell that. We'll sell that as merch. You know. We'll we'll make that into an <laughs> NFT, dude. Oh. <laughs> one time. One time. <laughs> Jed. Jed. That is. That was such an impressive set from both players. From both players. Oh my god. And there's more. There's more. It doesn't end. This isn't the final. It's. It's. We I don't even. One oh my what god. I, I just. I can't believe it. Oh. I can't believe it, man. I can't believe Dude, that's it. That's insane. I just can't believe How it. It's so her. insane. <sighs> but with that, we do have our finals yep. coming up. We got. Oh my god, I was about to say Wombo. <laughs> <laughs> we got Blarg versus Diao in the grand final. Oh wait, uh, just oh, act. Okay. Oh, production, production. Just, just oh, act oh, like hello. that didn't happen.
Yo. We got <laughs> so crazy. Bolark coming up from losers, clawing his way after a, an impressive, impressive set against Vince to fight Yao once more, who bested him in the winner's finals. But what do you think is going to happen, Jed? What do you think? Give me, give me your take. Blarge Blar put his soul in that losers finals, man. This is a fifteen. He's he's gonna find, gonna have to go into those energy reserves for sure. Gonna have to pace himself. Diao mm -hmm. is notoriously indestructible at times, so he's gonna have to pull something very special here. But I, I can expect to see a great set for sure. I fully, fully expect a banger of a set. Uh, Diao, of course, has not dropped a tournament since his entry in... I don't know, what what, what was the last tournament that Diao didn't enter and then did not win? Oh my god, I I couldn't tell you. I, exactly, I feel like the last right? time Diao lost was... In, Diao, he, Diao he, lost he one set against Ritteru at Comet Open, which was in December. But past that, he's won so many tournaments from winner's side, but now... Bolarg, in his first tournament of 2022 and also his first tournament in a while, he's here. He's gonna. He's here. And I could not be oh happy. Oh my gosh! Yes. This is I, such. I would just like to thank you all. Huge. Huge in terms of it's in terms of narrative, in terms of level of play. Like we were talking about earlier, you know, you show this play to uh, the the top finishers at a tournament like Tetrio Cup Two. That was around last year. Uh, events Girl. like Caden's Tetrio tournament, uh, the second one. You straight, know? Up. <laughs> straight up, straight up, straight up. The tournament had FS that, that, and the Jambo in it. That had a that like man, that is insane. Like, yo, pull up to our tournaments, what? baby. I don't, perhaps. But you, you show know? you show them this level of gameplay. You show them like the 500 versus score, the 250 APM held, and Callum. What? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> like, what are you supposed to do, right? Like, you see this light shining on my head? That's what I'm seeing. That's like it's God. At the end of the tunnel, because you are literally dying, and how fucking crazy this is. <laughs> it's I, I can't, I can't, I can't with this gameplay. But we'll we'll have to push through the finals here. It's gonna be so crazy. And again, thank you all for coming. This is the final. I I, I have no words. I have no words besides what's coming up here. Yeah. Ooh, All and right. we both see Getting the final so stats. Look at these triangles. The final so triangles. Last yeah. triangle of the tournament. What what does Blark say? What what is the conclusion to the Apple saga? Wide people happy. Wide people happy. Dude, wide people happy. More like wide apple happy. One time. Fringe. Bruh. What? That's all. That's all. <laughs> Just bruh. Just bruh. Just bruh. But this is... This is so insane. This is so crazy. And we will be having our warm-up. Uh, Blarg Dio. I don't know how representative this is going to be of the rest of the set. But I can say that this whole set is going to be insane. In the membrane. You know how it is. Real. Blarg with the great... That was such a great T-spin. Dude, Blarg, Blarg is like the master of T-spins that I don't actually know exist. And then I see it and it's like, what the fuck? Oh, but but <laughs> like, Dio is like, look at me, I'm gonna find a PC. Watch me do it. It's crazy. Tag with the big glue emote. Nice. Mm -hmm. Blarg on the left side, Dio on the right in this warm-up and throughout the set. Blarg looking a little bit cheesed right now. And he, it looks like that's going to be a Diao dub in the warm-up. But again, might not be representative of the rest of the set. Oh, I don't know. I, it felt it felt like both players were just going absolutely ham at it. Going crazy mode on it. You know, you never know. It was so crazy yeah, Jed died. It is oh, so crazy God. that Jed did die. F in the chat for Jed, unless he comes back. Him. We'll miss, we'll miss my man. Maybe he got mom. Got, did he? Did my man get hit with the with the mom? Oh, his headphones died. I was gonna say maybe you should check Discord. <laughs>
but we will be getting right into the set here. Uh, why with the TSS opener gonna absorb more? Ooh. Okay, Blood Clan a little hesitant. I don't know what the deal is here right now. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. He's probably look, he's probably feeling a tad bit of the nerves, if I had to guess, you know. Fresh off of that huge win, off of Vince. Yeah, the, yeah, the, the hard hat or something. 100%. out here with so much clean and to be able to return it all. Why are you sitting off a lot of cheese there, though? And, uh, mm. just dealt with. What do you think, uh, you know, Diao being like this almost insurmountable monster, what do you think Blark needs to do to be able to take the set and also the reset? If he's gonna do Bro, it. I don't, if I knew I'd be if, if I knew I probably wouldn't still be ranked. You know what I'm just saying. Um <laughs> that's true, that's true. <laughs> uh, you know, I, I don't know. Honestly, I just I just straight up don't know. Like it doesn't even seem to me like yeah, I was really even playing at full power yet, you know. He's just he's just kinda like chilling. So we'll we'll, we'll find out. But uh, I think Blarg is gonna have to really take it to a new level here. Uh, like, he had this big clean back and forth sometimes, but I think he's really gonna have to get a good grip on cheese with uh, this mm -hmm. set, much more than the last one. Yeah, Diao, definitely a uh, player who will intentionally send uh, messier and messier uh, just to trip your the opponent up. And, you know, it's sorta has come out in the last bit of the set, but you never, you never know, you never know what Diao might pull out of his freaking bag of tricks next. My question is one time, one time, is this going to be enough to revive Jed's headphones? What kind of death we deal with? You know? The world may never know. Let's see, nice D out here, some great up stack. Making a good TSS. To Ooh, preserve. And a C spin, spin at that. Oh, not going to make the full C spin, but, you know, upgrading it I further. I think up more than enough for that, you know. Mm -hmm. Look at this attack from Blark onto Diao, and Diao is just relatively unfazed, you know? He's finding these great down stacks, a bit of a misdrop. Uh, but he, he, but a bit of a misdrop, but he gets through it quickly. <laughs> and, uh, you know, he's in a great position now. Blark gonna drop another round to that huge attack uh, on, from Diao. Just an insane spike uh, to close out that round. See if Blarg is able to get his foot on the handhold there. Ooh, a great buildup, but he is awfully high on top of the garbage ball right now. He gets there, a 16 spike, but Diao has so much clean on his board. I don't get it. I don't get it! Cause look at this! Just... Dio, it feels like he never receives cheese. Ever! Look at this! And then he just, he just kills Blarg 3-0 in Dio's favor. What, what will Blarg do? You know? This is just so crazy. This video really is just on a new level. Let's see if Blarg is able to be able to take a round at least. Small steps, and, he, and it looks like he's going to be able to. Blarg yeah, finding a great spike, a beautiful down stack into that, into that hit as well. Just really good stuff. Let's see if he can recreate that again and again enough to take this set. Off D out. Okay. Blarg's continuations are so good. Off, off of his uh, DKI and, and other openers. That may be true, but Dio really keeping it nice and clean. Very top of the board here. Keeping things looking very nice. Oh no! Blarg with a bit of a mistrust. And it doesn't look like one that will be able to be dealt with quickly. He does end up getting down. Living to see another day. 
but it, his position is not as good as I think he would like it to be. D out here with that J miss drop. A, you know, small, small flubs, but both players are making them at rates where they're sort of canceling each other out and they're giving each other the opportunity to escape relatively unscathed, maybe with a bit of off position. Oh, boy, with a mid-game PC! Lord, finding the and PC and one. another one that's huge. Oh my that god. That is so huge. I feel like we've seen so many more mid-game PCs this tournament than we have seen in any other. Slowly but surely, always... it's becoming more and more of a thing. Mm -hmm. Blark accepting a tad bit of garbage. Dia waiting. Blark with a bit of an upstack. Ooh, a great nice offset. Oh, it's a. Oh my. Oh, Blark survives. That spike would have been enough to kill almost anybody, but Blark Not lives Blark. it. And now, it's Blark's attack. You know, he has the clean now, but Diao also has the clean because, you know, Diao. Oh, but that missed drop, that's sad. He's gonna be on porch. What the ZPs. Alright, 2-4 here. You know, it's, it's a bit of a deficit, but nothing that Blarg is unfamiliar with, you know? At this at this point in this in both this tournament and his experience as a competitor, big deficits. You you kind of become acquainted with them. A great build up from Blarg here, but Diao sending so much clean on Blarg. Yeah, Diao was really keeping nice back to back. A, yeah. God bleeds a little bit of cheese. Just that once those few couple lines are really, really putting a uh, a huge problem into Diao's whole uh, whole win con here, it feels like. And if that miss drop looks difficult to fix up, he's going to be forced to skim off it a lot. Uh, Blark not really able to find the answer there, and he's going to pay the price as Diao finds the attack to kill. 2-5. Slowly but surely, Diao kind of moving ahead here, and uh, this Blarg, I wouldn't want too much of a lead to really start the mount up. Not now. Oh, Is he gonna be moving ahead? ahead like... But that's a scary eyepiece, and that's another round for Diao. Two six here. Okay, the PCs from Blarg this round into a Tetris PC. Now that surely is too much, but yeah, Diao we'll, somehow surviving. Little, I'm not uh, sure how. Feel that lag, but both players gonna be able to return to a somewhat neutral position. Blarg a little bit cheap up, but gonna find a big spike. Blarg trying to get this up stack started. Looking pretty good so far. The nice DSD Tetris making really great. Use of that garbage at the bottom of the spike. Nice. Down stack, that almost, was incredible. Almost enough to kill Yao, but again, ah, that no. survival is just so, so strong on Yao's part. And oh, look at that. That was crazy. Donation that pays off in dividends yeah. here. That tie down was sick, nasty. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh no, 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 I missed hold from Borg. A little bit of a back step right here, although the well's looking pretty good. I think he's got plenty of options right here. Not too worried about it. Though. Nice little upgrade here, getting some back to back out pretty quick. Nice little float upgrade, you know. But Diao easily finding that down stack, still not threatened, and instead now oh, Blarg. Blarg going for the ski space ski triple. triple. That is such a risky. That is such a risky build. I think Blarg throwing all of his all of his options at the wall here, you know. If he's gonna go, he's gonna go like guns blazing, you know. Truly. The well, Bard going for pure PC this time. Only gets two. And now we enter another another big mid game. Yeah, with a huge huge spike. That's yeah, like that three. Yeah, Tetris. And he's still upgrading it with more. Mm -hmm. This is a huge down stack right there. That classic picturesque Diao stack. It's been you know, no one 
you know, no, you're experience. Larg with a great STSD build. That was so. I felt. I feel like he pulled that out of the thin air. Ooh. And a oh, huge look at that down stack. And now Diao is a is a lot cheese. Let's see if Larg is able to get the damage Ooh. required out to kill. And he's gonna get there. Yeah, look at this back to back chain. Larg, that was in. sick. All right, I am back. Sorry for the technical issues. Yo. Oh, that's good. Good. Oh my we god. At, catching you back up. We are 3 7 in Diao's favor. And you know, it's it's looking like a big a big hill to climb, but nothing that Flarg unable to do. Or hasn't done before, right? We saw that Vincent. Yeah, that's Absolutely true. insane. Ooh, but right now Blarg's going to need to downstack here uh, very urgently as Diao is just so good at those. Like, uh, burpee, like you said, uh, spikes, for dude, sure. Burpee spikes, dude. I'm co we're coining that term. Hella burpee spikes, but it doesn't pay off that time. No, and, and Blarg gets a pretty comfortable win. See what oh happens God. here. Let's see what we got. Lark entering an LST stack. Let's see how this one turns out. He is forced to break it a little bit in a kind of an ugly way, but he finds a great down stack to get out of it. Really, really beautiful. Just Ooh. oh no, but the misdrop. A lot less beautiful. Ooh, but uh, no T, no eyepiece permits for Diao, uh, Diao here, so he really couldn't counter and spike him as hard as uh, he would normally. And now we got a fractal coming through from Blarg into an LST stack. Ooh, Another an LST stack. Oh my and god, no such a one. Some huge attack coming in. But it's all clean and you no know, Dia with that insane, insane down stack. Gonna be able to so counter three. spike the like the lights out of Blarg. True, and Dia, you saw that sub three PPS just very timing focused, very macro focused uh Dia here. Just trying his best to just feel out Blarg and accelerate when he needs to and not constantly here, which put, makes Blarg the pacemaker and and Yao just doesn't it doesn't matter who has the pace, you always be able to, to return. Play, letting your opponent play pacemaker is such a scary, scary thing to do, especially in a game like Tetris, which is it can be so volatile with so much garbage flowing back and forth, but Diao makes it work. Not gonna make it work that way. Okay, make me eat my word. Commentator's curse, baby. <laughs> take it back. <laughs> you know, take Ooh. it back. Yeah. <laughs> we're in a very similar spot here uh, with Blart, where he was against uh, Vince. Ooh, mm. and finds the PC. Gonna we'll find, find another one. PC. Great. Your Looking PCs. for the. Ooh, oh, he's gonna find PCs. a one. Ooh, but and now, not enough. now he has to deal with this amount of garbage coming back in. Ooh, and this is very scary for Blarg. He's taking his time to make, um, accidentally misplace a piece there because just one piece, one bad down stack, it's you can't get out. You're dead, and that's how Diao wins his games. He's just very um, forcefully making you play perfectly, and if you don't, you will die. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Blarg is having a no play room out of his error. mind right now. Mm, right now, oh, though. Yeah. Clark, I mean, Diao's playing the most efficient I've ever seen a player play. Um, nearly 200 APM on only 3.3 PPS is and we say, very, we say very hard. Things, but, you know, <laughs> you know, like, I mean, of course, in relative terms. I mean, I want to see any of you here. I mean, I, I'm a 3.2er, <laughs> and I'm not, I'm not getting 180. That's a oh, very efficient. Someone do the APP. Yeah, he's, huh? he's, he's. he's Always to one, you know, 240 out of 200, doing pretty good. Yeah, very, very efficient. Day. Likely one of, one of, if not the most efficient player in the game. Oh, my lord, that is a huge downside. Blark finding the survival with a great, absolutely great amount of garbage. Downstack. He was looking for this upgrade, not finding the SP in time. Instead, going for a little down stack. Misses the IP, it's a little rough. It's okay. That is so Ooh. much damage coming in from, a, from the out, but Blark survives piece. it. He yeah, very there. genius teaspoon. Blarg is Ooh. playing immaculately right now. 
and let's see if he Ooh, can... Oh, and as you say that, a little bit of burst there. Mistrap's a little bit, but manages to get that T-spin. Manages to get all the way down. Huge spike there, and Diao's internet is influencing this game to an unprecedented uh, level. <laughs> Okay. Some good clean back to back up stacking from Bard right here. We'd love to see it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, once again, we got one of those internet. Both players forced to receive, and Blarg's uh, like his receive is way dirtier, but he gets through it very, very well. Again, let's see nice if he goes for that kite on. Go for it. Nice I feel back like to back. we have seen so many more donations, so many more mid game PCs, so much more of that. Kind of obscure tech that we haven't really seen explored. Uh, oh my in, god. In, yeah, crawling ahead, Folks? coming close. Nine. Folks, there was a legend told in the Great Mountains of a prophecy of a Let's funny it. number. It and hey! it works. And Every, it works, folks. Can we get there? Can we get. You know Drop what to say nice. in the chat. Drop it. You know, no, you know what to say. Get it out of the We've system. been here before. We've Get it been out of your system. Before. We've been here before. We've been in this exact <laughs> score position. Yeah, the seven. Yeah, scale on a razor seven. thin margin. Boy, Can I see this a seven? Is, he's gonna get there. God. Seven nine. Seven nine. That's the seventh Somebody pillar right there, baby. This is insane. Is oh, no. is the is six nine Flarg's magic number? Not weird. <laughs> Just a coincidence? Uh, uh, yeah, coincidence. Anyways, you know, I feel like Mark, how does he do it? Investing big time in this one. He has so little room to work with. But yeah, he... playing super crazy right now, though. This is looking so good. If you see this down stack. As is that first yeah, minute. this is at least one APP right now from, from Bro, Diao. Yeah. One APP is attack bigger than PCs. Oh, Blarg looking scary right now. I don't know about this one, Chief. But oh my god! Oh, that this. was such a good solution. That was the one solution that would have gotten him out of that situation, and Blarg Ooh. found it. He just really, solved the really world's first Tetris puzzle. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to chess.com. Yeah, that is. That, yes. You could make Absolute, that into a PS yeah, quiz. Like, level down stack puzzle. That's that, yeah. like, real-time Oris exercise, you know? Lately, he's been on the kick of, like, ah, if you would've died, just analyze and don't, you know, or you wouldn't have been bad. Blarg is like, all right, I'm gonna do that right now. He said, all right, bro, live action. <laughs> he said live action analysis. The live action or no live action? Help. Yeah, I was dead here. Blarg, eight, nine! You thought eight, it was nine. gonna be, but it wasn't. A crazy, and absolute insane survival turnaround right there. This is a very critical moment here because this is the difference between a tie and what is. Ooh, wait, those be. Oh, oh my god, he's got That's, that's nice. the exact same thing that he did It is that's 9 huge. 9, folks. We've been here. You dropped your numbers. <sighs> we oh have indeed been god. here before. Time is a flat circle. Ooh. Nice teaspoon double, extremely good floating from Blarg so, there. Uh, Diao's still in the game here. Diao's using incredible defense though to get right through all that garbage. Oh my god, and Blarg at the bottom of his board. This is a great position for Blarg. He's working through that cheese very, very well. Ooh, but Diao here, look, looking for a good demo stack. Very nice like, defense there from Diao. Diao, we need to know how good Diao's defense is right now, like defense is right now against Oh, Blark, who's just oh throwing everything. God, going for that insanely risky... Uh, and, and, and that risky build, and can he miss drop, but he gets through it, and then he makes an SGSC, and what the, what is happening? This is into so a so donation, much. into a 6-3 stack, shout out a promo. Oh my this is God. one of those games that you have to watch twice, so you can watch each player once, you know? A 26 spike oh. of individual attacks. But Diaz still out. Ooh, and that's gonna be death for Blarg. Oh my it god. It is. Ten nine. Ten do, I have nine. A, do I have a juice? Is this, this the is... end? Is this the end? I no ask way. you. Ooh, we got the out. Setting up a mega spike there. 
Ooh, and oh. Blark will need to rush through. Oh, Ooh, nice very guy. nice survival there oh. from, from Blarg. But Yao still putting in pressure. Nice. Oh my god, Blarg is living. And again, another. Get to this down stack, and he will. Bro, just barely. three, three back to back 9 0 wells for Blarg on every single spike. This game does not want him to win. It's crazy oh rage. But Blarg he's pulling through is still. Diao putting out some oh immense God. pressure, but Blarg converting right now, I think. So how is he alive after that? Like, I know, and he's still powering through even more right now. He just got to deuce. Gonna get there it is. Deuce. Show me the deuce, baby. He's going to get to deuce. Folks, folks, and folks, just notice that. Notice how he got three 9 0 stacks. That's a, basically a death sentence in this game. And he just, he lives in down stacks and he powers through and he wins the game. And right now he's looking to take and another one. Imperial so Cross! This is so mega huge. This is so insane. There's so much pressure being put oh up. Oh, and and drops. Drops. That's it. Oh my god. And back, we're back on tournament point for Diao. There's still oh, room. No. Oh no. This is such a. I'm a believer. Yet again. I'm a believer that someone will come out on top here. Someone will win. Sign white touchers. Ooh. Back, back to the set, great though. Great he's been from Blarg. Yeah, that was a nice little. He's just, he's just on that down stack, finding a great find. Now Diao so cheesed up. Let's see if Blarg can find that pressure. And look at Diao's board. There's oh, not man. much pressure from Blarg. Diao escapes. Ooh, Diao is gonna need. Ooh, oh my god. Blarg. Oh my god. <gasps> it's such a oh. weird dynamic to see the player about to die and at the same time throw insane pressure. It's like. Oh my god, it's like. Ugh. Oh, this, this is might... my character bar, but look it, at this down attack, dangerous. and that's another deuce. We're back in it. Another 11, 11. This is a set to be remembered as are I mean, so many of the sets today i mean for this for this uh, we said <laughs> we're coming for the stacky awards this year man it's there's just no way that the quality of these sets are so insane oh, and blard is gonna here. take a set and That's now, reset point. 12, 11. Reset. Oh my reset god. Oh my for, god. The, for the first time oh since god. I think the very beginning of the set, he's up. Show me he's the up. game with Hero. He's going crazy and fast. There's the first PC. And he gets Show the PC. The PC. Ooh. Ooh. No DPC, but there's still some great garbage use. And Diao, look, look at Diao's board. He's so covered up here. Ooh, but just the. But it's okay. Diao's making this down stack. Look at this. He manages to get it. Borg is in a bit of a tough. Position manages to get out very nicely done. Oh, some real. Blarg. T spins will Ooh. never, ever not impress me. These are so. Oh, but this down second, you know, it's so huge. To try to get out of he makes a T spin out of it. Ooh, nice count to four there from Blarg, though. A bit of a power stack coming up from Blarg. He's gonna just turn it into a big Tetris ball. Ooh, and they're just both players. You're, you're, you're just if whoever you're rooting for here, you must. Oh no! So oh, intense. God. And we're back to a deuce. 12-12. 12. 12. 12. 12. 12. Right now, these players are fighting it out on the first set here, just looking for some sort of advantage. Yeah, wants that victory. Oh, we're saving the misdrop. Let's go, Blur. This is another one fixed. Blarg with a huge misdrop, but he's going to be able to get out of it. But even still, his position leaves a lot to be desired. Let's see if he is able to get out of it. Blarg getting out with a 15 spike. It's going to be a counter, and now we're in this kind Really of good conversion back. there. Wow, again, really good conversion from Blarg to stay in this one here. Mm -hmm. Very good multiplier usage. Yeah, I'm putting out some immense pressure, though. Oh my god. And right now, just that donation there from from Blar. Oh, Mid-game PC! Mid-game PC! And Another one! one. Oh, and but Yao yeah, survives and he, and he, he just rocks it right back at him! 
Blark survives the blow! Still in the game, but it's looking serious here. What a downstep. Ooh, all that cheese is going right back. Attack. He is mowing through this cheese. Into the Ooh. STST. Out of an eyepiece dependency, turns it into a TSD. Very nicely done there. Oh, but the uh, the big multiplier. Oh my god, so Lark is insane right now. What oh, and he earth? finds another spike. Oh my yeah, god, it's just relentless damage. Something. Oh, that he covers up! Lark covers up! He ooh, finds the ooh, downstab and Rally gets out, and he needs to accelerate to extreme speeds right now if he intends to survive. This pressure and from Biao. What oh. on earth? This round alone, a two minute round in the deuce 12 12 situation. Wow, what a God, and you saw Biao. another spike there. Biao is throwing everything at Blarg. Everything. He's looking for everything to kill him right now. He's trying to get that. Blarg but Blarg just doesn't die. Right he just doesn't die. It feels like the roles are reversed in a way, you know? Blarg not sending the attack, but defending to an insane degree. Oh, no, this not ice the ice pin. Just let it go. Oh my god. Blarg, even after that mishap, still able to to get there, get down, and send this attack. And now he's on the offense. This is a great Kaidon donation into an L based T spin. And he's gonna get a huge down stack, a 17 spike, Ooh, and, and he's he gonna take it. it. Reset point he again here it. for Blarg. Once again, crazy. another point in an insane insane set this is oh my to, god to folks recap what happened that round why don't you what? guys glad he that lived you joined in the like commentary. three insanely huge spikes and then what else had oh my god you're just, just how can you oh my god i i it's there's so many things to say and at the same time it's just right after the other this is tetris a 28 this spike. is tetris this, this and is this it. is a no that's a, not it Diao's your chickens before they hatch. Oh my god, Diao was a great teaspoon, but... Ooh, but he's it. dead. Blarg is oh, wait. doing it. That's oh the reset. He did it. The set. And he gets it. Oh my That's god. That's a pop-off right there. That's a pop-off. He off gets the set. 14, 12, 3,142 lines sent by Blark. 2,460 lines sent by Diao over a total of 26 rounds. 26 rounds? Oh my god, Dacer. We got, got one the... more set. And do we do we have the replay save? My god, I, I did save the replay. I did save the replay. I'll upload it Incredible. right now. Incredible. Oh Let's my god, go. folks. I got it, Dacer. I got it. Are you excited? Are you excited? Because I'm excited. We oh are. my god. It I just, seems like I our players I want to that. just want to jump into the second set. So it it seems as though that might be what happens here. All right, folks. I'm going to I'm going to drop the replay in in the chat for you all. Enjoy that. Oh, yo, it's after midnight. I've been playing Wordle again today. Let's go. Wordle. Any Wordlers? Let's go. I'm doing it live. All right. Let's... Oh, Clark, Clark says, let's run it. Oh. Oh, one minute. We got one minute. All right. All right. He wants a one minute break. All right. All right. Give him a one minute break, folks. We get, we get a little oh. water break. And we get it's the as serve. casters a bit of a chance. I don't to even got any water. I don't even got any water. I don't even got any water. I'm 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 dry. Okay. I'm also I'm also off water. But Jed, what happened? That's it. <laughs> what happened? It's just the most insane thing ever, right? It's just at first of all you thought, oh my god, another Diao dub. So easy, so easy. Um, I'm 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 going to bed. Free money, free whatever. And then, and then just out of nowhere. You know, the power of the funny number comes through, brings Blarg to a deuce. But the owl's like, no, 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 no. We're not uh, doing that. So, so he comes back 
He's like, um, no, actually, I will win. And then Blark's like, but I, I have the power. I have the power of the funny number. I have the power of the funny number. How can I lose? And that's what Nobody happened. The power of. I don't. The thing is, this happened in. This happened across Blarg's last two sets. He was down Ooh. six. He was down five nine, and then he won twice in a row in that two exact times? scenario. Two twice. times. No way. I just can't believe it. I can't believe we got. I. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Uh. This is this is so insane. This narrative that has been built, Blarg. You know, for the past couple tournaments, Tetrio Cup Six. Uh, what else was he unable to participate? Comet Open. Uh, there was some other tournament in December, or in like November, December, that he was unable to play in, and now he's back and he he wants it. He's he strong. It so he's bad. verified. All oh right. Oh my God! My lighting fell. Go into a bit of a second set warm up. And, uh, you know, what do you expect to happen in the second set, Jed? Diao, of course, has not dropped a he's not dropped a tournament in a while. But he did drop a set to Ritteru. Do you think a similar thing is going to happen here? Or do you think Blarik has what it takes to get the second set again? The thing about Ritteru is that he didn't, did he really ask for a break. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, he just went straight into the second one. Uh, viewer check? <laughs> we are being asked for. We are at 390 viewers. Oh, Yo, wow. let's go. Thank you all <laughs> so much for coming to this think... final, for breaking the viewer record. I think we're, yeah, we're breaking Tetrio, like, Tetrio tournament records uh, in terms of, like, big, big events, especially at Team TSD. So Yo, crazy. let's go. I, I finished the world. Yeah. Let's get it. Nice, nice. I, I want to thank you all. It's a four. It's a four. Nice. I want to thank you all for coming out, for watching this great final, for watching these insane sets. All of you, you're you're priceless, and so we just love you so much. Alan, come into this final. You know, if you if you like what you see and you would like also to donate to the prize pool, you can use the command exclamation point donate. You can subscribe to the team tsd twitch channel right here you can use your twitch primes if you if you have one of those lying around but we are gonna get right into the second set here this is the true grand finals and that is so yeah. insane so much pressure coming out from tl right out of the gate but blarg again similarly to the end of the last set he doesn't die he's will he die here no Ooh. apparently not Ooh. But let's remember, Diao is like like a Dark Souls boss for two phases. He's got three health bars. He gets Blarg stronger. Arg is in phase two of the Nintendo boss fight right now, straight up. <sighs> He's just, you know, Blarg is like, I've been grinding boss my whole life. You know, the sand hill, that's impossible. And every time you lose, you have to climb it back once again with the scarier mon. But, you know, Diao is just that one person. He's one of those two people just who become the gods of, of, of what is fast Tetris, you know? And Hello. and he's going to have to find um, some strength here, uh, Blarg, if he intends to to take the tournament you know and right now he's at a pretty comfortable pace here he's down stacking since a huge um spike to diao who uh, has to down stack that nine zero well mm -hmm. and, and let's not Blarg is floating four pps like on the dot here not an easy pace of gameplay to match and not an easy pace of gameplay to actually keep Ooh. up and he him. converts he that and that he gets easy. there with a seven spike diao cheesed up beyond belief Look at that cheese, but he gets through it. He's to meet ya, says Blarg there, but ooh, gets that T-spin yeah. mini so crucial to block there, and look at that misdrop from Diao. That's gonna be that, rough. 
Yeah, That's second round. Pressure. Mark Arturo gonna go number two. He's hot right now. He's playing super hot. A two will start, but let's not forget Diao also started very, very hot. Um, you know, the same way it goes for for Blark here. It, it could very well go for for Diao. I feel like I see these like full screen spikes, and then they don't die, and it's just it's ow. Can I get how that? does this happen? How do you how do you literally the game says you are meant to die to this? You're yeah, like it, it's like a DC when someone gets a curve truth and you're like yeah this is meant to kill and then it doesn't except there's no zone and these players are just insane yeah. or they're just <laughs> out of their minds absolute pure like like octane gas oh the not three. slowing down that's He's three really juicing it right now there and you can tell that blarg is just he is just on the train Ooh, on the train and Mr. pco there from uh from Diao, unfortunately, but I mean, he's a god at downstep. Gets through it very cleanly here. Once again, did another misdraw, but again, fixes it so cleanly. That's what makes Diao so dangerous, is that even if he makes a mistake, he knows how to fix it. Blarg there with doing a bit of that burpy, like, tank really high. I don't know if he did it on purpose, but that was crazy. Ooh. I'm quitting. A thousand percent. <laughs> You're too proud of that. I am very proud of it, okay? It's a, it's a good oh, bit. Oh, Speaking sad. of good bit, Blarg not doing so hot that round. Uh, Diao getting his first point in the second set. And yeah, right here we got a TKI coming up. Ooh, very badly misdrop there from uh, Diao. You don't want to get caught in this elephant storm mm -hmm. from Blarg. Ooh. And both players here are scrapping insane amounts of spikes. Again, Diao misdrops. He's going to need to fix it expeditiously, and he can't. 500 versus score. 500 versus score. He's insane. He's a beast. Just nuts. He's a beast. Yeah, but let's, again, don't ever count out Diao. Diao already beating... Uh, Blarg before, he can do it again, he's done it in the past, you cannot count him out, he's so strong. Mm -hmm. Um, even, even with inconsistencies, he just somehow finds the way, and, oh, and Blarg's Blarg gonna still need to fight very hard. Mm -hmm. Both players just fighting for their lives here in the True Grand Finals, and this, this is it. This is it, there's no more sets. This is the last this one. Is, this, this is, is the final more, one, yeah. folks. This is, if you've Blarg been here since the beginning... Thank you so much. What but on Blarg... earth? That's the two full screens. You see the Blarg's garbage bar go like past the board, and he's still and he's living. Blarg is on another plate of existence. Third eye wide, freaking open, dude. I mean, Diao is kind of a burpee. Crazy. Ooh, but Miss drops in. Oh, but he still, he still gets. Ooh, does he get he, out? He won't get out of that. Out no, of, he will not. Unable to. And that's a four oh. too. Yeah, Don't Diao with the STSC up there would have been incredibly brutal too. It was a pretty mm. good way to finish that one for him. Diao tends to go for hot streaks, um, and he's just insane at. I just, you know, going from what is seemingly a losing position into just a dominant display. Like once again, uh, Blarg cannot relax around Diao. Yeah, even though Blarg is up four two, there is so little room to make any mistake you know? yeah was, he's just so he's just so good at punishing and 100 percent here he out here but, so far up and he's, ooh, he cannot might, find oh, the this is way too he much attack. yeah you see blarg ready to find more I, attack now blarg. too blarg inching ever closer but diao like an ominous like an ominous presence dude like that himalaya like k2 dude he's actually like k2 you know like not, not, really not like, like the like highest, that. but it's about <laughs> a, a terminology. <laughs> any climber? Not an ecology. Blarg is too crazy right now. Look at this. Blarg, what the, what? Is that a big game trinity? Blarg, 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 you, gotta, you gotta get down from the ledge. He lives he from it. That was crazy. Down. The T spin what triple cut trinity. That was for the highlights. And that he was wins. for the that, highlights. That is... Did you see that? 
That was what? so insane. That was oh just god. unbelievable. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. That was for the highlight re That making Trinity to victory? No way. I don't way. think anybody's ever seen that setup win a round in tr a true grand final against Diao in a fast game. That, what a what the f move. that is, yeah, you oh need so God. much, so much, like, guts, you know, to get there, to be able to do so it. So much spirit, but again, like we said before, Diao doesn't stop. It doesn't matter what kind of setup you do, or what type of spikes you get, what type of lead you get, he's always ready to take it all back. Okay, coming back here. We got a back to back here. Diao playing at f almost 4.5 PPS, but does a terrible misdrop, loses yeah, the huge. game, and now Blarg is up 7 3. Blarg 7 3. This is looking huge. Extremely dominant. Right Indeed, now. this is huge. It is so insane. This is so huge. It woke Skyfire back up. That's crazy. That is yeah, crazy. unironically, it did. I set so big, I had to film it from far away, boss man! 8-3! Yet. I do think the one thing that, like, fueled Blarg is, like, his previous loss, maybe in, like, Wrench Evolution, where he was just that close, and now he's not gonna let that happen again. What's my fire? Blarg is out for it. This is so sick. He's out for blood. This he wanted so bad. PPS. And Attack he gets another one. 9-3 Nine, three. Blarg on reset on Diao. This would be first this is real insane. victory against the two gods of Tetris in forever. This is huge. This is actually a monumental really... moment in Tetris, but it is not over. Look at this fractal coming through from Diao. It's oh he has to break it up a bit. And he, Diao he covers so over. Oh, and the floating is a Tetris. Oh my god. <laughs> Blarg just oh went nuts. 206. 10 Heard 3. Me. 10 no. 3. This is the Blarg turn point of Blarg. How many, how many points does he have? Oh, he has 7 seven points? If you want to see Diao bring it back, put your 4s in the chat. If you want to see Blarg take it, you know Diao what to do. You got to get that 7 bro. in. This is a rough situation with Blarg. He's got a lot to work with Never. here, though. Mm -hmm. Never give up. Ooh, and that's oh, it! And Blarg's gonna do it! 11-3! Blarg wins Tetro Pub 7! This Blarg is huge! Tetro Pub 7! This is His such a major Tetro day for Blarg. Blarg. That is so insane! You gotta save it's that replay! Tetro Cup I beat him! I got it, I got it. I got worry. it, I got it. We got the replay, but more than that, we got a new champion! We got Blarg winning Tetrio Cup! Seven! Oh my god. I can't believe it. I can't believe this. Blarg's fought so hard. Diao, such a crazy force in Tetris. Finally losing to someone. Okay. Finally putting it all. I can't believe that happened. That I don't I don't even know what this is. I don't even know what to say, folks. Uh, I, don't, I don't dude. There is there are no this. words that can accurately like get i just the... i don't know i don't this know this is a truly great moment in history that's so that's so crazy man that's so crazy i oh my god oh my god that's actually insane i'm so oh, happy for blarg very is well that, done uh, he's in the voice yeah i can just enjoy i don't Actual even need an w. invite i'm that powerful <laughs> I actually, oh, big chief. oh my god yeah. man congrats okay well, if we're doing player interviews, then... Oh, wait, was yeah, I not supposed to join? Pause. Yeah, first of all, pause. No, that was yeah, yeah, yeah. going to no, happen. We're good. We're good. We're good. Stick it's going to happen anyway, First dude. of all, pause. Uh, before we get into an interview, I just want to say thank you to everybody who came out. Um, thank you to all the players. We had a nearly... No, we had 300 signups. Nearly 200 players played. Um, and just a great production. Thank you to all our donators, Judman. Um, shout out to... That's my man's name. He always comes through. Um, QMK yeah. for, for donating. And also shout out to uh, Italics for donating. Thank you so much. Also shout out to all Harvard. Um, I'm probably missing a few other people. Thank you so much for Um, Almost Jed, all the press will go to the place first. Jed with the plastic cutting Wait. out. 
Right. Um, again, thank you so much for your donations, for your support. Um, thank you to all the staff, TL, uh, Dazer, Wrench, Armentier, Oliver, Jimothy, Skyfire, uh, Sinewave. Like, I love all of you. I'd like to thank you so much. Shout out to CL, of course. Uh, did I repeat CL? I'm not sure. Yeah, I, I, yeah. Shout out, shout out to CL for looking up, looking up all the matches. And again, thank you to all of you. There's 500 of you right now watching us. I just want to say thank you. I love you so much. I love Tetris, and there's gonna be more. So, uh, with that in mind, uh, Lark, that's, that's that's the end of my speech. Up? Yeah. And what's, what's up, up bro? About, about time we about time we got some America on the board again. America. God bless America. USA. 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 Number one. USA. Oh no, my North God. America, so I'm included. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, not really. But yeah, let's get Canada <laughs> out of here. Yo, mute wrench, careful. Wait. Um, Who's the yeah. best player in Canada? How do you feel oh. about not only winning the that bracket reset against Diao in such a such a dominant fashion, 11-3, but also your two comebacks against Diao in the first set and in Vince in uh, your losers final set. How do you how do you feel about those? Uh, pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. Um, Keep it humble. I, Keep it humble. I uh, this is definitely the best I've ever played. Um, it's kind of crazy that but like my best set before this was versus Reviclia and that was also a freaking uh, bracket reset. So I guess I just play well during bracket resets. I don't know, man. It, like, I know this is such a, like, stereotypical thing to say, but, like, it really doesn't feel real. I feel like I'm about to wake up. Yeah. Honestly, yeah, man. No, I, no, I can't this say is... I can't say this I is you. most definitely real, man. Most definitely. And you played so well that that comeback... The power... The power of the funny number. Two funny numbers into, <laughs> into Dubskis? You Wait, did what? that, man. Funny numbers? You were, down, like, you were down five nine in both of those sets, and then you you, you won the six nine, six, and, and it's Stomp City. From there. Okay, it's like I don't know it, if you <laughs> I I didn't because I I was like paying attention to the score, but not to that degree. It's like uh, it's, it's hard it's hard to describe like how I felt during those sets because honestly, since I tilt like so easily, I would. Uh, I'd like lose a ton of rounds at the beginning of the set, and then I'd just be like, okay, yeah, I'm kind of like mentally checked out of this already. But then I just like, I guess that kind of made me play better because I didn't have as much nerves and like as much shakiness. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, uh, yeah. <laughs> I, no, I don't know bro. what to say, man. There's like so many like thoughts going through my head right now. It's like, I've, I've, okay, 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 okay. So I had like goals for this year, right? And two of my main goals were to get partner on Twitch and to win a major event. And oh, hey, how about that? <laughs> in my All right, All right. In my Make it already here, right right guys. <laughs> See you, twenty twenty three. It's literally well, January, and I've like already done two of them. What's next? <laughs> More goals? More life? What's nah, next? Man, I don't know. Yeah. I mean. This tournament was definitely like your best showing yet. And honestly, you you've been sidelined from events for what, like the past the past month or the last couple months and oh, wait, what is what does sideline mean? You haven't been able to play. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Might be. But No, I just have a four year old wait. vocabulary. Insane. And oh, they are calling they're calling me to sing in La Tom. I yeah, it's like, it's like, yeah, I've, so I'm trying to think about my history here. Like, I, I missed a Tetrio Cup because I literally just forgot, even though it was, like, something huge that I was, like, looking forward to. Then, it just, a freaking tornado, like, went through where I live, and, like, the entire internet was out for, for the whole day for some, some, some event. And now, I've actually been dealing with, like, pretty bad stomach pain for the past three days uh including today so i'd have to like deal with freaking stomach cramps like the universe is just it's not just on my like side these ailments they're trying to stop a king from getting his cr <laughs> you're too but, good man even still he gets there winning tetra cups 
making history. You know, shout out to Oliver in the chat sharing his uh, pain. Sympathy. Yeah, I, I feel you, dude. It sucks. Like you literally go to sleep one night like, OK, this is going to be it. And then you wake up like one hour before your alarm because you got to like shit your brains out. OK, a little <laughs> little details, <laughs> but, you know, I respect that you're the champ. It's your day. It's all mm. Gucci, man. You're so good. You're so pro. Um, and also, again, big congrats to uh, Diao, who got second, and Vince, who got third. Uh, I mean, they did not make it easy for you at all. They, they did really, not make it easy. They really did not, dude. I don't know what it is with, like, friggin', I don't know what region it's called, but, dude, they gotta work on their internet, their, like, ISPs, <laughs> man. My god. Yeah, I... <laughs> sure. <laughs> I, I don't know what's up with that, man, but like, yeah, it was, I I do feel a little bit bad because of course lag is going to affect like both sides, but man, it's just, uh... like it literally yeah, felt like... like playing old Tetrio, man, where pass through happened like every round, mm -hmm. uh, but I right. guess I pulled through. Folks, I'm being uh, forced into LaTom, so if you guys want to like, I don't know. I wonder if you guys want to replace my, my OBS Ninja, you can. Um, again, Blarg, bro, I, honestly, you're you're my favorite player, man. You play so good, and, and today, it's just like, oh my god, I don't know if he's going to do it. And then you just did it every time. Also, um, you beat Vince in a tournament two times. Yeah, I did once, but twice. I did. Like, I did. like just... Lightning strikes twice, you same bolt type beat, just so insane. You're so you insane, man. You haven't said the line though. That's my, That's my dog. dog. That's my dog. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, I'll, I'll say anything, man. You're the champ. You're the champ, and you made this tournament so crazy. You had crazy stats. You you were just you were just out of out of control today. So, uh, big congrats to you. Uh, we're so proud of you. And we hope to see you in more tournaments uh, this year, right? Yeah, hopefully if like a earthquake doesn't happen and my entire house collapses, then, you know, that, that should right. be a possibility. That's a little dark, but, you know. Category <laughs> 5 hurricane, you know. You'll, you'll be good, man. I, I believe of something great. So, uh, also, uh, you want to do any shout outs, any... Any plugs, anything yeah, where, you want to say to the people? You? Dude, the, the, the yeah. thing about that is, like, there's so many thoughts running through my head and so many, like, people that have helped me that it's just, like, I, I'm a, I'm really afraid of, like, forgetting people and, like, uh, you know, I'm, I'm afraid of people feeling like they're not significant because I don't mention them. So I don't know if that's a good idea, but you, you know who you are, um, whoever... I mean, there's like tons of people that I could say uh, have helped me, but you know, you know who you are, and um, thank you. True. Shout outs, and uh, where, where can okay. we find you, Blark? What? Wait. Oh, oh um, okay. uh, well, okay, these are just putting me on blast because I haven't streamed in like two weeks. Um, maybe this will like reinvigorate my interest in the game because it's been kind of dying recently but like um i don't i don't i don't know um i i might start streaming again eventually um and yeah i have a twitter also literally never post i think hold on let's see let's see when my last post <laughs> on last twitter post was like literally january 4th January. man and it was when oh, i got, got partner, partner. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't tweet, I don't stream, but follow them anyway to um, stroke my ego. Very nice. All right, folks. Maybe you, you maybe you're seeing the spam in the chat, but they do really do want. <laughs> uh, uh, I love you guys uh, again. Congrats, Blair, bro. You're insane. And uh, yeah, man. Uh, thank you to all of you. And I'll just leave Blair to you guys. Uh, yeah. Good shit. Big respect. And, yeah. and yeah, I'll see you guys. Hmm. Or are they spamming All right. the chat? Before, <laughs> before we wrap up the stream uh, for tonight, we do have some events that we want to showcase as we leave January 2022 and move into February as well. Blarg, you're actually playing in one of these, right? You're playing in Yeah, one. Square, or wait, am I not supposed to hey, spoil yeah, it? Say. Let's look at square one, Dazer. Square one, one time. That's crazy. Yep, one time. 
one time for the folks. This is Square One, the Tetris Effect Connected, the largest invitational tournament uh, to date, presented by Puzzle Kingdom and us at Team TSD. Uh, Blog, you're participating. Who else can we see? We'll, we will see Diao. We will see Kabuzel, Promo, Kazu, Uyashoda, and many, many more. Uh, exclamation point square one for a link to the website. There we yep. go. And Moose's. This has really worked so hard to make this like mm -hmm. the sorry sorry if I'm like invading you know <laughs> no, <laughs> overstepping no, no, no. Talk, my talk boundaries here good, but yeah. um like he's worked so hard to make this like the best tournament it can be like I mean mm -hmm. like look at that poster and like how the tournament is had to contact a ton of people to like get him in to make sure that we have the best of the best and so that we're gonna have a great tournament so he's really worked hard for this and um it would mean a lot to him and me as well and you know the entirety of puyo tat world and tmt tsd i guess if uh you would support that because it's a uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be a good tournament and you can Absolutely. count on me when i say this uh, the first group stages are going to be on the 11th of February, and it's going to go through that week and the next weekend. And the final rounds will be the 25th and 26th. Did I did I tweet? Did I link the wrong account? <laughs> Fuck! Someone, yeah, someone, well, someone, get the right account. I I messed it up. Yeah, Anyways, uh, <laughs> some random Japanese guy. What? How did you not? Uh, okay. It's it's puzzle. It's puzzle kingdom with no. It did have an underscore. I, you know what? I'm sorry. I'm a, I'm a VIP. I can spam too. Thank you kindly. Um, oh wait, I put it twice. Okay. Incredible. Uh, make sure you follow the Puzzle Kingdom Twitter account for more updates and more information regarding the event as you get closer to it. Yeah. Yeah. Next up, we have Star Cup. We have it's yeah, something. Star Cup Regenesis, uh, another. Puzzle Kingdom event hosted by our friends there and headed by my good friend Edge TE. This is for all you mid U ranks, all you 23.7s, 23.8s out there looking for a chance to prove yourself. This is the this is exactly what you need. Uh, it's going to be on January 29th. That is seven days from now this Saturday at 7 p.m. EST or 4 p.m. PST, depending where you are. And it'll be streamed on the Puzzle Kingdom Twitch account. You can do exclamation point star cup for a link to the Puzzle Kingdom Discord where you can sign up for that tournament. And I'm so I'm so excited for this. I feel like 24 like players around the 24k skill level get owned because like U rank tournaments are too good, SS rank tournaments are not good enough, you know. Mm -hmm. And this is just like that perfect middle ground for people in that in that space to really show what they have. And this yeah. is this is Edge's old this is Edge's old tournament, and he brought it back, and I'm so proud of him. Let's go. Mm, I don't know much about this tournament, but uh, if Puzzle Kingdom is like somewhat affiliated with it, then I'm sure it's going to be an absolute banger. Yeah, it is. Edge is heading it moose is on it i'm on it actually in, in a in a bit of a way so you know those those first two names definitely gonna gonna make it make it look really really good uh and we have one more announce one more tournament announcement and that is mcdt anniversary two not much to say on this one it will be on february 5th that is two saturdays from now so we got we had tetrio cup today we will have uh, star cup next week and the week over that will be mcdt anniversary to the gestures doubles event hosted by matchmaking central uh i mean modern mino community you know might be might be growing pains you know what i mean and it's gonna be it's gonna be a ton of fun this is one of my favorite tournaments of the year every single year and you know, it's a chance to play with your friends, and it's it's gonna be great. Blark, did you play in this? Last week? Uh, I I played in one. Um, I don't know the. Con oh, I remember. Grand Finals was me in circulation versus uh, Firestorm and Binxt, and Binxt was kind of like 
thrown in there because QMK didn't wake up on time. And um, we were literally all in a VC together with, like while we were playing the grand finals. It was, it was great. It's a fun event. I like it. Mm -hmm. It's super, super fun. And I'm very excited for it. That is February 5th. So put that in your calendars. And I think that's it. That's all we have. That's all the announcements we have here at the end of Tetra Cup 7. It's just me. Jed, dead. Jed's dead. <laughs> and uh, I think now it's time to raid. We'll be sending you to a small little Tetris streamer, Excadrill Tetris. They're looking for some follows. You know, send them some support. Thank you all for coming and supporting Team TSD, supporting Tetrio Cup. Uh, thank you for playing, for donating. Uh, your, sub your subscribes at the start of the stream especially. And, you know, just, I'm really excited. 2022 off to a great start. Thank you all for coming. Woo!